Good morning, jewelry makers from the cat ladies. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Susie, my lovely, how are you? I'm fine. Oh, great to see you again. Great to see you. Great to see you. Yes. Um, Michael's on cameras. Look, there he is. Oh, look, there he. Go on, Michael. Just do it. It's Friday. Come on. Friday. <clears throat> yes. <laughs> uh, we've got <laughs> Michael's on cameras. We've got um, production manager Ollie. He's going to be directing the show today. There he is. Yes. There he is. He's actually. He actually almost looked looked in the camera then. Yeah. <clears throat> Yes. <laughs> We've got producer Neary Nunu. There Yay! he is. Yay! Hello, my lovely. And of course, we've got the one and only Kinger on floor. Yeah. Yay. Yay. Where is she? There she is. Oh, look. Oh, she's just yeah. amazing. We love her. Love her. We love her. But she kept me talking in the loo, so I was late. Your fault, Kinger. Um, today's show. <clears throat> Fantastic. Where do we even start with today's show? Deal of the day, anyone? Yes, please. <laughs> Branca Onyx bangle. Lovely. We have got two bangles. Look at these. Are they beautiful? What do you even what do what can you even say about these, Susie? I want to buy one <laughs> of each. She's going to buy them I both. I am. Let's... I am. Just fair warning. I'll be. I, I shall model them. Shall I model them? Oh, here we go. <laughs> be under no illusion. Susie is going to be buying both of these. Yeah. I, I've worn them. I love the fact that we've got a thicker one and a slightly thinner one as well. Isn't that? Yeah. They're just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. But first thing I thought this morning when I looked at these is that would wouldn't that just be absolutely exquisite to wear on your wedding day? Wouldn't that just be beautiful? It glows. But it also matches perfectly one of the kits at 12 o'clock. Oh, my gosh. Yes. So these tw these tw these 12 o'clock kits are incredible. I'm so excited about these, Susie, because you get these beautiful little mini Marla kits. But oh, don't think you're going to be getting, I don't know, agate or, I don't know, dyed magnesite or something. No. Yeah. You've got Branca Onyx. Yep. <clears throat> that one. The other two Marley kits are Larimar and Tanzanite. Oh my goodness me. They are some of the most incredible Marlers I think we've ever had. This is gorgeous jewelry. It's just beautiful. Favorite of all the ones I've made. Absolutely love them. What, the Tanzanite? Tan no, it's... Tanzanite, all three of them. I can't pick a favourite. Oh, Every time yeah. I made one, I thought, oh, I actually prefer this one. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. They're beautiful. I love the kits. Look at the way they come to you in yeah. a little box as well. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Look at the quality of these beads. Oh, my word. Absolutely amazing. These are super, super, super luxury Marla kits we've got coming up in the 12. Okay. <clears throat> Nine o'clock kits. Yes. So the piece which you're about to see here, quite classic, quite, um, you know, uh, quite classic, quite traditional. The piece on the left, oh yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous connectors. I love the connectors. The piece on the left-hand side, oh, all about asymmetry. It's yeah, beautiful. Yeah, I just decided to do something completely different. Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous, Susie. It's so lovely. It's so current. Yeah. Um, and, and again, it looks, all of your pieces today look super, super high end. Are you going to tell us now that it's easy to make these pieces? Oh, yeah, of course. Here we is. go. Of course they are. She's off. It's yeah. me that's made them. <laughs> <clears throat> well, there we go. Fingers crossed for the demos. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have worn them. <laughs> no, it's wonderful, honestly. I've got my glasses. <laughs> oh, well, at least you've got your glasses. Yeah. Last time you were doing it completely blind, oh, weren't yeah. you? Bless you. Oh, yeah. um, no, it's going to be brilliant. Um, we've got, coming up in this hour, this is your... Um, um, an amazing viewer's choice hour. Uh, we've got, the, look, the first three items there. Who, uh, who wouldn't want these? Earring stud displays. Uh, we've got one for three pairs of earrings and two pairs of earrings. They're absolutely gorgeous. Uh, these are stunning. They're coming up in this hour. I love the way that you set these up. They're oh, so wow. cool, aren't they? Really, aren't they really sweet? Like those. 
They're awesome, aren't they? So they come on this little wooden display and you literally just pop them into this really gorgeous little wooden display. Um, and um, and there you go. That's your little that that's your little stand ready. Wow! How fantastic Very is that? Very high end looking. Um, yeah, really high end, and just uh, just so so kind of bespoke. I love yeah. the fact you know you can make you can make um, this really into your own uh, kind yeah. of design, can't you? They're gorgeous. Yeah. Um, so we've got these coming up. We've also got um, uh, little uh, uh, jewelry pouches. But oh yeah, it, it's all viewers' choice. So basically. Anything that you want to come through and get in this hour, do it now because it's literally going to disappear at um, 9 a.m. So get these items as quickly as you can. Lots and lots of these pieces will be selling out before we even bring them to air. Um, so please just go ahead. Spiny Oyster Turquoise, one of my favourites there. Um, gorgeous Pearl Chain, Olmec. Oh, the travel bead boards. Fantastic. Look Ooh. at that lovely connector. connector. Isn't that beautiful? beautiful. Hematite ring. Oh, nice. Square the one. gauges. Oh, the calipers, sorry. Um, gorgeous. Close out deal on amber. Oh, gosh, that's already sold wow. out. Gee whiz. Yeah, so loads and loads and loads of incredible items, all look available until... 9 a.m. and then it's going to go. Oh, look, amber cutoffs. Oh, I love oh. this. Oh, the vivid oh, green angelites. Oh, my oh. word. Oh, oh. <laughs> the clear oh. oh. We've yeah. got to play those, haven't we? Yeah, we've definitely got to play the Merca bars, the stars. They're so fantastic, aren't they? Oh. Um, right, now, um, there's loads coming up. Loads and loads and loads. Um, we've got um, the Wall of Fame as well. Um, with a few entries today, which is going to be great. Um, but please, just just go ahead and get things because things are selling out already on the website. Let's go to the Wall of Fame and see some of your incredible designs. So let's start off with number 25. It's Joe Green. 25. Yeah, there we go. Lovely Joe Green. Oh, beautiful. Uh, hi, Joe. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. Another seed bead make. This is a choker with seed beads and goldstone. Um, the quality of the goldstone is amazing. Thank you so much. And good luck to everyone. That's from Joe. Thank you, Joe. That's absolutely wow, beautiful. Wow, beautiful. Lovely shake to that. Molly Rogers, your number 26. Um, I bought these turquoise stones recently and have paired them with one orange agate stone, spaces of citrine nuggets and sterling silver. All components are from JM. Wow, I was delighted with the quality of the turquoise. Excellent value. Thanks again for the great variety of products and super demos. Best wishes to all. Thank you so much, Molly. I love that colour combination. Yeah, That's lovely. Beautiful. Kim Hopkins, uh, you're number 27, my lovely. Oh, look. That's a gorgeous mala she's made there. Oh, I love it. Kind of ace, um, kind of... Um, Monochrome as well. Oh, gosh, that would go well with a hinge bangle, wouldn't oh, it, that wouldn't we've got coming it? Yes. up? A long yes. line knotted necklace made with a black and white and green jade with a master carving. This one's just for me. Good luck to everyone. Wow, what deals we've had this week. Stay safe, everyone. That's from Kim. That's beautiful. Thank you so much for that, Kim. And do you know what? We've got this gorgeous hinged bangle coming up today. Um, sorry, uh, uh, Niri, this is coming up in the 11, isn't it? Oh, is it the nine? nine. Oh, blimey. Okay. Like yeah, that. sorry. This hinged bangle coming up, which is absolutely exquisite. Can't wait to bring you this. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Beautiful. Alan Hopkins, your number 28, my lovely. Please find attachment entries to this week's Wall of Fame. It's a long line necklace with mookite. Oh. <laughs> I love that, Alan. It's my first time knotting with Kim's help. Good luck to everyone entering. Great demos this week. Stay safe. Love Alan, it. that is absolutely gorgeous. That's so nice. And Kim's helped him do the knotting as well, which I think oh, is really bless. sweet. Well done. Thank you so much, Alan. Who's yours from, um, right. Susie? At 29, we have Jane Galloway. And she says, hi, please find my wall of fame, uh, my entry to the wall of fame. It's a necklace made with imperial topaz, London blue topaz and findings from my stash. Love watching the show. Good luck to everyone in the draw. Thank you. That is beautiful. Thanks, Jane. That's lovely. And number 30, our final one is Tracy <coughs> Carter. And she says, hi, oh, everyone. Look at that malachite. Wow. My entry is a clover malachite and argentium set. Fusing the argentium turned out OK, but I haven't always had much luck with fusing in the past. I was really pleased with the clover shapes I made and a bale on the pendant. It's three jump rings fused together. I added malachite, four male rounds in the necklace so that the chain would sit right. 
I've used my Dremel for the first time to clean and polish the Argentium. Hope you like it. <coughs> Beautiful. That's, That's really lovely. lovely, Tracy. Thank you so much for that. Um, we've got loads of items available on our website. Please, please, please just go and have a look at all of them. Um, items are already selling out on the website, just to let you know. So please just, just add as much to your order as you can, because it's all going to disappear at um, yeah. nine o'clock. There we go. Uh, right. The clear quartz what, sorry? Oh, the trillions. Oh, oh they're these. lovely as well. Or do you, do you mean these ones? Yes, they're the trillions. These are they absolutely beautiful? gorgeous. Um, before we did the showcase for this incredible gemstone, uh, which was a couple of weeks ago, I contacted um, some of our guest designers. Um, Susie was literally replying before I'd even <laughs> finished writing the message about clear quartz. And one of the things you were saying, Susie, was just... If you're going to have any gemstone in your collection, you know, yeah. any if you're going to build a collection of gemstones, you've got to start off with a gem you've like this. You've got to have clear quartz in your collection. It's just a must have. Just no questions asked. It's such a lovely gemstone, apart from it looking beautiful. It's a wonderful gemstone because it amplifies energy. It mm. clears the energy and it just is a really feel good gemstone to have. I absolutely love it. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's, it look, it's 19 99 I would be using those as separate little pieces, as beautiful yeah. little charms. The faceting on this material is absolutely beautiful and the quality is amazing. One chance remaining. Well done. <laughs> Oh, we've got the plain rounds now. These are gorgeous. We've got to do the the, the massive ones yeah. as well, uh, Neri. The Merker bars. Um, look at the beautiful oh, yeah. bubbles. Oh, and it, and it it's it it it's interesting, isn't it? We talk about kind of this gemstone amplifying energies, positive energies, but also it does quite literally magnify things as well. You Absolutely. know, if you put a page of writing behind it, it does. It magnifies it. It's yeah. it's it's incredible. And to me, this is, a, again, a must-have gem. And in that size, I'd get six and eight if I, if I could because I use them in my shackle jewellery. And I always have Lovely. that as the crown. So even if I use another gemstone in the crown, I always add that because that just finishes it off and just sends all the lovely energy through. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. You've got to get these in different sizes. Is amazing. I don't know whether we've got any different sizes in these, but, uh, you know, put this with any colours, any different threading materials. It's yeah. going to take on all of that quality. It's just gorgeous. Can we do the Merca bars, Neri? Yes. Oh. Oh. Susie very, very kindly gave me one of these this morning. Um, yeah, I bought this strand. Absolutely it is lovely. absolutely it, it's so beautiful, isn't it? Thirty nine ninety nine. I can't believe that price. The quality, the attention to detail, detail. is amazing. And here. the faceting is absolutely amazing. So what is a Merkaba, Susie? A Merkaba is a Hebrew uh, symbol and it's really for very strong protection. Ooh. So it's really highly protective. Um, and it being clear quartz, it just radiates oh. all of that protection. Great for setting intentions as well. If you want to sort of set intentions like, you know, this month I just want to be healthy or I'll you know, I'm going to go on the London Marathon in wherever it is. And I'm really going to Oh, Steve Bennett could do with one yeah, of those. He's going to put that the on your desk May. and let it do its thing. So it's a wonderful thing to have. And yeah. And yeah, I gave you one. Funny enough, we gave you one this morning. I thought you've got to have one. Isn't that lovely? It, 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 it's such, things happen sometimes, sometimes don't yeah. they? Um, and I have to say, I, I, anybody watching today, you've got to be affected by that. How can you not be affected by the shape, yeah, by the quality, beautiful. by the cut, by the sheer beauty? Uh, morning, JM. Uh, what is nicer than clear quartz? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Margot. You're so right. And what we're a great way about, to start your day. We're talking about malas later on, but this is fantastic. You don't always have to have a tassel, so this could be at the end, and I think that would be a lovely mala to have. So I plan to put one on a mala myself, and I'm going to put clear quartz as the marker beads. Well, if you're, if you're, if you're going to use your mala, say, for meditating or just taking five minutes, and yeah. you're going to be feeding those gems through your hand, yeah. I can't think of a better gem to have at the bottom than Absolutely. a gem with that intention. Exactly. To sort of wonderful. send all of that lovely energy out. Absolutely. Oh, how wonderful. Beautiful. Well done. Uh, there's loads of people coming through. How many do we have, Neri? <clears throat> Four chances wow. left. Look, well done. Uh, Jennifer, Susan, Denise, June, Susan, Kim, uh, all with that in their baskets. Um, just incredible. Uh, really good. Well done, everybody who's coming through. Denise is just checking out. Maker, you want two. That's just gorgeous. I just... That is a, 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 an absolute 
masterpiece of lapidary, isn't it? You, you I look at that and go, I, I, don't, I wouldn't even know where to start. Yeah. Well, they, to me, this is what I would just have about my person. So I'd put it in a purse or a handbag so that wherever I went, I just had it about my person. So if I'm in the car or anywhere, I've just got it. So it's lovely in jewellery, but it's one of those lovely strands that you can just give to a member of the family and just say, just keep it upon your, about your person. I love that. I love that. You know, things it's like a, that can really kind yeah. of um, have a positive effect yeah. on people, can't it's it? It's just a must-have strand. As soon as I saw that when you aired it, I thought, oh, I've got to have that. It was such a lovely, it was yeah. such a lovely showcase and myself and Claire yeah. were just enamoured with all of them and just struck by the quality that we had. Uh, Teresa, well done to you, Maker in Hertfordshire. Maker's got three. That's great to see. Well, well done. done. Taking those details away. Well done. Um, still one left. Oh, gosh. I was not expecting this to be this size. No. The, the bottle. It's huge. I thought it was going to be, be like, like that. Like something you wear as a necklace. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's a whopper that is a whopper a whopper chica that is wow. all oh king it you are you are tempting me this morning she's only gone and got me a board as, as if to say take the lid off tip it out uh, so you know what I'm, I'm gonna this is all amber amber offcuts yeah Oh my wow. gosh. Wow. Isn't that lovely? Oh my word. Look at all of this. Oh my. Ten chances left. That's all amber. These are the kind of pieces you might see, you might find, I should mm. say, on the beach. Um, like uh, um, uh, in the sand. Tiny little pieces. It, it is, it's exactly like sea glass. This is absolutely beautiful stuff. That there. That's 40 to 100 million years wow. in age. Great in resin, if you're doing resin makes, beautiful. What Set a great resin. idea. Set it in resin, yeah. What a great idea. Uh, who's this message from, Susie? Can you, can you yes, see? Yes, it's sent by Angela in Hampshire. She says, good morning. <laughs> Hello, Angela. <laughs> <That's all> I... <laughs> <laughs> I got my bees tray yesterday and was very impressed with the quality and weight. If you look in the tray, it will not fly across the desk. If you knock the tray. Ah, yes, well done, good. lovey. Well done. You yeah, that's yeah, that's great, Angela. Thank you so much for that. Yeah. It's um, it's 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 good to know kind of how how useful you find our tools and kind of accessories yeah. and they're the kind of things, aren't they, that you get and then you wonder how you ever manage without them. Yeah, they're, they're absolutely brill, aren't they? Well done. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Don't mind me. I'm just putting the amber yeah, back I was in just the bottle. To find you a Don't worry. To I've got it. it. I've got it. Okay, now. Susie, I don't yes. know. Oh. oh, I've never seen this now. Oh, Tell me what you think of this I because love I... I love that Angela, um, Angel like anyway. I saw Angela was the message before. <laughs> Named after you, my darling. Named after you. Um, I love Angela. As you know, I'm into my healing gemstones and Angel like is a lovely nurturing gemstone and it's, it gives you that lovely, somebody's given you a nice warm hug. Um, and with the Green Angel, it's really good for healing sort of wounds and any hurt that you've got. So oh, it's a really wow. gentle healing stone to say Fabulous. everything's going to be all right and it'll just make you feel much better. And think, yes. So I absolutely love it. And the colour, oh my word. Isn't it? So it's striking. It's jade like, isn't, isn't it? Very jade like. It it's reminds very... me a little bit of Chrysoprase. Yeah. Well. It's got that wonderful intensity of green. Um, Two chances left. Um, oh, wow. This one's, this one's beautiful. This is, uh, yeah, there's, uh, these are your 12 mils. Two chances available. Mariska and Maker, oh, you wow. can take that if you want to. Um, well done, everyone. Uh, oh, gosh, loads of things sold out. Lovely. Oh, those black spinels have sold out. There's no point playing those. Wow. Um, I love black spinel, as you know. Oh, we've had some beautiful black spinel over, um, over the last week. Oh, the six mils have sold out. Oh, gosh. The amber sold out. Oh, wow, look at that labradorite. That's lovely. Yeah. Beautiful pearls. Honestly, oh, yeah, the honey amber. Uh, yeah, lovely. Oh, the hematite like rings beautiful. are gorgeous. Oh, gosh, they come in different sizes. Wow. Oh, that's fantastic. The topaz oh, connector. Ah, yeah. Yes. Here we go. Let's get oh, that on there. Oh, um, So the six. So, look, you've got to check out. I've got Linda, Maker and Net for that. Oh, no, we've got one left of the vivid green in the 12 Yeah, mil. they're beautiful. They're stunning, aren't they? Um, we'll do the 10 mils in a minute, but before we do that, let me just show you very quickly this gorgeous connector, um, which someone's requested. 
Oh, this would be lovely with sort of like your little sort of seed pearls. Ow. Make a oh, it's a connector. Choker. Yeah, so it's yeah. like clasp. Good. Yeah. Okay, so I understand that now. Right, so beautiful sky blue topaz in the centre of that. That has been expertly cut. Yeah. Beautiful. There's no windowing to that whatsoever. That is yeah. a really beautifully faceted gemstone. That's absolutely gorgeous. Um, you've got these three loops on either side. So if you wanted to make a triple or maybe even a, well, a six strand yeah, necklace you could. or bracelet Absolutely. maybe. If you're using micro gemstones, you could put two or three per strand. Well, because I'm thinking that they're, they're soldered rings. So yeah. it's not like they're going to be under a huge, it's not yeah. like they're going to kind of undo, Do, is it? No. Um, that's all sterling silver, by the way. Um, 24 99 not your deal. Sue in Edinburgh, you're already through for this. Great to see. Beautiful oh. quality. We're going to go even lower because we can. Uh, Tahima, well done to you. Victoria Muriel, really classic look this. Um, actually, with some of your nine o'clock pearls, they'd look beautiful, beautiful, wouldn't they? I just think they'd go with lovely little yes. micro gemstones. And do you remember a couple of weeks ago, I did multi-stranded nice. bracelets and multi-stranded, that'd be a lovely yeah. multi-stranded bracelet. Yeah, well. absolutely. Yeah, to kind of almost have this as a watch face kind of feature yeah, exactly. in the middle. That'd be yeah. really lovely, wouldn't it? £19.99. pence. Mariska, well on to you. Victoria, Muriel, you could get this. There's two of you. Um, sorry, you've got two in your basket. Um, well done, everyone. We had some sterling silver star pegs. They've sold out, just to oh, let you know. Oh, they're so good. I've got those. They're lovely. Are you going to use them with pearls? Yes, yeah, I just peg them into pearls. I've made a ring that is sort of like um, an evil eye ring, and I've used that, and I've put it in, so it's like the eye of the eye. <laughs> The eye of the eye. That sounds lovely. But Beverly, lovely. well done to you as well. Gorgeous. Okay, let's um, do the 10 mil Vivid Angel like that's, that must be these. Yeah. Beautiful. Absolutely amazing colour. Um, when we bought this to wear, it was an abs it absolutely stormed onto your screens. You loved it. We absolutely adored it as well. The quality is amazing. Um, Twenty-four ninety-nine. Amazing. Um, really beautiful colour. I love the fact that we bought you different sh um, uh, sizes of this because, of course, if you wanted to make that graduated necklace, I think we gave it to Alison, uh, guest designer Alison. Oh, she made a lovely necklace. The in-house designers made a lovely kind of graduated spiky necklace, and Alison did a full on. She did a full on, on choker. That was it. Edwardian with, the, with the kind of the swags. Beautiful. That was lovely. That was beautiful. Yeah, that's exactly what she made. Um, Think about Marla kits coming up. Oh, the for Branca sure. onyx. Swap it out with the with the, the black onyx. But imagine knotting that with red. Oh cord. yeah. That beautiful. would just be the ultimate colour combination, wouldn't it? <clears throat> okay, which one are we doing now, lovely? Eight mil. These look bigger than eight mil, I reckon. I but think they are eight mil. Yeah. Do you think they are? Yeah. Susan's already through. Maker's already through. That's great to see. Well done. Something about this colour. Um, you know, with your chrysoprase, it's much more of a jelly kind of translucent okay. tone that you get. This is a, a more opaque. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Do you know what? That's a lovely that idea. That's a good idea. No, with tan it's got a similar saturation. Mm, beautiful. Look that at is that. Yes. Look. Oh, my good wow. grief. That just pops Good grief. It? This is why you have to buy these gemstones. You don't. You may not think what you're going to do with them, but you've got them. An angel. I well, think this is sold out. But has this one sold out, Neri? There's two left of this one. No, 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 no. I'm talking about the six mil. Yeah, six mil sold out. Oh, oh. No, sorry. There's no point showing that. There we go. Wow. So you could use a twelve mil as a guru bead, maybe. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that is. Do you see how the colours are similar? Obviously, one's green, one's blue but they've got a similar kind of saturation. saturation. You know, something can be kind of 20% saturation or if it's like a, a blue, very dark blue sapphire, it'll have like 80 to 90% saturation. Yeah. This is the same saturation of this, whatever this is, 70%, let's say. Um, that's amazing. Ladies, had a truly awful work day yesterday. Oh, had me in tears, woke up apprehensive. You've given this more... You can, oh, oh you can hope this morning. You. I'm off to find clear. Oh, Alison, bless you, darling. You shouldn't feel like that. That's not. That's yeah. not nice, darling. If you've got any um, tiger's eye as well, oh. get some <clears> tiger's <throat> eye, or even um, just um, a nice grounding. Yes, mukite nice maybe. Or... Mukite's a lovely stone. Yeah. Carnelian, mukite, darling. 
Oh, bless you. Send in your hug. Send in your hug. Good. That's a good. That's a good. That sounds like the kind of thing my mum would say, Neary. Get through Friday because you've, you will have forgotten about it by Monday. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I hope so. Oh, darn it. But if you've got to go into work, put some tiger's eye on. You're strong. Just strong like a lion. <laughs> <laughs> right, OK. Um, these have sold out. I don't know why I keep showing you these, because I feel like I'm going... <laughs> uh, no, but they've sold out. Anyway, right, where are we going now? Oh, we've got the other angel in. Oh, come on. Oh, I've got this. Beautiful. This Have a, a little look at this. What? What is this? A you, pendant? Is this a is. ring? Is it's this an Ouroboros, which is either a, a dragon or a serpent eating its tail, which is all about birth, <coughs> death, rebirth. So it's about infinity. Life goes on the ever-lasting cycle of life. It's the circle of yeah. life. Starbite. Through all. The world. Yeah, we were saying it's going to be a little bit too big for a ring. It's not going to be comfortable because it's no. going to f make your fingers kind of... It's, it's kind of, Yeah, uh, which isn't good. But that as a pendant. Beautiful. Just put it on a piece of cord. Wonderful. Wonderful. Look at this. Um, yes. Jill in Greater Manchester just ordered the 8 mil Vivid Green Angel Light needed cheering up. My car was stolen this... Oh, what is going no. on? What is going on? <clears throat> yeah. Do you know what? I think we've got the animal print on today. I think we could become vigilantes. Yeah, strong. We literally... I'm going to send you out lots of positive energy. Oh, we're sending you out. Oh, oh dear. Jill, you poor little poppet. Oh, yeah. That is just not good. Cheer yourself up, darling. Just stick with us. Yeah. Stick with us. Be inspired. Have a giggle. Yes. Um, I've got an amazing joke, guys. Um, no, actually, no. I'm not going to tell it now. I'm not going to tell it now. Is it not funny? No, because I don't want to. I don't want to sell it as a joke. I don't want to sell it as a joke. Anyway, right, okay. So just forget I said that. I said it yesterday. So so just, just oh. try to forget yesterday's show. Everybody will be. Anyway. Gosh, I'm through. really not good at kind of. Is this the right one? This is the right one. Yes. Um, beautiful. So you've got this kind of eternal, this eternal life kind of quality. Yeah, haven't it's got you? like a serpent or a snake. It depends on what culture it is, but it'll either be a serpent eating its own or tail a dragon. or a dragon eating its own how tail. How wonderful. But you pick Circle of Life. How gorgeous. Is it good, yeah. It's wonderful. And I think it also kind of whatever stage you're at in life, just yeah. you've just got to kind of, it, it's all part of the journey, Exactly. Isn't it? And it gives you a better understanding of where we are within the sort of the whole of the universe and oh. everything has a meaning and, you know, and our place in it as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. 199 is not your deal today. Don't overthink this. Lark's head not where exactly. it's dependent. Exactly. That's it. That's all you do. That, on that's cord. it. You don't. You don't. Oh, a silk scarf. God, oh, lovely. Now, Ollie, you're that always is designing. Lovely. I Beautiful. like that idea. Beautiful. That's lovely. Or if you wanted to create it into, make it into something, you could have it as a, have it as the O for a um, polo. No, <laughs> no, Susie. <laughs> Have it as an O on like a lariat style with a really big oversized toggle that you'd make out of wire. <laughs> you are not being very helpful. <laughs> she didn't even, she wasn't even listening to me. So you know like a lovely lariat design with a T-bar? Yeah, this is the yeah. O. Put your toggle through there. I don't, I don't know why I bother. <laughs> I don't know why I bother. Maker's got two in their basket. She's got chocolate, that's why. <laughs> I that's think why she's it misbehaving is. already. <laughs> I think it is, seriously. I've had a load of white chocolate. She's like a naughty child. Yeah. She's like a naughty child. You know how kids get that Friday afternoon feel? Yeah. That's Susie at yeah. 29 minutes past eight yeah. in the morning. <laughs> All message. OK, what does Sue have to say in Edinburgh? Blue Leopard and the Cheetah bring justice and great prices for all. Yes, yes I love yes. that. Yes, yes. Blue leopard, you know, like crouching tiger, hidden dragon, and people have got these names and things yeah. like that. Your blue leopard. leopard. I'm the cheetah. cheetah. <laughs> blue leopard. Well, this top was from Sainsbury's. The Sainsbury's cheetah. <laughs> no, that's just not. It's just rubbish, isn't it? <laughs> Supermarket cheetah. No, no. Awful. 
dreadful. Anyway, but we could be vigilantes. Yeah. I want to wear a cape or something, maybe. I don't know. Oh, anyway. Right. But I do like the idea of that. That's £129, yeah. by the Fantastic way. Amazing. Have, by the way. Gorgeous. Get it. Add it to your order. Well done. Um, right. What are we doing now, lovely? Oh, what the big one? Oh, a great, fantastic. We've got 9 a.m. kits coming up. You could add this to your kit. So the beautiful necklaces that you have made for the nine o'clock kits, particularly this asymmetric one. Yeah, add Sorry, that. lovely. The other one, Michael. There we go. Uh, the asymmetric one. The pearl you've used at the bottom is beautiful. It's a lovely kind of coin pearl, oh, isn't it? Yeah. But this is. This would be perfect. <gasps> this would actually look better. Oh, I don't know. I, I like what you've done there, but I think that they would both yeah. suit this design. Um, and it's in pearls like this are embarrassing, embar embarrassingly easy to set, aren't they? They are. It's just a little peg bale with a bit of glue. No skill required. If you know how to open a cap, that's it. What tips would you have when you're gluing a pin into a pearl? Do you right. apply the glue to the pin or the pearl? And how much do you use? What glue do you use? It sounds daft, but make sure that the peg is the right size because sometimes you get the pegs and they're a bit long, so they're you snip it to size. Yeah. So put it in and just snip very gently till you've got it flush. Mm. And then I would just sand the peg a bit, just with a bit of like a nail file, just to give it a key, and then glue both. I glue with hyper cement glue, which I think I've got here to show you. This, this is perfect, which is perfect because it has awesome. a very thing. I won't take it off because I'll never get it back on again, but it's got a really needle type point and then it just comes out like a little drop really gently. And then you just poke it in the hole. Yeah, gorgeous. Squeeze it, fill it up with glue and then put some on the peg and then put it in, wipe off any excess and then just leave it for 24 hours. And that there, it you know, you, if you, if you, if you, let's say you did that and it's going to take you what, five, 10 minutes to do yeah. it. Leave it for 24 hours. It's 19.99. How much are you going to be able to sell that on for? Yeah. I mean, that's, that's what you've got to think. Is it going to be under 50 pounds or is it going to be closer to 100 pounds? It's amazing. It's amazing, isn't it? Well done, everyone. Price. Amazing. We've got so much to bring you. I, I want to show you these gorgeous earring stands that we've got coming up in this Ooh, hour. I yeah. love the fact that they're wooden. I, I just think it's lovely. Yeah. And I love this dark green. Yeah. It's a really lovely... Very high-end looking, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, you can just take these out if you if you want to. Um, and then they're easy just to put in. They're just kind of almost tension set. Yeah. Almost. You just pop that in there. It looks great. Um, just a really nice little stand to be able to kind of position. We've also got this, which I think we could have done with this before Mother's Day, I think. But, but anyway, um, gorgeous little um, purse, which is PU leather open it up and it's got this lovely kind of suede mm. interior with these with these little um uh poppers here so you can put your earrings on here these you've got little holes punched in there to put your earrings in okay. bracelets other you've got another little kind of clear little pocket here chains to put in, things yeah. in chains yeah you can put your chains in there and then great for i don't know um, uh, you can put you can put a um, uh, change in there, bracelets, Pendants. whatever you want, bracelets, yeah. Um, but I think that these would be wonder. These would have been wonderful for Mother's Day, wouldn't they? But yeah. um, but you know, it's great to have them today. But lovely little gift. The price on that is amazing, by the way. Okay, right. Let's go now to. Say again. Yeah. No. Mm. <laughs> I don't think it is, Ollie. I think it's, I think it is these ones, but I think the recording may be incorrect. Do you remember these ones? It is the ball link chains. Oh no, it is this one. No, it is this one. The extender chains. It's these ones. It, yeah, sorry, lovey. It, it's these extender chains. Now, these are so, 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 so useful. When you're making, um, and, and, and I, think, I think for this time of year, and particularly this year, May, we've got three bank holidays. We've got May Day, the beginning of May, May the 1st. We've got May the 8th, uh, which is, um, no, we're not working on May the 8th. No, we're not. Uh, May the, no, I, don't, I don't think we are. Um, sorry, as in jewellery maker is, I'm talking about this shift side. Sorry, I'm, I'm listening to Neary. Um, and then you've got the one at the end. Um, the... 
brilliant thing about these is if you're going to be make if you're going to be doing little make and takes along with a coffee morning Ooh. or along with a kind of a cake sale at your local village hall. If you're going to be making pieces, which you're going to be selling for pocket money prices and you're going to aim it at kids or people who just want to want something, you know, fun to wear, a, a little memento. And you're going to be selling pieces for, you know, under 10 pounds. These are going to make the difference, aren't they? They certainly are. And a nice idea as well. Uh, there is a shop that do sort of... Uh, link your bracelet if you've got a partner and you go in and you both buy a, a like a chain bracelet and they link it but you could have parties where oh, you just make a little bracelet and just put a little charm on it yeah and then just put a little jump ring on it doesn't have to be you know closed but then it fits them precisely and you're not wasting anything you see that's that's the great thing making pieces which are completely personalized and yeah. bespoke yeah and will fit that person it's wonderful, isn't it? Um, it's six ninety nine. You're getting three meters of uh, your precious metal plated base metal chain. It's absolutely brilliant. These are the kind of things which you always want to have when you're making those pieces, uh, when you're selling those pieces, and someone tries something on and goes, "Oh, do you know? I just need it just a few yeah. inches longer." Don't worry, I've got something for that. I've got my extender chain. Absolutely. Uh, this is precious metal plated base metal, but I can get you a precious metal one in and send it to you in the post, yeah. or you know, whatever. You know. Having things like this is always a great thing. And for $6.99, amazing. Um, Mandy, hello, gorgeous ladies and fabulous crew. Susie, uh, what gemstones can help help with swelling, please? I want to right, make yeah. um, some things to help a friend. Right, now, swelling comes from the throat chakra, and it, the throat chakra's sh chakra is connected to the lymph nodes, which controls sort of uh, all your lymph glands. So that could... Uh, be where you get the swelling from, like with swelling, water retention, etc. So I would say anything to do with the throat chakra. Lapis lazuli, I think, is a fantastic stone to use. No. Um, now, hematite's a really good stone for grounding. Wouldn't necessarily get rid of any swelling, but it's a lovely grounding stone and it's got sort of iron in it. But I would say what you're looking for there is anything that's connected to the throat chakra so we've got lots of hematite coming yeah. in tomorrow so that's going to be really um really really useful that's yeah. going to be great um we've had a lovely message from angela bless her and she's asking for a bit of assistance and i can't show her message because it's got a customer number on but she's saying she recently lost her husband i think it was only about seven weeks ago darling so sending oh, you all you. the love in the world mm. and she's feeling a bit lost and she's wondering if there may be a gemstone which might help to kind of give her a bit of strength give her a bit of kind of a bit of yes a, 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 a bit there of is. a bit of support what there what, is what there's, would you suggest? there's quite a lot now this would relate to the i always try and explain the chakra as well so this is the heart chakra but it also relates to the uh, sacral chakra and the root chakra. So I would always say um, uh, rhodochrosite is a lovely oh, healing wow, gemstone. Lepidolite helps with grief. Um, and I would always say something like um, obsidian or tourmaline as protection so that you don't get any... Because when you're low... Um, you're susceptible to lots of other negative energy. So what you want to do is sort of put a barrier up. So first thing, black tourmaline or black obsidian protects you. Wonderful. And then to heal, that would be your rhodochrosite, beautiful lipidolite and um, beautiful stones. And carnelian is lovely because it's nurturing, but it will just lift you out of that mood. And mookite. Awesome. That, oh, thank you so yeah. much, Susie. That's really... Angela, best of luck. Do keep in yeah. touch with us. Let us know how you're getting on, Libby. Um, right, OK. Um, where should we go now, lovely? Oh, it, oh! I've never seen these. Which one? Yes. Is, is it black yeah. or white? Yeah. Is it black or white? Or is it both of them? No, it's one each. Right. The white. I've seen these, yeah. What, I, what, do, I, what do I do with these? Right, these... Oh, we're doing, sorry, we're doing the black Oh, right, first. sorry. Right. Right, Levy, don't they worry. Do both, right, these are actually professional uh, trays for sorting out gemstones. So you see here, we've got, oh. like, little sizes for gemstones. If you've got pearls, yes, why don't I? What clever idea, Olive. <laughs> That's why <laughs> you are so important in the show. Here we go. So here you can see little lines here. And you can see some with circles. These are 
Bust. There we go. Let's move it there. That's right. So you put your little gemstones here, and this is helping with sizing. So great if you're making uh, a necklace and you want to graduate it, put them here. If you're doing a mala, that's great because you can sort out what you want there. Then here, because say if I was in a pearl factory, what they would do is they'd come along with a whole load of pearls. Great if you've got, like, you love sorting. Put everything in there, and then what you do is sort it either with colour or size or shape, and then you pick them out, and then you put them here. So that's where you put those. And then these are for the sizes, the various sizes. And then when you've finished, or you've done, say, you've decided, right, I'm happy with that row, I, I want to get... You, you push it into the middle, and then you can just... Tip it out so everything gets tipped out easily. These are great with di diamond dealers use them and pearl um, users so use them a lot. Michael is suggesting using these with the marla oh, kits. Oh, absolutely, that we've got. absolutely per perfect. I think purple. as well. If you're absolutely purple, I think if you're if you're um, if you're if you're if you're wanting to colour match or colour sort. Um, certain coloured gemstones you know you've got your darker background we've got the lighter yeah. one as well so if you're going to be doing it I mean I've seen people sorting a koi of pearls yes exactly that's fascinating that's is it, it when they're kind of doing this that's it um, and they're looking at different sizes and they're putting trying to make pairs of gemstones that's together. exactly it's right a really useful little tool very, isn't it very useful this you know but you can use it for all sorts great for seed beading you know if you're sorting your seed beads yeah. all, they've all got mixed up then you can have a lovely afternoon sorting them out with this and as you say, a nice little kind of funnel here to kind yeah. of tip it back it's, into the it's, yeah, exactly uh, back into the bag or, or the little tube. Really heavy weight. And yeah, really. It's almost like bakelite. That's exactly what I was about to say. Yeah. It's like a bakelite. It's like a bakelite finish. Yeah. Really sturdy. Um, going anywhere. So the black one, uh, four ninety nine. We're going to do the white one now as well, um, which I hope is going to be the same price point as well. Um, Really, really useful tool to have. And what's nice about this, um, it's not too big, is it? No. It, it, it's kind of, um, it's kind of, you know, um, uh, count. It's, um, you know, if you don't have your own studio, your own kind of workspace, but you're kind of gem sorting or doing whatever it is at the kitchen table or kind of in the corner of, you know, a room, whatever. Then, you know, this is great because it's not going to take up too much space. Um, Four ninety nine as well, which is absolutely brilliant. Lots and lots of people coming through. I think there's a benefit for both of these, depending on what what colour it is you're sorting yeah. and looking at. Um, I know that diamond, I mean, this isn't perfectly white, is it? But I know that diamond graders use those kind of pure white backgrounds to kind of get that colourlessness yeah. across, don't they? Um, but I think for things like your pearls, especially if you're um, looking to make pairs or looking for ones with exactly the same kind of colour and orient, yeah. these are going to be really, really useful. Yeah. So they're 4 99 each. Uh, just add them onto your order. Well done. Gorgeous. Awesome. Um, right. What should we do now, lovely? I've got some more clear quartz. I've got some other green angelite. I've got... Yes. And okay. we can compare how these look to Larimar because they're very Larimar-esque. Well, it's almost the same as what we were looking at with the tanzanite and the... Tanzanite and the vivid green. As in the tanzanite and the vivid green angelite are the same kind of saturation aren't they yeah that's better isn't it and you'll see here the larimar if you love yeah and the lighter green angelite oh my yeah. gosh is almost exactly the same what's so wonderful as well is that in some larimar you do get moments of kind of really incredible clarity yeah, yeah. and you're getting the same with these aren't you susie yeah. it, it has that if you love larimar you're going to love the angel. I love angel because it's a beautiful, beautiful gemstone. And it really does. And both of them, Larimar and Angel, are really soothing yeah. um, gemstones. So they're wonderful. But they have that same quality and texture yeah. and look. Yeah. 12 99 That's pretty much sold out. We've got the slightly smaller strand as well, which are four mils. These are just going to disappear. Oh, all right. Well there done. There you go. See? Angela matches her gems all the yeah. time. That's why she's got the white tray. Yes. I love that. Um, I think this would be a lovely colour maybe for bridesmaids or, or kind of an alternative yeah. to, a, uh, you know, a white or a, an ivory wedding dress to wear kind of this lovely kind of bright, light pastel peppermint green, I think would be a beautiful colour mm. for a... Um, uh, for a bride to wear. Uh, Victoria, Miriam, Maker, Maker in Perth and Kim Ross, Maker in the Highlands, Pauline, Maker in Hampshire, Valerie. 
Well done to you, Victoria. Brilliant. 9.99. Well wow. done to you. Fantastic. Absolutely. Did that really happen, um, Ollie? Oh, gosh, that's a bit. So at weddings, the only person who's meant to wear white or kind of cream is the is the is the bride. No one else is meant to wear it. And um, someone did. I think someone who came to Ollie's Ollie's um, wedding wore a pure white suit. That's suggesting me it should have been me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's absolutely. It should have been me. It's like that scene out of Love Actually, isn't it? Yeah. I was filming her. Oh, Kieran. Kieran Knightley. And um, yeah. Victoria's got two of these. Well done. Oh, Mariska, Valerie, well done to you. It should have been me. Um, does anybody know, by law, any reason why these two people should not be joined together? Please declare it now. It should, should be been me. me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. We were just having a laugh at your expense there, Rolly. I don't think he, was, no, he noticed that at all. Anyway. Never mind, that's fine. Uh, right, early birds. <laughs> uh, he, he just doesn't care. Early bird special. Uh, let's go. I think anything you can do when you're selling your jewellery when you're kind of at a craft fair or whatever it might be to make yourself look more professional, more organised, more um, appealing. Um, I think the more you can do that, the better. Absolutely. These are perfect with pearls. You know, we say, I always say, if you get a strand of pearls, just set to a side, um, you know, that sort of jewellery maker you know you as a jewelry maker your perk but you can sell those earrings and i always say i start 40 pounds for a pair of stud earrings great price now you, some of you might think no but make those stud earrings put them in here then you'll justify it and look absolutely beautiful they really will and against this dark it's not really beautiful. coming across on screen this dark yeah. green like a um, forest sherwood green isn't it? it'll look absolutely beautiful um when um you are Photographing your jewellery. So a lot of people, you know, you might not sell your things at craft fairs or, or events or in boutiques, but you might sell pieces online. Lots of people have got their own Etsy stores. Lots of people have got their own um, have got their own kind of outlets that way. Mm. Um, when you're photographing your jewellery, and we really do want to get photographer Sam back on. Um, uh, back oh, he's on, so good. Um, uh, JM, he was he was absolutely brilliant, and the advice he gave, which is just second nature to him, like, oh no, do this. Oh no, yeah. do this, do this was just so invaluable and it really allows you to take such good photographs and to market yourself. Um, yeah, I think, I think since actually he was on the show, uh, uh, the Wall of Fame, everybody has, you know, it's really upped its game. It, yeah. um, Alison sent in some beautiful photographs of her, of her dragon carving jewellery um, oh, yesterday. She took a really, really lovely photograph and it was just using our photography props. It was just really, really lovely. Um, and I think it is important when you're when you're either marketing yourself or selling your jewellery that you it, you show that you've taken a bit of time and a bit of care and consideration in how you're going to present your stuff, how you're going to present your beautiful jewellery that, that that will have taken you weeks and weeks and weeks to prepare. Not to mention which these are really, really cool because these come out. I believe it's going to be like a almost like a metal on the inside of this. Yeah. Um, you get this lovely carved wooden um, uh, tray. Absolutely fantastic. So you've got these little indents here. Nothing on the other side, nothing there. So if you want to kind of, um, if, if you want to personalise that with your own logo or whatever, mm. if you want to get your burnisher out, you absolutely can do. Perfect. I'm just going to put that there. Literally just give it a bit of a squeeze and then pop your earrings in here. Really easy to put yeah. in and take out. No problem. And you can always put the price of your earrings. You know, sometimes if you've got a lovely display, what you don't want to do is spoil it with sort of all stickers, sort of saying these are £30. Mm. Here, you could just put it underneath very discreetly. So you absolutely. So you can see it. If you wanted to recover these as well, you absolutely can do. If you wanted to cover them in yeah. a different fabric or, or with a different colour, then you absolutely can do. Um, you've got three... Hang on. Yeah, so you've got three of your earring displays here, which is um, 
Absolutely fantastic. Really, really lovely. I love the fact it's got that wooden base. Easy to manoeuvre mm. that. Easy to move three things at once. Uh, which when you've got a stand, where, when you've got your own stall, it's, you know, it's, it, it, it's always going to be of a huge benefit to be able to do that. Um, we're at £40 at the minute. Um, we're nowhere near done. Mm. Let's get that price point all the way down for you today. All the way down. Lots and lots and lots of you there today. Let us know. Are you going to be using this when you sell your jewellery? Are you going to be using this just for photography purposes? Let us know. We'd love to hear from you today. Go to our website and send us a message. We're under, um, we're under £20 now, which is absolutely brilliant. I'm wondering as well, could you put... Why just not? wondering if you had a carving or something like that. Could you? Mm, no. The other one, yeah. I'm just trying to think if you've got like a little carving. Yeah. You could. I mean, this mm, maybe not this piece here, but if you've got one of our carvings, yeah. you could literally just pop it in there, couldn't you? Very good idea. And what's nice, it's got that little lip there, so it'll lean up against it yeah. beautifully. Um, yeah, so if you do want to kind of uh, display any of your carvings and you don't know how to do it, then I, my my kind of little <laughs> bit of advice would be to use it, you know, this way up. So literally just turn that upside down and put your carving in there. That would sit really nicely. I'm just going to move that one out of the way because it's the three, it's the three kind of aperture one that we're bringing yeah. you now. Uh, loads of you there. Well done. Let's get that price point down. Um, that's going to be great for photography as well, isn't it? If you, if, you do, if, you, if you do use that, that's going to be absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Fantastic. The fact that it's wooden looks fantastic as well, but you can paint these as well. If you've got a certain yeah, colour, nice. you can paint this turquoise if that's your colours, or the, yeah. the, the pinks, or the whites, or the browns, or the blacks. It looks like it's been made for you, doesn't it? Yeah. It looks like it's been specifically made. Um, you know, the, there are lots of people who use these kind of displays, which are great, but, you know, they're a little bit, they're a little bit ugly, aren't they, sometimes? Mm. What's nice about this, it looks like it's been made just for those earrings. It's yeah. got a lovely kind of uh, handmade feel, hasn't it? Price point coming in in three two one here we go my lovelies well done everybody coming through this is great to see you today well done Sometimes go 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 you can display your jewelry in shops you might sell uh, through a shop and you've just got look, like a couple of um shelves these are perfect for those you shelves. can get more on can't yeah. you that's great 12 pounds and 99 pence well done patricia helen annette pauline's got two carol maker lorna toyin well done to oh, you um awesome. um kinga do we have any um kinga do we have any jade carvings, any kind of coins or anything like that? Have a little look, because I'm, I'm just wondering whether you can, you know, how, how, how nice that would look. You know, just, just taking that out, moving that and doing that. Look lovely. Just, yeah, I think, I think that would look... display them. Well, I just think it's different, because I think a lot of people do struggle, especially if you're going to be selling some of your pieces, mm. how, to, how to display these uh, pieces. Um, also, oh, here's one for you. Let's say you've got let's say you've got a jade carving there. Here, instead of having another carving, you could literally just pop a little bit of information here. Taipei yeah. natural jadeite carving there. Clever. With the price. Here we go. Let's see if this it might work, it might not work. I don't know. I oh, there you go. Perfect. Perfect. Look at that. There you go. And then you can I a, love that information on the Put side. a bit of information here on a piece of card. How say beautiful. Taipei jade carving of a lotus flower with the price point as well. That's going to make it look so special, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, that's brilliant. I love that. I love that. There we go. Uh, do you know what date Sam is on, please? I missed it at the time. Oh, is it 10th of Feb? 10th of February. Yeah, he was brill. He was brill. Yeah, it was good. It was a good, good show. That was great. Well done. Um, loads and loads and loads of people coming through. Well done, everyone. Yeah, so a great, great way. I love that idea. It's nice, isn't it? I, I really think love that idea, especially with the jade. Well, if you're selling a jade carving, and that's a really yeah. special piece. Yeah. And you want to make really it look special. Shows that it's beautiful. There you go, there you go. There's yeah. your information there. You don't need yeah. to use that. You can use whatever you want there. You know, just yeah. put a little thing there or, or I don't know. Or a logo there. Yeah, a logo or PayPal accepted or, you know, these are the yeah. cards I take or, you know, whatever it might be. I don't yeah. know. Just a bit of a bit of a bit of information there. Why not? And then you can slide it over to the customer and say, look, this is it. And it's just lovely. It's a display. little kind of display, isn't it? Yeah. How lovely. Or you can just use it for the earrings. It's entirely up to you. Gorgeous. Well done, everyone. Here's your price point for this one today. Um, so we're at 30 pounds. Let's bring you a 30 second clock. 
There you go. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, Victoria Muriel, Carol, Linda, Tracy, Manchester. Well done to you, maker in the West Midlands. Absolutely brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. Well done, everyone. I'm going to put that card in there. Well done. Gorgeous. Um, so if you've got, so if you've already come through to get the three one and you want to get the two one just to kind of, um, just for a bit of variety on your stand, maybe. Absolutely perfect. Oh, I've got it here, Neary. No need. I've got it here. Gorgeous. We've got the, uh, we've got the hinge bangle coming up. Oh my gosh, which is absolutely beautiful. Well done. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here's your deal today. Well done, everyone. Here we go. Eight pounds and... 99 wow. pence well done i would definitely be getting that today well done have a little go with it have a little experiment take it out set it up great if you like it brilliant if not then you've got your 30 day money back guarantee great for taking photographs as well because i always find taking photographs of earrings really really difficult because if yes. you put them on an earring stand you know the dangly one yes you, you get the background in the way whereas this is beautiful yeah yeah, yeah, you're absolutely right. It's um, it's really going to give you um, it's really going to give you a much a much better background, much yeah. better for photography. I think. I yeah. think you're right. Um, plus that green as well. It goes so beautifully with um, all sorts of different gemstones, but particularly pearls. Yeah. Uh, it's going to really make gold pop, mm. and rose gold pop. It's going to look great with silver as well. It's just a really nice background mm. colour to have, and a little bit more interesting than grey, black, and white. Yes. Isn't it? You know, gives you a different kind of feel, doesn't it? You may want to start that as your sort of branding colour. Your Yeah, your colour theme. And follow that through onto your social media yeah. as well. Yeah. Really useful tool. Right, early bird special time for the jewellery pouch. Um... Do you know, is it really? Oh, wow. What a thoughtful uh, gift, Neary. Yeah. He's Beautiful. lovely. So uh, for Mother's Day, Neary bought his mum a jewellery pouch because um, they're all going to be going away for Neary and Sam's wedding to uh, Greece. And of course, when I get on the plane to go to Neary's wedding as well, <laughs> I'm going to need one of these. It's not even listening, not even reacting. <laughs> can, I, can I tell you something really serious, actually? No, this is this is really no, this is really serious. Last night, I took my cat's medication by accident. What? <laughs> what? Don't ask me how. <laughs> you see, it's so much better because I didn't set it up as a joke. <laughs> oh, I love it. There's me concerned. <laughs> No one said, you don't have a cat, Carol. <laughs> uh, right. Anyway, oh, that, that was worth it. That was that what I like that. I like that one. And do you know what? I was so surprised in my local town. In my local town, I was so surprised when the stationery shop moved. <laughs> oh, ha. <laughs> give, give up. Right. Yeah, that was terrible, that one. Right, OK. Here we go. So jewellery pouch. Back Neary bought pouch. one of these. Um, <laughs> OK. Um, these are wonderful if you're going to be going away for the night or away for the weekend or away on holiday. And um, you don't want to take, well, you want to take, you know, multiple pieces of jewellery. But you don't, I mean, I, I tend to just shove all mine in like a yeah. little bag and just hope for the best. But then you get there and it's all knotted, knotted up, up and yeah. old and it just looks awful. This is lovely. I love the navy blue colour. You open it up, it's PU leather, so it's nice and durable. Um, and you've got your two tags here, two little kind of straps here with poppers. This one here is great for things like, oh, I don't know, rings, yeah. little bracelets, um, chains. This one here, I if I just show you, maybe the back <coughs> or the front. Here we go. So you've got here little, little holes punched in here for, yeah. your, um, for your earrings. Uh, which is absolutely perfect, your little studs or even your dangly earrings. Close that. You've got a little zippy pouch here as well for all sorts of different things, little bracelets maybe or bangles. Yeah. You've got a lovely suede finish on the inside. This one here, similarly for things like chains, you might put the chain there and stick the pendant in there maybe yeah. um, so it doesn't get lost. So it, tangled. it protects it a bit. Um, 
I am, I never follow my own advice. I always say, oh yes, you must hang your jewelry up, hang your necklaces up. No. I'm terrible. No. I literally just take a necklace off and just shove it in my jewelry box yeah. and then get it out and wonder why it's knotted yeah. and just get really cross with myself. Um, so I really do need to listen to myself and get myself one of these. Um, it's so, it's such a great little thing to have and you'll feel really organized. And also, can I just say as well, getting on holiday or getting to your destination, wherever you're gonna be going, and opening up that bag or that box and finding everything's tangled, it's really annoying and it makes you not want to wear the jewelry. Yeah. But when you go away and you go, oh, I'm gonna, oh, what jewelry shall I wear? It's like you're opening a wardrobe. It's just, oh, that bit of excitement. It's really kind of, it's really quite nice, isn't it? Um, price point for this is ridiculous. We're at 20 pounds, not done. Have a look at this. I love this, it's gorgeous. Have a look at this. 20 pounds down to 12 pounds wow. 99. No, no, that's not your price. Wow. Do you know what else? Because I wear lots of beads, those pearls and beads. One per set of jewellery, and then you just stack them, especially if you're going on holiday. So I'd have one marlin, I might have it with the bangle oh, I'm going to wear that with that one, and then another marla, a long line necklace with the ring, or, you know, my earrings to go one outfit there, and I'd just stack them all up and they keep safe. That is, and oh my gosh, do you know what you can and do, Susie? your best jewellery. You could, if, you, if you're putting it with certain outfits, oh gosh, and especially if you don't yeah. travel lightly, which I assume you probably don't I travel do. very lightly. Clothes um, I do, jewellery is what we <laughs> Take it all. <laughs> is if you hang your stuff up, let's say you're going to be going away for a little, you know, for a couple of weeks and so you actually yeah. do make an effort to unpack your bag and kind of have a, hang, hang everything up. With that outfit, you could literally just put that through the coat hanger and just literally yes. hanging up with the outfit ready to go. Exactly. Oh my gosh, I yeah. love, this is awesome, isn't yeah. it? What a great idea for yeah. different suites of jewellery. $12.99 is not your deal. This is a really lovely gift to get for somebody. Yeah. Um, uh, you know, um, my dear friend Ruth, lovely Ruth um, Lynette, she's got loads of jewellery. She's got bags and bags and bags of jewellery and things like this for her. She would genuinely be yeah. so appreciative of something like this. It's a lovely, lovely item. But we often talk about what's the best way to uh, keep your jewellery. I get asked because of pearls and jade. This is it. Oh, put six pearl necklace in there with the earrings in there. Your bangles, put your bangles, you know, a couple in there. That's it. Beautiful. Six ninety nine. Wow. Very affordable way. And it keeps the longevity. Also, oh my gosh, imagine this. You wrap this up, you give this to somebody and say, I've got you a jewellery pouch for your birthday. They yeah. open it up and there's a piece of jewellery inside. Yes. Is How lovely beautiful? would that be? Oh my gosh, loads of people coming through. Victoria, Christine, yeah. Muriel, oh. Lorraine, Maker, Maker in Yorkshire, Tyne and Weir, Pam, Sandra. I think a great gift uh, for Easter. A lovely thing as well. I mean, I, 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 mean, I, I kind of like taking uh, flowers to friends, you know, when I go around and see them if we're going for dinner, but I'd, I'd rather give them something like a candle, which can, yeah. which can cost exactly the same price point and last even longer. And every time they light it, they can, you know, think of all oh, that yeah. lovely dinner party yeah. or, you know, whatever it might be. Six ninety nine for this. I'm not being funny, but that is that's less than the price of a bunch of flowers. Yeah, such that's a such gift. a lovely little gift and something which people are going to be genuinely excited about and not have to disappear to go and get a vase and then prepare the flowers whilst no, they're trying exactly. to cook you dinner and everything. That's just a really lovely, thoughtful little gift. Um, I really like that. And I think if you are going to be selling your jewellery over the next um, couple of months, you know, over Easter, over the bank holidays, you could just have a selection of these on your stand as well. And you could sell them for as little as 10, 15 pounds. And you've yeah. made a bit of profit on each one of them. It's, it, it, it's a great thing. It's the kind of thing that you would never think to buy somebody. Yeah. But when you see it, you go, yeah, they'd absolutely yeah. love that. Yeah. And I can tell you now, Neri paid more than 6 99 for his. That's really good. Really good, isn't it? Ooh. What is it? Oh, big... Oh, I like this. Big. How many of these have we got? Just like Big, <laughs> fat, star by. I'm going to explain this like this. Hang on, I'm just going to do this. Let's wind her up. <laughs> yeah, 
Yes. And let it go. There we go. Right. Beautiful, beautiful hinged bangle. Now, you've heard me. You know I love a bangle. And we... No. <laughs> and, you know, I, you know, I've always said, if possible, always get one that is completely round. And I've said that if you see a hinge bangle, it's inauspicious. Now, there is a reason for that. And I'm going to say why this is different. Typically, if you buy a hinge bangle in the past, what would have happened, because jade goes through families, jade is passed down, it's all heirloom. People wear them like I do every day, and it might break. Now, the family think, that's okay, something bad's happened, it's come through the jade bangle. Some people think, right, now then, I've got a jade bangle, I'll, I'll hinge it. Um, so that it's wearable. So when they pass on, the family don't want that bangle because they're thinking, no, because, you know, auntie, mummy, nanny, you know, something befell on them. So they won't, so they'll s sell it on. Now, that is a hinged bangle that is estate jewellery hinged bangle. If you get a, a bangle that has fresh out of the ground, this has no history, no... A uh, provenance to it. This is brand new jade mm. that is made specifically to be a hinge to bangle. To be a hinge bangle. That is the design. There is no history to it. There's mm. no sort of karma or anything like that. So it's absolutely brand new. So you will be the first one to wear this. Then it's fine. And then everything's happy. Thank and you these so much are for explaining new. that. Steve. And I needed to explain that because, you know, I'm really keen on buying this. And you're thinking, well, Susie said, don't buy one. Yeah. And that's the reason why it's not estate jewellery. And I stand by, don't buy estate jewellery hinged. It's been made hinged. Yeah. It hasn't been hinged because it broke. It's no, been made, made hinged. Deliberately, two fresh pieces this, for the design. This is so beautiful in the fact yeah. that it's that yin and yang. Yeah, it's it. that it's that black and white, it's that monochrome, which I know you yeah, love. I love monochrome. Susie. So look, you can wear it with this. Oh, God. You see, I wear a lot of black and white in the winter. I like naturals, but if I go for... Look at that. Susie, that is just... That's, it's it's made. You see, I'm, you know, this it's, is why I'm keen to get this. It's also 60 millimetres in diameter, so yeah, this is going to fit Everywhere. pretty much any wrist size. And, of course, the beauty of it, of, of, of it being hinged is... You know, if you find that it won't go over your wrist, it won't go over your hands for whatever reason, uh, it doesn't matter because you can literally just pop your wrist in there. Now, it's not only hinged, it's sprung. So I won't do this too much, but look, if you just literally let go, you can see it, yeah. just, it literally springs back. This is such a beautiful bangle, Susie, with such a gorgeous clasp on it. It's beautiful. I'll let you hold it because I know yes. you, haven't, you haven't had a proper look at it I yet. Know. It's Absolutely just gorgeous, lovely. isn't it's it? It's lovely so heavy. And, lovely and weighty. And what I like about this is that is a lovely hinge and look i'm going to try it on oh, please do no please do yeah. now i've got a small wrist and this is quite a big bangle so normally this size would be too big but when i clip it on look at that it's beautiful oh that's lovely that just is that's really high end looking. that's gorgeous and I just love it it's so it, I, it does look so expensive doesn't it you're right have we got enough for me to get one <laughs> Well, I don't know how many we have. How many do we have, Neri? I know they're very few. Four. Oh, four. I might, can I get one? Every, if anybody says no it, on the telly, um, you know, watching, says that's not fair, tell me because I really, I don't really... I anyone's going to say no to you, Susan. Keen. Let's do a minute's clock. Beautiful. Um, I absolutely thoroughly recommend it. It's lovely. I, I love it. It's, um, yeah, it, it is such a lovely piece. You've got... Your white and black jade, you've got the yin and yang. It was interesting, actually, we had um, dragons and phoenixes yesterday, which, of course, again, is that yin and yang quality. Um, we're at 999. It's not your deal. Um, I think the quality you're getting here, the weightiness you're getting here yeah. is absolutely beautiful. Um, the, the clasp is decadent. It doesn't, it doesn't, it's not too overly... It doesn't overshadow the bangle or interrupt the shape of the bangle too much. It's very, very complimenting. It's very discreet. Um, the beautiful um, uh, kind of filigree work you're getting either side is just gorgeous. And that little trigger you're getting there as well, just to open it, you literally just compress it and the bangle will open. It's just been so 
beautifully made. I think that's just gorgeous. And can we talk about the quality of the jade? Yeah, as please well. do. Please that do. That black jade, it's not piano black. If you've ever been in yeah. anywhere that has that piano black finish. Yes. This is what this shiny, like. shiny Fantastic. black. Fantastic. And that lovely white jade. Yeah. It's beautiful. Gorgeous. Uh, we've got Pauline in Merseyside, Maker in Greater London, Patricia in Middlesex. Lots and lots and lots of you there. 699 is your deal. Uh, we've got um, we've got individual split payments of £174.75. and pence. Well done to you. It's absolutely beautiful, Love gorgeous. It. Well done. We only started uh, with four. We, I think we might have a couple of chances left. Um, yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. I want to show you this as well with the gorgeous yeah. um, uh, uh, Branco um, white onyx as well that we've got coming up. This is your deal of the day coming up at 10 o'clock. Look at it with the kind of slightly that. finer beautiful. one as well, which is just beautiful. It's just yeah. gorgeous, isn't it? Uh, Pauline, I can see you there. Well done, my lovely. We're taking the details away in 40 odd seconds. Absolutely amazing. Well Love done. Go, go, go. Two opportunities remaining. And such a beautiful piece and designed and crafted so that it will hinge. And that's the important thing. It hasn't broken and been kind of mended. Uh, Maker in uh, Cumbria, well done to you as well. Uh, two opportunities remaining. Go, go, go. It's and look, beautiful. you've got your 925 stamp here as well, yeah. which is just lovely. So I hope everyone. that's Anne explained about hinge bangles and why these hinge bangles that we've brought you, the quality is fantastic and they're absolutely beautiful and very sort of on trend at the moment. It's very, very fashionable um, and a lot of people in the West really prefer this sort of style. I think it's because it's easy to get on and off. And if, and if you say, you know, people in the, in the West probably prefer it, it's because we're not necessarily immersed. We haven't been immersed no, or even, I, I don't want to say condition because that sounds wrong, yeah. but we haven't been immersed in yeah. that kind of, in that um, folklore yeah. surrounding, but, yeah. you know, why it's important to have a solid bangle, but wonderful. But even, um, you know, Eastern people will buy a hinge bangle if they know the provenance. If the provenance of the family was a hinge bangle, but the, the family were went on and created great wealth or you know things that we find uh, are really you know auspicious they think oh that person was very auspicious through their life I'll take a, a chance with that because I will get the good luck of that because when you wear jewellery that's why I always say you mm. must wear your jewellery you impart that lovely energy so I say I always think nice thoughts gorgeous 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 and in Pembrokeshire I can see you there as well well done yeah. beautiful right okay amazing what are we doing lovely I love that. Thank you for those that text in and said go for it. <laughs> this is beautiful. In fact, Susie, you... Um, oh, yeah, I picked it up. Yeah. I saw you picking this yes, up this I've morning. Yes, i these up. This is an absolutely... Beautiful. ...stunning piece. Yeah. Um, I can't remember whether it was... whether I was with you on the show or not, but I, the... Yeah, I can't remember We were, now, we were beautiful. looking at the back of this piece and saying those concentric circles are... Beautiful. So pretty, and they form yeah. this beautiful flower shape. It's almost like the circle of life. If you ever know about sacred geometry, um, you've got the circle of life flower, mm. which is con cir uh, circles that are sort of intersected with each other mm. in three layers, and it becomes like the circle of life, which mm. is the most sacred of all the geometries. And this has got that essence in it, which is beautiful. Let me turn this round, because it's not just about the sterling silver. It's beautiful, isn't it? This I absolutely love it. This clover of black jade. My gosh. That is beautiful. So you've got this incredible sterling silver, white topaz star in the middle of this clover. I just want to draw your attention to this incredibly beautiful kind of puffy oh, clover. Beautiful. Tell you what it reminds me of, of, and I think I said this when we launched this, it reminds me of, you know, when you see, um, um, uh, I, I don't know, Queen Elizabeth II, or, you know, when you see, the, when you see a, um, um, a queen or a king wearing a crown, and at the top, they tend to, it tends to be the kind of the velvet fabric bit with the kind of bits of the crown coming up over the top, but there's that kind of almost like a pillow on top. Do you know what I mean? In, in kind of velvet, and then they've got the sides of the crown coming up. It reminds me of that, like the top of a crown. It's just beautiful. Suzanne's bought four of these. Oh, well done. As a connector, as a, as a, um, 
so many ways as a connector this. sitting around you know a, um a, a necklace kind of at regular stations this would be absolutely beautiful wouldn't it absolutely there's so many ways you can use that you can use it as a top for a pair of earrings you can use it in uh you know your um like Marla styles. I'll tell you what I'm going to do with mine mm. is I'm going to have them either side. I'm going to do a multi-layered uh, uh, seed pearl, uh, three or four strands either side and then down there and then have another one here to a tassel. Oh, gosh, that's sounds And again, beautiful. that's going to be monochrome, black and white. It's why I love that bangle. Mm. I think, do, 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 do you know, I love that. Yeah, and oh gosh, yeah, it, it follows on with that monochrome feel. Uh, let me get that blackboard out of the way because otherwise you can't see it properly. It, um, it, it, it is absolutely beautiful as a connector. I think that, you know, using that sporadically around a necklace, Ooh. you're going to get that Van Cleef and Arpel kind of style Alhambra design going around the necklace. Much like the uh, Wall of Fame entry we had this morning, which looked absolutely beautiful. Um, oh. With that kind of, you know, the... Um, which one? It was the last entry, Neary. Oh, that one there with the malachite. Tracy, that kind of design there. If you had two or three of these around a necklace or in a pair of earrings, that would be absolutely beautiful. Oh, my gosh, I love what you've just yeah. put down here. Put that, that turquoise is that amazing. The bottom, if you were, were lucky enough, I've just picked mine up today. Look at that. Just as a pair of earrings. Oh, that's gorgeous. So it goes with anything. Wow. So while amazing. I've got monochrome, any gemstones, rubies, sapphires. Thank you for that. Emeralds, gorgeous. turquoise. Um, there's still two bangles left. If you want to get either of those, please do. It's not available on split payments. Um, it's all going to disappear, though, um, over the break. So get as many of these items as you can. Uh, wow, what an hour. Don't go anywhere. The most beautiful pearl kits coming up next. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. to know what's going on in the next show then head over to our website click on the TV guide this will tell you who's presenting which guest we have joining us along with what's going on in each hour if you ever miss a show you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show you can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy catch up on jewelry maker Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
it's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. We have got eight people in baskets for the last bangle. Oh, get it. These kits, oh. Come on. Yeah. Come on, let's get it over. Let's get it over. Here we go. I lo 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 love these pieces. Um, I think you've got something here for absolutely everyone in absolutely. these two pieces. You've got um, your kind of fairly traditional and classic, very, very, sorry, Michael, that's not very helpful, is it? Traditional, classic, really, um, I love that ombre. I've just noticed the ombre. Yeah. That's beautiful, <laughs> Susie. That's I'm, gorgeous. I'm glad because I wanted it subtle, so. Yeah. But you've only just noticed it's subtle. It's so sweet. Look at those gorgeous lavenders. Oh, my word. And you're going up here. And that, yeah, oh my gosh, right round to the white at the back. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, you know, with your lovely connectors, with your classic connectors. And then you've got this piece here, which is so beautiful. And what is Neri doing? Hang on, it's like a, <laughs> you're like a nano. What are you doing? It's cold. <laughs> Never any, are you wearing a poncho? You're wearing a poncho. It's cold. You cold. Is it cold in there? Oh, the aircon's just there. Okay, fair yeah. enough. Right. All right. All right. <laughs> oh, he's chilly. All right. Yeah, right. And then you've got this piece here, which can I have the clicker, please, love? Uh, which is um, which is so beautifully asymmetric and just ultra, ultra, ultra modern. Um, it was yesterday, and I was looking. I um, can't remember what I was. Why I was on, I was, I, I, oh, I, oh, that was it. I was looking at the Monica, Mo, Monica Veneda inspired pieces that I bought. Well, Alison bought it for me. I gave her the money uh, yesterday, which is absolutely uh, wonderful. Um, and I was on the Misoma website, which I love. It's literally, if you're ever searching for inspiration, I'd go and look on their website. They've got so many beautiful, and I mean genuinely beautiful designs. Mm. And they've had bracelets in the past that remind me very much of some of the bracelets that you wear. You know, the ones where you've done, for instance, kind of half a bracelet of gold beads and then the yeah. other half is, I don't know, uh, pearls or something. Yeah. That asymmetry, it's so lovely. And alternation is nice. It's a little bit, it's been done quite a lot. And I think what's so nice about what you do is going, no, it's half and half. It's yin yeah. and yang again. Yeah. It's, and this necklace here, which I think is beautiful i love this necklace i love it's so i like the fact that it's over half of the necklace in those gold beads I, yeah. I really really like that and it just reminded me well that's 325 pounds it just which which is let's face it that's a great price mm. and it just reminded me um this necklace that susie's made just reminded me of um of uh, of of the necklace on the miss Oma website um this is a lovely, lovely piece. Um, and you've been quite economical with your pearls. Yes, definitely. Um, don't be frightened of doing that and, in, and introducing your precious metal, this lovely paper link chain that Susie's used here. Which is so on trend as well. We've got 313, lovely, using those odd numbers. 
just looks lovely. And then that pearl at the bottom. It's interesting. If you didn't have that pearl there, it wouldn't it wouldn't look as good. It wouldn't look as yeah. finished. Whereas that is, you've just got a great eye for kind of going beginning, middle, end, or you know whatever whatever goes through your head. Loving this paper link chain, Susie. It's so yeah. sweet. I, well, it's so on trend at the moment. I love yeah. paper link chain, and I just wanted to sort of just inspire to say that you know pearl necklaces don't have to be classic. Mm. Nowadays, there are just so many variations. So, you know, it's just a starting point to just jump off and have fun and be creative. Now, we're going to start off with the, um, with the other kit. Um, these pearls are just glorious. They really are. Um, we really pride ourselves on being able to get great quality pearls. It's actually interesting. Last weekend, was it last weekend, Neary, that you were in, um, yeah, the, that shop? Um, mm, I don't, mm, they've got a supermarket as well. Uh, Lewis. There you go. There you go. And, um, Neri actually took some photos of their pearl pieces, which is beautiful. And you think that you think that the kind of prices and, and well, you think the quality of our pearls is great. Look at theirs. It, you know, really great quality pieces, like beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. Gorgeous earrings. Mm. Gorgeous earrings. How much are they? £195. Beautiful earrings. Absolutely gorgeous. That's the price for those earrings. There's no, there's no, there's no kind of, you know, that's in a shop. That's not um at a craft fair and oh, I might be able to get, you know, a couple of pounds off here, there and everywhere. You know, that is the price, 195 pounds. They're, they're your wedding day earrings. Yeah. Um, those gorgeous earrings there, 180 pounds. Yeah. Gosh, they're big, they're lovely. Natural colour as well. Beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Now, gosh, look at the necklaces on the bus there. Yeah. Some lovely bits in there. Any others, Neary? Come on. See that pink one, probably an eight mil. That's probably an eight mil pink. Do you think? Yeah. I can just tell by it being in the box. Oh, bracelets there, 230 pounds, 160, 99, yeah. 100, some good prices there. But minimum price for those studs, 54 pounds. Yeah. Isn't that interesting? Yeah, I don't, oh no, the prices are below, so that's 99, that yeah. one. I don't the, know. The, oh, the they're top singles. One, yeah. No, they're doubles, but they will be button pearls at the top, ah. at starting at 54. And then you've got the seed, the, the small, perfectly round ones perfectly starting round at 99. At, starting at four mil. Right, I see, I see. And then going up. Great prices, but yeah. I mean, yeah. So what does that make this necklace? <laughs> Based yeah. on everything we've just seen. Yeah. But they are the same quality, aren't they? Yeah. Look at what you've got here. Now, we had a wonderful show the other day on Monday. And what did we ask you to do on Monday? Do you remember? We asked you, send in your valuations. Mm. Send in your valuations. You've taken your pearl jewelry, you've taken your pearl strands to a local jewelry, you've asked how much roughly would you value this at or how much roughly would you sell this for or this, that and the other, you know, whatever. Every single person who came back said, you know, I bought this strand for X amount from a jewelry maker and I, and I had it valued at, you know, whatever price it was. I bought you a couple of valuations actually, which, which, I was, which I've been sent over the years. Uh, please do feel free to email me with any valuations for any jewelry, any, Pearls, uh, my, my email address is carol, C-A-R-O-L, like Christmas carol, roach, R-O-A-C-H-E. So carol.roach, R-O-A-C-H-E, at jewelrymaker.com. Email me any valuations that you have, and I'll show them on air. And I'll yeah. show them on air. Um, so uh, I've got one here from in-house designer Sue. Hi, Carol. It's Sue. Yes, I made the necklace. Oh, that was for, obviously for jewellery we were showing on air. Natural multicolour pearls are my favourite, and the iridescence on these is amazing. Well, I have no problem asking three to four hundred pounds. Amazing. Oh, I don't know how much the kit was. So that's slightly, slightly irrelevant. But anyway, uh, Pearl Valuation. This is from lovely Fran Porter, who lives down in London. Lovely, lovely customer of ours. Uh, she bought a uh, full strand for less than £30. Didn't um, use it all. She just made a bracelet. And she made a bracelet. She didn't use them all. And it was valued at £110. Beautiful. Absolutely incredible. I mean, 
The valuations that we had on Monday's show as well, when we bought you all those gorgeous pearls, were absolutely amazing. Anybody watching um, who has had anything valued or you've bought something from Jewelry Maker and you've gone to have it valued or you've sold it for X amount, let us know, text us. We'd love to hear from you. Go to our website and send us a message. Now, joking aside, you know, this is, you know, this is beautiful quality that we're looking at here. But let's get serious. Value-wise, Susie, and I know you do sell your pieces. Yeah. You've got some incredible pieces that you do commit that, that, that people kind mm. of, you know, you get that yeah. return business from people coming back and saying, look, can you make me this? Can you do this for me? Um, how much would you sell a necklace like that for? Th this would be 495 because it's double strand. Wow. Yeah. With the, you know, because the... Beautiful you don't need connected. to justify it. Yeah. You don't need to. Yeah. We've just seen those prices direct, you know, on the high street for, you know, earrings for, you know, whatever it was, 100 quid or, you know, however much they were. 299, I mean, they're big pearls, I suppose. 249, uh, you know, 59 for two pearls in a pair of earrings and they're button pearls. What we're looking at here, of course, that's worth every penny of that. Now, it's not just the pearls that you're getting. It's an ombre uh, strand yeah, of pearls. Lovely. Look at this. From the most beautiful ivory cream, which then blends beautifully into your apricot peach, which then blends beautifully into these kind of almost indescribably beautiful lavender pinks. All of that is absolutely gorgeous. You then get, oh gosh, these two beautifully intricate connectors. These connectors you're getting here are very, very pretty, very, very delicate. Really high end as well. They're sterling silver, encrusted with white topaz. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I mean, like you couldn't ask for something more, more decadent than this. It is just beautiful, Susie, what a gift. Um, Okay, now, graphics coming in. Oh, sorry, not graphics, price point coming in. The deal you are getting today, this is ridiculously low, by the way. Lynn Maker in Greater London has got two. Victoria Lorna Linda in Northumberland. Lynn in West Yorkshire. Noreen in Dorset. Well done to you. Here we go. This is amazing. This is incredible. 69 wow. That's less than a pair of earrings in the shop that Neri was in last weekend. That is a amazing. And that's how much I had left. So, you, you know, first of all, I thought... Well, sliding class bracelet. Yeah, absolutely. So earrings and a bracelet there. I had all those left. Now, you would think you're going to struggle to make a double-stranded, but... And that is an 18-inch necklace as well. I love it. And do you know what? I love the back of it as well, Susie. Can, yeah. can, can we show the back? Because it's got this beautiful extended chain with a beautiful little pearl. Look yeah. at this, with a beautiful little pearl. Isn't that such yeah. a lovely finished piece of jewellery? Virginia Maker, Maker in the West Midlands, uh, well unto you. 18 chances left. Very, 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 very limited edition kit. Now, I love what you've done with this, Susie. I think that what's great about a kit like this is it gives you the potential to literally... Um, it gives, you, it gives you the potential to do so much. So whether it's going Absolutely. to be rosary linking, whether you're going to be, um, whether you're going to be uh, knotting with this. I mean, Susie hasn't knotted with this. She's put beautiful spacer beads yeah. in between all of these. If you did want to take the time to knot it. But please do me a favor. Go and get these things valued. Go and see what your local jeweler thinks of them. Um, you know, even before you make jewellery with it, you know, go and show them this incredible strand and say, what would you value this at? What, give, just, give me an in, just give me an idea. You don't have to pay for a valuation. You can just ask them for their honest opinion. You know, jeweller shops are not always going to be really busy and rushed off their feet. They'll probably be glad of somebody coming in and saying, oh, do you know what? I wanted to come to an expert. And, you know, just, just kind of, you know, say it in the right way. I wanted to come to an expert. I bought this incredible strand of pearls. Give me an idea what kind of price point you would market that at. Yeah? Five seconds and we are taking the price point. Uh, sorry, I beg your pardon. Uh, taking the details away. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. Elaine, Jackie, Maureen, Maker, Catriona, Linda, Lynn, Noreen. Loads of these in baskets. Check out as soon as you well can. That's for me. And I have to, maybe it's because I bought the deal of the day yesterday. I don't know.
Maybe that's why, I don't know. But that, that's how, that's how I think young people, younger people will wear pearls. You've got to be, you've got to make your, no, you don't have to. But if you want to sell your jewelry to a younger crowd, you need to, you need to kind of give them the kind of design that they're going to appreciate. Now, for me, what I love about this is obviously the asymmetry. But Susie, can you imagine layering this? Adding, adding yellow gold, a yellow gold chain over the top. Just, do you know you what? Know. I nearly did a, a bicolour. I was going to do silver and Gosh, gold. Gosh, that would be amazing. And you've got so many pearls left over, you could actually do another layer of pearls. So you could have a double-stranded layer of pearls as well. So on one necklace, yeah. have the two oh, layers. Look, if you look at the overhead, you can see how many pearls I've got left over. Oh, my over. gosh, you've got so many I've left over. I've got half of it left over. Look at the amount of pearls Susie's got left over. Oh, my my gosh you know that I'm look it's not even a minute that that is a necklace amount but you see that's what's so wonderful about the necklace that you've made yeah. is you have been quite economical and frugal with the pearls because you've added in all of those sections of chain yeah. it's just but doesn't it make it makes more of each pearl <clears throat> doesn't it I just think it's Love very contemporary and I think you know it just I want to sort of give ideas that pearls are uh, sort of like a really must have piece of jewellery to own and mm. you don't have to have the classic pearls. Nope. They are lovely and I love them, but I love the sort of more contemporary looks. So Absolutely. I do a lot with satellite chains. And what's so nice about long long length necklaces like this, which I know is your is your thing, yeah. is you can wear it with the high neckline that Susie's wearing today. Yeah. You can wear it with a blouse. You can wear it um, with a excuse me, with yeah. a maxi dress. You can wear it with whatever you yeah. like. It's so, it's dead relaxed. It's so versatile. Yeah. Two strands of pearls. Here they are. They're both absolutely stunning. You've got this gorgeous, uh, big kind of peachy yeah. apricot gold strand. They are massive pearls yeah. you're getting there. Wowza, wowza, wowza. Um, this slightly smaller strand of bright white uh, pearls. And then... Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this. These are beautiful connectors. Wow. Yes. A I... stunning connector with three yeah. kind of um with uh what are we describing it as? With three uh carriers, if you like. Yeah. I mean, that is absolutely incredible with this tiny little cup on the end with a bar, um, uh, which is absolutely beautiful. This is really nice. Actually, there was a, um, uh, th this is, this is so, so nice that they are free moving. They're not static. Yeah, They're nice. not soldered kind of on. They're free to move all the way around the, um, the jump ring here. So that's really, you can be really reactive to the piece that you want. Um, I really like that. That's gorgeous. Oh, wow. Wow. 49 That's That is not a 49 yeah. neck. No way. That's amazing. 249 349 maybe. Oh, my gosh. And look at this. Look how they move. Isn't yeah, that beautiful? They're really free good. to move all the way around that ring. So if you wanted to have everything down the bottom or around the top or kind of put it at slightly uh, different angles, and you absolutely can do. It's, 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 it's completely... It's completely free moving. I'm not being funny, but that component on its own, that sterling silver component Beautiful. on its own, that's got to be worth, that's got to be worth kind of a good, a good portion of that price point at 49.99. Yeah. Victoria's bought five, Elaine, Maker, well Alison. Done. As a connector, we don't do many connectors like this where these little kind of carriers are free to move all the way around. It's kind of normally static. So you've got one here, one at the bottom, that's exactly one on the right. other side. That's Oh, that's potential, isn't so it? So contemporary. I mean, you oh, look, it's it's hinged as well. It's got like a little yeah, socket it's, there. Yeah, it's just so lovely. Look at that. It's hinged. So that's so articulated, isn't it? You could have done... I could have done one strand here, had the circle here, and then done a, a double-stranded asymmetrical that way. Yes. That would have been very pearly. You've got enough to do that, which is fantastic. But I just wanted to sort of show... There's lots of ways. You could put a tassel on the end of this. Oh, yeah. Add a tassel chain tassel you know uh, and just put pearls on the end of it L so much you can do with it most definitely look you've got 45 seconds and we're taking the details away well done meet's got two greater london's got two kent's got five angela maker maker in bristol tracy victoria maker that is a brilliant brilliant deal isn't it please check out as soon as you can linda in northumberland well done to you um half a minute and we're taking the details away um gorgeous 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 qualities we are about 20 minutes away from today's 
outstanding deal of the day, which is uh, the incredible white onyx bangles. Oh, these are gonna yes. absolutely fly. They are gorgeous, beautiful quality, beautiful glowing body to these. And they're gonna be yours in about 20 minutes time. Um, look, there's loads of you there. We're taking the details away in five seconds. What a deal. 49.99, add it onto your, onto your order as soon as you can. Well done, everyone, gorgeous. Okay, right. what are we gonna see, um, Suze? Wait, I'm gonna show you how to use the connector. So if I can borrow one mm. of these, because I want to explain this, I'll explain both right. And then I'll show you, so part of the demo is actually how to use these. Um, let me get my glasses on, because they're really, now these are really high, high end, uh, connectors mm. and if you can see there all the component parts are hidden Amazing. so all you're going to do is butt the pearls up against those connectors to give that really high-end finish and so re it does take a bit of um, jiggery pokery in as much as Good word. Um, if you're thinking now first I'm going to debunk you do not have to use uh, silk thread with pearl knotting. You don't have to pearl knot all the time. A lot of people ask me, should I only use silk thread to pearl knot? The world is your oyster. Your design, it can be anything. And this, to me, is a connector that perfectly, really, reinforces what I say. Because if you want to use this, you will not be using silk thread because the, 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 how you use it is so minute. Now, I've got some uh, six-pound fireline or wildfire beading thread which is incredibly strong yeah brilliant and the nice thing about this is that you can almost use it as a needle and you're going to need to now if i just show you this side can you see you've got a bar can you see that yeah you can see that bar and you can hook the jewelry through but there is a hole inside there there is a hole at the top in there which actually, oh fantastic so there's a hole so you can right and to prove it she says because this is what you're going to do is you're going to thread your thread can you see that now sorry yeah can you see that thread come through uh oh, no because my, don't worry can oh yes yes yeah, yes yes, 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 yes. Through, and then you just jiggery poker it and then pull it through it's quite easy and can you see this side even finer and to be fair, there is very little scope for you to try and get hook any thread over. and hook it over. You will just, you know, you'll be there to collecting your pension. Um, <laughs> so, but what I noticed, and they know that too, there is a hole and it is a pinhole, literally really tiny, um, that I spotted and I thought, there, there, you see, they're clever. And look, can you see there? Oh, see hello. Oops. So we've had a message from Nora asking, she bought the um, uh, uh, metallic purple pearls, would you knot them? It's up to you. I mean, it's just from what Susie's you. been saying, whatever you choose to do, go for it. I think if you are going to knot, if you haven't done knotting before, I would try it out with another gemstone yep. first, with another knotting material first, but it's entirely up to you. And I will be doing pearl knotting. I know we had um, Alison doing pearl knotting and, and don't think, oh, not pearl knotting again, but I'm going to show you because it's part of the mala. So if you wanted to use the other one you can pearl knot this one you won't be able to pearl knot because you're going to need a very fine fire line yeah. uh, beading thread and as i've threaded it through all i'm going to do now i won't do, well i can because um i'm going to because i can just cut it off you are literally i know it sounds daft you are literally going to make a knot like that this is simple as that and do it twice or do a surgeon's knot um, mm. And I wanted to show you this because what I didn't want you to, it's a beautiful, can you see that it's quite a big one? Yeah, it's quite a big knot, that's lovely. And then all you're gonna do is fill that through, pull it and it'll stop. And then put some glue on that and then leave it. And then that is how you then start. And that's if I perfect, just, Susan. if I just then put a pearl in just to show you. And then you push the pearl right up to the And then you components. butt it up and then it butts up. Yeah, that's completely. lovely. Can you see that? And that's how you use these components. Well, what's nice about the component is it's quite, um, those two cups are quite wide apart from each yeah. other on the other side. So you can use your pearls and they're not going to kind of like squash, squash against exactly. each other. They look great. 
So they've designed to be used in that way. And then you get this very oh, high-end finish. And it's quite easy. And all you need is, like I say, a little knot and then a dab of glue. And then it's a really professional finish. So Gosh, you are have, brill. So that is how you use it. I wanted, because what I didn't want is you to think that, oh, I don't know how to use this. Yeah. And then get frustrated because it is easy to use. And you just use your fire line. Excellent. Now, I'm still going to use fire line. Now, I'm going to show you the other connector. So we've shown you how to use that one. Mm -hmm. Now, this connector is beautiful. Now, can you see? Can you see this one? It's now got like a like a, a jump ring in there. Can you see that? Yeah, it's, it's more like a jump ring. So... So that is so easy to use. You can then say this was silk thread. I can put that needle through and I can use my silk thread. So if you wanted to use, do silk knotting, this is the connector mm. that you can use. Mm -hmm. So that's how you use your connector there. Now, I'm going to show you it as, as part of this because I am going to be doing pearl knotting. So um, you'll be able to make a pearl knotted necklace by the end of today, but it's in two stages. But very, very importantly, as I always say, and this is why it's great if you're using beading thread, and I often use this. I don't, sometimes I don't use silk thread all the time. Um, if you look at very, very, very high-end uh, jewellery makes, you look at Mickey Moto and see how they finish it off. Can you get in quite close here? What you've got is you've got your um, connector and then I've just got some French wire yeah. there and then it goes straight into the pearl and that's it. And if you see the other end, can you see, you can't even detect where the um, chain finishes. Chain finishes. It goes right up against it. You so can't you can't even see the French wire and there. That That's is amazing. What, you know, when you get on to making expensive pearl jewellery, this is the finish that clients are going to be looking for. But there's no reason why you can't use it on, you know, the simplest of makes. And I'm going mm. to show you. And this is how I do all my jewellery. If I can do it with silk thread, I might have to drill four um pearls to make the hole bigger for the thread but with this method you don't have to because you can use your file which is really mega mega strong this is a six pound and you're going to be doubling them through and it goes through all of your pearls as i shall prove here now and so what we do first of all this is french wire can you see this french wire i'm now going to the oh, overhead yeah. it's yeah. a bit of french wire here and i snip about, I'm going to say, about half a centimetre. Can you see it? And you do two exactly the same. So that is all I'll use. That is all I need. So what I do first is I'm going to assume this is going to be silk thread. Oh, and your panther kit on from, a, from the other day. So, with the Chrysler oh, rays. Wow. Do you remember so, that one? Yes. Now... See I'm if we can get recording of it. Right, now then. I've threaded two on because this is the oh. same for this method or it's the same for um, your um, fire line method. Are we coming back to me yet? Yeah. There we go. There we are. So I'm now threading on that piece of fire line. Yeah. I'm taking it towards the end. So you're going to thread it towards the end. And then I'm going to get my connector and I'm going to hook that in straight away. Now, I know some people like to put a jump ring on because they say, well, it can make it interchangeable. Well, I, I just think I'm just going to go for that particular design because mm. normally at some stage you are going to re-thread it. People, if it's silk thread, it does stretch over time or it gets dirty, so it will be re-thread. And it's that time that you can say, actually, I prefer this. So mm -hmm. I always say commit to your... Um, to your clasp. Now, mm. I'm going to show you the way that if this was silk thread, but it's the same for this one. And then you're just going to carefully, and imagine this is two meters long. Yeah. Going to carefully just make sure that hooks into the um, connector and then hook it round like that. Okay. And then you're just going to tie a knot. Lovely. But Make sure the pearl isn't in the way. Oh, just move your hands over a little bit. Sorry. Can That's we? all right, darling. Yeah. So I'm just going to tie a knot. Sorry. And then just tie a knot really securely. And if this was your um, silk thread, 
you're going to visibly see that knot very, very clearly. With this, it becomes invisible. So this is the difference. So you've got your first knot and then you feed it back through the second one. Lovely. And pull it through. And if that was being pearl knotted, that knot would sit there and then you would then, this end here, now you snip that off so it's completely hidden. You don't have to glue that at all. It's hidden. And then you carry on with your pearl knotting. Gorgeous. Right, with this one. So that's how you start. Now, with silks, uh, with fireline, all I do is, I forgot to put a little uh, spacer in there, but just assume I have. And then I just continue and I use loads and I continue with a spacer. I won't do it for too long. Um, with my make, go to the other end, mm. do exactly what I've done here with the other side. So if it was an extender chain, I'd do the other side. And then I'd feed it all the way back. Don't cut that, as I said before, that's if you're using silk thread, mm. but if you're using fire line, leave that. Mm -hmm. And then bring it all the way back round. And then when you get back here, let me just, Put that on because um, and just pretend that I've got to the other end. I'll yeah. Just, actually, I'll just pretend I've put. Um, oh, I love that chain so much. Just pretend that's part of the necklace, and mm -hmm. then I'm just gonna, and I've put the French wire on, which I haven't here because it's more to do with making these necklaces, um, and it gives it that strength. So you fed it all the way back to there with your fire line. You've got your connector at the other side and then you tie a knot here like that and that when you've tied it a couple of times I'll do it again just to show you um, so you've now threaded it through twice nice and then to finish that all you would then do because with with this is a size 12 needle just then, as you would with seed beading, just take your threads either side before you snip them. Never snip them at the knot. Just take them like two or three pearls. And there you have your perfect finish. If Gorgeous. You. Can you see that end? And that is such a professional end and very achievable if you use fire line. So you can do that on all your pearls and do it this method. And I've sold uh, pearl necklaces using this method. Buyers, when you're um, selling pearls, don't actually ever specify, Susie, you need to do it with silk thread. I demand you do it. They might say, yeah, I'd like it silk knotted or whatever. That makes your choice. But if they're not fussy, because I might say I can do it with gemstones, I'll show you various ways. Or they might just say, look, I just want a lovely necklace. Mm. So then I'll decide what I'm going to do with it. But awesome. that is a lovely way gorgeous, of Susie. doing jewellery. Well done. And I'll do the pearl knotting later. Yeah, lovely. Um, on screen at the minute, we've only got two, uh, but on screen at the minute is this incredible Christ of Praise kit. This, this broke uh, the phone lines when we bought it to her oh, a few weeks ago. It. That there is a metre of Christ of Praise with a sterling silver panther clasp with green onyx eyes. It is literally I've got a incredible. Um, it is literally, it's £129. There's two chances available. Oh, Susie, you're so gorgeous. I wore that sorry. bracelet all. Oh, sorry. It's going to I wore disappear. that bracelet all. Oh. Um, <laughs> That's all right, let me It's going to disappear, but I'll show you again because it's the show. Um, I wore that all um, show and I just absolutely loved it. Uh, we've got a message from Gloria in Suffolk. Hello, lovely. So I gifted a lavender pearl purchased from JM to my sister this week. She cried, oh, tears of joy. And just kept saying, oh, wow, I felt so proud. Gloria, that's why you make jewellery. That makes yeah. me feel proud. Yeah. How awesome is that? Sorry. Go jewellery maker. There you go. There you go. Oh, Susie, that is such a lovely bracelet. A metre of Chrysoprase. I know, it's literally incredible. And it broke yeah. the phone lines when we bought it to air. So there's two left at £129. Oh, there's one left. One left at £129. Amazing. Um, gorgeous. Right. Oh, see, this is it. What, the ones that Susie picked up this morning? Yeah. Yeah. We're going to make this into a star buy. Time to revisit the Akoyas.
much. <laughs> <laughs> well, quite seriously, when you put the thread through the hole and then it came out, I thought, oh, gosh, no, this is it, this is it. But then you got it through again. Yeah, it's easy. Yes, yes. go, Susie. Yes. <laughs> yes. I know, we're all rooting for it together. Oh, it's brilliant, all rooting. <laughs> Susie. Right. Right. <laughs> okay. okay, so we bought you this strand of a <laughs> Oh, gosh. When we bought you this strand <laughs> of a coir pearls the other week, nobody was expecting them to be this size. I mean, wow. Yeah. Nine, <laughs> nine mil, eight to nine mil. Oh, you can just tell they're a coir. Look oh, at that recording, Susie. They are lovely. I bought these. Mirror. I've bought these. I've just picked them up today. Absolutely. And fantastic because I've just shown you what, how to make your jewellery. This is the, the method I've just shown you. This is what you do with these. Please. Mirror shine. I mean, wow. Mirror shine. Oh, they are fantastic. Aquias like this just don't exist um, for a number of different reasons. Uh, the, the, the mollusk that they come from, the uh, pink tada fucata, is about the size of the palm of your hand. It's tiny. It's like a little compact size. Um, I'm sorry, I don't know why I'm literally... Look at my hand! No, you, know, you don't have to look at my hand. Um, it's... it's um, but it is literally the size of your hand. So the pearl that it forms is really delicate and quite and, and quite petite. Um, unlike the pink tada maximus, which is what creates the South Sea pearls, which is, you know, the size of a, a dinner plate. Um, that's why these pearls are so extraordinary. Um, but of course, what makes these super, super, super rare and extraordinary and super luxurious and, and just an absolute miracle is of course what's been going on in the pearl world over the last over the last couple of years, um, thousands, hundreds of thousands of um, of um, little hatchlings, um, uh, um, Akoya pearl, uh, um, the mollusk hatchlings, have died due to some unknown virus, whatever it is. Nobody seems to be able to uh, locate kind of why it is, but it's uh, but it's affecting so many of the Akoya pearl farms. When you've got things like Okoya pearls, Tahitian pearls, South Sea pearls, um, it's made from one type of mollusk. And of course, that makes the gene pool very, very, very narrow indeed. So to try and crossbreed them with other pearls, it, it's just not going to work because, of course, you're not going to end up with an Okoya. You're going to end up with an Okoya mixed with a, you know, whatever it might be. Um, the, the quality you've got here... Absolutely oh, beautiful. They are so, so large. Beautiful. Stunning. You know, these are large Akoya pearls. For these to yeah. exist at all is absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, because, of course, what does that mean for Akoya pearl value, Akoya pearl prices? It means that any Akoya pearls in the marketplace right now, uh, you are going to be paying over and above what you would, what you would have absolutely. paid five years ago. Um, you know, not due to the COVID-19 pandemic, but due to this um, mystery virus, which seems to be affecting um, the Akoya uh, mollusks. Um, I've never experienced acquires like this. Have you ever? I mean, I know that you, you know, yeah. you've been sourcing pearls for for years. Have you yeah. ever seen acquires like this no, in this no. size? Yeah, normal size that you're going to get acquire pearls, and it's standard in the industry, six to seven mils. So when I'm selling oh, a pearl gosh. necklace, uh, I'm normally selling uh, acquire pearls for about a thousand pounds, as opposed to say starting price of 200 they'll yep. start it. that's for six to seven mils that's standard they start at four mil they do go up to sort of nine mil so so rare so, so rarely, rare yeah. bearing in mind it's a really small i mean the oyster is that big it's so, tiny so you imagine that's going to be quite painful or quite big mm. to have in his little sack yeah absolutely so it puts the price up that's the point it absolutely. really puts the price up it's like your one carat diamond uh, one and a half. It's equivalent, really, to a three-carat diamond. Oh my the, gosh! Really, that's yeah. Yeah, that's fascinating, isn't it? I think as well something to something to remember as well 
is that these are genuine Akoya pearls. They're not Akoya style pearls. Yeah. These are Akoya pearls. They can only be called Akoya if they're from, I think, one of three places in Japan. Um, I don't know exactly where we get our Akoyas from in Japan, but it's definitely Japan. So what I would say to you is, for everyone coming through to get these today, please, 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 please do get your authenticity certificate. It's going to cost you an extra 25p. Yeah. Because, of course... If you take a pearl necklace to be valued, a freshwater culture pearl necklace to be valued, it's going to be valued at X amount. Mm. If you take an Akoya pearl necklace to be valued, it's going to be a different league entirely. Yeah. And that is the main difference here. You are looking here at something, you know, freshwater pearls, you can have up to 20 pearls in an oyster, maybe even more. But with an Akoya, it's one pearl one per pearl. oyster because they're so tiny, the little mollusks. We're at 699. Can I tell you a little tip as well? If you're Please ever do. buying pearls mm. because there's so many suppliers and as you know like with everything it's faked and people will sell freshwater pearls because the quality of freshwater pearls is fantastic these days take a uv lamp if you've got freshwater pearls the uv lamp will make the freshwater pearls fluoresce they naturally fl fluoresce if it's south sea or akoya pearls they won't won't fluoresce so that is a test or if you've got one of those nail things that you put your nails in or you do resin work stick it under there Put your fresh I did not know that. The rest, and a koi pearls won't. So that is fascinating, yeah. Susie. Yeah, little tip. So that's how. Wow. You Learn from the GIA because they test all of their pearls, and they had uh, a strand of pearls that was very, very high end. It was South Sea pearls, and there were three freshwater pearls in amongst them. Oh, naughty, naughty, naughty. naughty. Gosh, that is fascinating. Two, four, nine. Yeah. Fascinating. Yes. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. And with regards to the kind of the value of this in a in a knotted necklace, Susie, I mean you're looking at four figures, aren't you? Oh absolutely. For for eight to nine mils. Well I bought um, Potentially one. ten times the price point yeah. of the strand. Yeah. And I th I've bought a strand, I've picked it up today, <clears> so excited. That will be going down in in because they're so rare to find. Mm. Honestly, so rare to find. Um, so, yeah, I shall be handing it down. I won't be selling it. Amazing. Wiltshire, West Midlands, Victoria and Kent, Maker, well done. Right. Do not go anywhere. We've got the most exciting thing coming up after the break. It is going to absolutely blow the lid off the show. We've got not one, but two Branca Onyx bangles. These are sensational. Do not go anywhere. We will see you in a couple of seconds. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. To know what's going on in the next show then head over to our website click on the TV guide this will tell you who's presenting which guest we have joining us along with what's going on in each hour if you ever miss a show you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show 
You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. safe to say we are all incredibly excited about we this are morning. We very excited. <laughs> and I'm sure you guys are as well, if you know what's coming up. I'm sure we've promoted it. Uh, a lot of you know that we have a really exquisite opportunity right now. I'm just going to give you a brief overview of this gemstone. I know a lot of you know about it already. We're talking about, obviously, the Branca Onyx. Branca being like the Portuguese or the Brazilian word uh, for white. You, during COVID or maybe just before 2019, 2020, a Brazilian farmer uh, in the state of Minas Gerais um, was you know clearing some land and they they hit kind of in the mountain uh, the side of the mountain some gemstones and uh, you know they're talking about this vein which isn't unusual there I mean some of the, the Bella Horizonte emeralds some of the most incredible emeralds mm. the Belmont emeralds is just when they were clearing space for a road it's just so gem rich wow. it's the same as Burma um, and, and so you know this is a, a frequent thing usually it's gemstones they know more about like tourmalines um, emeralds and other uh, Brazilian gemstones but this time they hit this white gem originally like it looked like marble and then they started mining more and they got this supreme kind of translucency there was a few people from what I hear from the, the, the miners that I met at Tucson two years ago that thought it might be jade. Because really, when you think about a, a white translucent gem, yeah. I, can't, I can't personally think of another gem that you would mistake it for. Um, and so they took it to Belo Horizonte, which is kind of the, the gemstone capital of Brazil, where a few of the kind of gem labs are. Not they're the biggest names, but they have the equipment there to tell you what you're looking at. Yeah. And it's, you know, it's always in use because all these people are always finding gems <laughs> in their amazing. gardens. Um, <laughs> and, and so they go there and they get it tested and they told them that it's an ultra fine, ultra rare example of onyx. Now, the Brazilians kept it quiet for so long, so we didn't hear about it because in Brazil they have a very different law, which is if you find a gem, even if it's not your land, that's your claim. So, and it's, the, it's literally the first to register the claim owns that pocket, right? Oh, so it could be your land. Um, and it's happened many, many times with like uh, railway workers. Um, I'm going back many, many uh, decades now, but when they were building railways through Brazil, these railway workers who were back then working for like a pittance, and they're clearing this land, they'd find something, they'd be like, right. And they'd like uh, make agreements with each other. There could be like four or five of them, like a gang of them working one stretch. And they'd go, right, you guys carry on, I'm that's gonna a movie. run. Yeah, yeah, and, and they would, awesome. they would, they would, one of, the, one of them would be like, right, cover for me, I'm gonna get somehow to Belo Horizonte. And they'd, they'd have to register it with the Ministry of Mines, and then it would be, and you know, oh, that's and, awesome. and, and, and I'll be honest, back then, when you read about it, there's many great stories, even covered by the GIA, where there's a lot of bribery going on, a lot of corruption, oh, bet, because yeah. they'd have like 30 claims. And usually, you know, most government officials go through it by date, 
first, you know, like, okay, well, this was submitted first, but if you could get in there and you could be like, go through mine first, then it's the first to, to market, really. Um, and so the, the, the farmer, he did find it on his own land, but he didn't want to let the secret out straight away because he wanted to register the claim because he didn't want someone else mining this material. Eventually, he's got it, so it's, it's a great story. This is on his land. It's his incredible mine. Um, he's still farming, but he's also mining this material. And he debuted it at the Tucson where I was. Um, and it was a really, really incredible experience. Um, I don't know too much about Onyx. I know what I've told you before, which is that there's like a massive disconnect between the Onyx we see and the Onyx we can't mm. afford. Mm. Okay, they are not the same gemstone. Natural Onyx that doesn't need to be dyed or treated is extremely expensive. And that's why... Um, I've always said this, when you see like a Cartier or a Boucher on Black Onyx and then you see us or, or next door bring you on and it's exactly the same design but we can do it for 30 quid and mm. that, there it's like 7,000 pounds. That's not because they're making some huge margin, that's because we can't get the natural material mm. because the natural material realistically it's like 1% of the mining and, and the rest of it they die and they can call it Onyx so it's great mm. or we can call it Onyx and it's great. But I saw an opportunity here and I started talking to these uh, Brazilian guys and I explained to them that we're a shopping network, we can buy volume, which is what they want to do. They want to work with someone who can do that. And so we got an incredible deal on this. And I've said when I first brought this to you guys, that it's the first time ever in history white onyx has been discovered, like translucent white onyx. Um, you know, because onyx is always black. I mean, you see it green dyed and stuff, but it's always black when it's gem quality and natural. And I'm the first to say, any time that I'm wrong, I'll tell you right now, um, there has been a discovery of white onyx before, okay, like a long, long time ago. Do you remember me telling you, Carol? Mm. Like, a long time ago, there was a discovery of white onyx. No one even knows the mine because it was a very small discovery. It's almost like a chunk of this incredible material. And it was acquired by uh, Carl Fabergé, and it was created into this unbelievable polar bear that no one even knew about. Beautiful. And it was sold in London um, to uh, an aristocracy, to a very wealthy family. And um, Christie's very recently acquired it back and they even had no idea why Onyx existed. And so they had to go back, they did this whole kind of investigation into where is this from? We believe the mine was somewhere in either Siberia or Eastern Europe, it's gone now. And this is like a renaissance. This is an incredible experience for all of us to be able to own, it is realistically one of the most expensive gem materials in the world mm. and in a new way. The reality for everyone watching right now um, is we are gonna bring you more Branca Onyx which is incredible. We're still going to give you the best prices, but your expectations need to be um, tampered a bit or tempered a bit because when we first got involved, we got like the best material, which is translucent. Um, today it's called Branca Agua, which is like water, top water. Oh. Um, and going forward, we're still going to bring you the natural onyx for as long as we can, but it's going to be opaque. And even that material has been acquired by Sotheby's. It's been acquired by everybody. It's still extremely rare. I don't want you to think it's not but today represents probably our final opportunity of the Branca Agua. Now, next door at Gemporia, many of you, I know you migrate between the channels. A few weeks ago, we did um, our first ever lookbook event, hmm. which was, it was a great success, it was amazing. Awesome. And usually we do these kind of events, but we're inspired by the looks books of others. So we'll, we'll get hold of like the Tiffany Blue Book from like previous years, 2016, and we'll be inspired heavily by their designs. And we've done it with uh, La Vienne, we've done it with Van Cleef, where they do their incredible design ethos. And we go, oh, okay, well, I don't know, hummingbirds are big, so we're going to do a hummingbird collection or whatever it may be. And we decided, look, we, we're now our own, we're our own jewelry house. We've worked with the beers, we've worked with Rio Tinto, we've worked with the Argyle Mine, we've worked with Gemfields, we've worked with some of the most incredible gemstones in the world. We have an amazing team of designers from Jaipur uh, to Antwerp to Bangkok to Chanterbury. And maybe we, right now, 20 years in the game, we can create our own lookbook, our own designs. And we did that, and it was amazing. All new, like the imaginations ran wild. We said, just go for it. You know, new, exciting things. And one of the standout pieces, now it was like showcases, showcases, showcases. By showcases, I mean like 20 or 30 different designs, earrings, whatever. When it came to the, the Branca Onyx, we did one piece. Oh, wow. And it was a bangle and it was the Branca Agua Bangle. This material goes two ways from Brazil right now. The top, top 1%, the, the Agua, goes to the Far East, okay? And then the other material goes to Jaipur, the, which is where we're buying the rest of the material from. This is the, the, the one showcase of Branca Agua that we did um, next door in Jampori. It's an incredible bangle. Lovely piece. It's, it is, it's really coveted. You can see the translucency. Wow. And, and look, you can, it came with like a physical lookbook 
and the double page spread showed this and it says you know the stone is clean and translucent like the waves of the purest white water completely untreated and completely natural it's as if mother nature handcrafted this bangle from her intricate careful hands and you have two different bangles today we have um, one that is significantly larger massive carat weight still the agua material <gasps> translucent and then I absolutely love, I've never seen a bangle like the other one. So you know, delicate. This, this is almost like a ribbon of, of yeah. incredible uh, branca on it. They are absolutely uh, sensational. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what's happening now with even the opaque material. So this is Sotheby's putting like flawless diamonds into this material. Oh, wow. Price upon request. Just two small pieces of the exact same material from the exact same mine. Uh, you've got these here. Wow. These are $3,200. These are from Seralina, yeah, uh, small white onyx and diamond earrings. And this is it, they're being partnered with diamonds around 18 karat gold. Uh, you can find pieces like this, oh, wow. 2,800 2, pounds. Um, this is from Forever Jewels. And it's like opaque, but it's faceted in this really beautiful kind of cone shape mm. on the top. And this white onyx is, you know, it's in white gold as well. <laughs> this is what's happening. But I want to take you to Christie's where we heard of the first ever time white onyx made its debut on the world stage. Um, so I'm going to take you there. It will take just a moment. Um, but this is it. Oh, have yeah. you seen this? I did. It, I it's beautiful. Watching. It's amazing. Beautiful. beautiful. So this is, it. this is where I like eat my own words and say, OK, I was wrong. You know, five minutes with an Look onyx polar this. bear by Fabergé, this chunk of rust. It's huge. And, and they've got this Russian art specialist in. And she's talking about the detective work that went into tracing the provenance, because no one knew this existed. No one knew that there was one onyx. I mean, they had that tested so many times. They knew Fabergé worked with, you know, many different gemstones, all of them natural. And it came in the original box from, like, the early oh, 1900s. It's great. Um, and this is it. Oh, large, my gosh. Yeah, it's stunning. It is, it is. A, a large and important white onyx model of a bear by Fabergé, circa 1909. It's five inches. Five Beautiful. inches. It's incredible material. And the, 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 the reason I'm showing you that is because that combined carrot weight would have been needed to create these bangles. Mm. You think about how much you've got to waste to create the size, the diameter, you know, a solid, a solid piece of, 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 what is it, five inches? You think about how much you'd have to waste down to get down to a bangle. Yeah. This is an opportunity that I can never bring for you again. Even if I wanted to, even if you were willing to pay the price, it's very difficult to find the translucent material. And, and they talk about the detective work. And they, they say that, um, the timing of uh, Degane and Virginia Vanderbilt's stay in Scotland one month before the purchase of the white onyx polar bear suggests that this lifelike model was given to the Degane family as a souvenir, a souvenir from their joint uh, holiday. Fabergé provided luxurious presents to the elite from all over the world. That's what mm. we're doing right now. Mm -hmm. um, this exquisite model of a polar bear wow. acquired more than a hundred years ago is a wonderful testimony to its role in Edwardian high society. This, is, this material, as fleeting as it is when it's been uncovered, it's only ever been available to the elite of this world. It's only been crafted and worked with by the actual masters. You know, Carl Peter Fabergé, in his workshop in Paris, who was creating jewellery and Easter eggs for the Tsars, <laughs> like the wealthiest individuals that have existed throughout history, sold this in his boutique in, in Mayfair, London in 1909. And they're still digging into the detective work of this incredible material. And I want you to understand wow. how difficult it is to achieve something like this. Now, I don't, wanna, I don't want to disparage anything, but it's far easier to carve a bangle out of jadeite. It's more expensive. And it's right now harder to find. Mm. But it's easier in the way that it forms. OK, you get fault lines. You do get fault lines. But if you get something without a fault line in the slice, it's ready made. You know, in terms of you put the template on it. Yes. You've got to go through. Yeah. With, with, with this material, it, it, it forms in these layers. Yes. These very difficult layers. Some of it is frosted. Some of it throughout that geology is already shattered, essentially, mm. but still formed perfectly. Yeah. To find a sheet of this material that is clean enough to do what we're doing here, it yeah. looks... It looks like it's made out of resin, this material. Yes, it does. It looks it like looks it's been manufactured in a factory yeah. or something. This is not. This has been pulled out of a farm in the side of a I mountain in Brazil, transported thousands of miles across the world to the Far East, to the only people, and I say this with all uh, honesty, the only people in the world with the skill to be able to do this. Fabergé couldn't do this. He, he could create this wonderful polar bear, 
but to create these bangles, only the Chinese and, 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 and the people of Myanmar can do it. So, sorry to interrupt, Dave. Yeah. The polar bear, Yes. the, the Fabergé polar bear. Yeah, I'll go back about, to it for you. That measures 12.7 centimetres yeah. in, in length. That's that. Yeah. How much, and as you said, how much of the material would you have to get for these two bangles? Yeah. I mean, mm. this is well, I, I know incredible. From, from, well, for, for those of you that are following my little journey on social media or whatever, or maybe you were here when I brought in one of the master carvings that yeah, I'm bringing. Yeah, I saw yeah. it. Right. This is the way it's going to go with Jade, because just like Fabergé did, when you find something like unparalleled in terms of rarity, you yeah. want to preserve as much of the caraway as possible. So what you would want to do, if you do, if you're fortunate enough to find like a jadeite boulder like this size, back when jadeite was coming across the border all the time, yeah. still extremely expensive. Like I'm not talking about that, but when it was there was a consistent mm -hmm. supply, they could do things like this. They could go, do you know what? This piece we're going to carve into, waste it all. Let's create the most pristine, incredible bangle. Now, as I've seen firsthand, what they're doing is saying, oh, hold on, we've got, we've weighed this, we've got um, two kilos of jade here. What we're going to do is we are going to create the most amazing sculpture, mm. which is amazing skill, but we're going to preserve as much of this as we can. Yes. We're not wasting it anymore. Yes. And that is absolutely proven by uh, what Asprey are doing in Mayfair right now. So they've got all these um, antique pieces of jade. They've got 60 pieces, right? Concierge only. They're, they want to lead the, the, the Western market in luxury jade. Eye, but they have one piece of rough. And even they're not brave enough to do anything with it. Wow. That's the truth. They've got like a seven kilo piece of rough. Mm. Wow. And do you know what they're doing? They, they could create anything. Money's no object. They could take it to China right yeah. now. They well, could that's like, create it. this, create that. But all the pieces that have been created, they haven't been commissioned by us, right? They've been acquired, right? Mm. So they've got like pieces that are those big buy discs. They've got, they do have bangles. They have everything. They've acquired those. They've openly said, we've acquired all of this on the secondary market. It's not like they've gone there, like, like I have, even with what we're doing, and said, please carve this, please carve that. Yeah. But when they did acquire a piece of rough, they've got it in their safe in Mayfair. They're inviting the elite in, and they're saying, you can commission your own carving. You can. If you want to waste it, you can, but it's 18 million pounds to do it. That's the reality. Yeah. They have an 18 wow. million pound piece of rough that's 30 centimeters long. That's it, it's 7.5 kilograms. It's impressive, it's amazing. But th they could do whatever, they could absolutely shock the world and create something amazing, but they're not. They're like, we're not wasting this. We've, we've paid a substantial amount of money for it. We've acquired it, we've transported it to the UK. And they are saying, come and view. I mean, when has any jewelry house in the world, Cartier, Tiffany, come anyone- Come and view this piece of rough. No, never have they, <laughs> never. Yeah. It's never happened in history. That's how valuable and pristine this material is. And this oh. is why, but it's exactly, the reason I'm talking about Jade and the reason I'm talking about that is because it's exactly what Fabergé did. He acquired um, white onyx. No one in the world even knew it existed, me included, Christie's included. They've had to do detective work to find out where on earth this came from. And he got that piece of rough and said, right, I'm going to create a polar bear. And it probably was, was essentially dictated by the form of the rough. Yeah. The rough was probably elongated. And he said, OK, we're going to... And it's amazing taking the thing away from it. Mm. But we've gone and created a bangle. Mm. And, and look, you know, what we should be doing is we should just be sat here with chunks of rough. Yeah. You're saying, right, guys, this is the price. Right. You tell us what you want. If you want to waste you know, two thirds of it, that's fine. We'll take it and do it. But this is your opportunity. Now, for anyone who tuned into my show, on Gemporia, where I bought you the Branca Agua. You'll know the price that we paid for that. You'll, you'll know the price that our, our collectors paid for it, and it was amazing. It was a complete sellout. There's nothing here today. These are the best price Branca Agua bangles, not just in the business, but in the world right now. In the world. And the only reason that works, wow. and I'll be absolutely frank with you, because I speak to the team that carved it, and they predominantly carved jade, and they've done this, uh, not for us, they, they do it routinely. They buy the pristine material, and they do it. And I know this price they sell these for. Okay, so they sell them singularly, okay? And they'll sell them to, you know, um, boutiques in Shanghai, in Beijing, in Japan, wherever it may be. And th those companies will come in and they'll buy one, or they'll buy two, and then once they've sold it, they'll come back and buy another one too. And I said, okay, well, we, we're not gonna pay, and it is over a thousand pounds for one of these. How about if we ordered as many as you can make and bring the price down? We're the only people on the planet that are doing that. So I'm gonna tell you, it, yes, it's going to be a better price than you saw next door. It's also going to be the best price for a Branca Agua bangle in the, in the world. We're talking transparent. Yeah. We're talking aqua. Mm. But we're also talking extremely limited. Even though I bought everything they had, yeah. they're not massive quantities. No. The, the largest carat weight, which is even larger than the piece that I launched in our lookbook event, 
What is the carrot weight, Neri? On the largest one? 180 carrots. Right, 180 That's incredible, carrots. isn't it? Mm. And how many do we have, Neri? 85. Right, so not That's 150. Yeah, <laughs> okay. it is, but it's not 200, it's not 150. No. Let's do a 30 second clock. Oh gosh. 85 of these, best so price you'll expensive. ever see. I wish all of you the very best of luck. This won't happen again. And, and by the way, I can't even do it with the opaque material for, for a less price because you don't have the crystal. So it's never, it, would, it would have to be hinged. So for the opaque material, the lower grade, you can't actually do this because it won't, it won't sustain, it won't go all the way through that process. That's fascinating, yeah. So the, the only way you can get this is if you're buying the top grade. And anywhere else in the world, you can't afford the top grade. Oh gosh. Best Lines are open. Oh my gosh. Best of luck for <laughs> sure. The legendary Susie's buying. Yeah, uh, she is. Yeah, on, on absolutely. I just saw you. And that's it, fine. That's great. It, 180 carats. Well done, wait, first wait, person wait. on the phone lines, Greater London. Congratulations. We, we do have a queue forming. It is going to be oh, an unbelievable price. Oh, Double gosh. figure stock. Double figure stock. That's it. Not oh, hundreds, gosh. unfortunately. And I want to show you, yeah, and, and the other one as well, Carol, just what's coming up next. The, the beautiful, incredible. Oh. It's so beautiful. I love it. I've never seen anyone do a bangle really like this. Fine. It's, very it's so fine. It's so transparent. That's coming up. Just look at that. I love the fact that it's completely round as well. That yes. kind of more traditional kind of profile to it. It is incredible. Is the That's other one on pre-order, Neri? No. No, okay. He's fine. too scared no to problem. put it on pre-order. He's worried. That's fair. That's fair. Look at that, Susie. That is I absolutely incredible. Isn't it beautiful? It's transparent, exactly. top water, oh, incredible yes, crystallization. Because right I think this is, gonna, this is gonna be the only beautiful. time that it ever comes to air. Um, the Best price for a bangle. The, the, yeah. the aqua, the, the water kind of content that we're talking about here, the aqua-ness, the translucency, thank you Dave, yeah. is, is above and beyond anything I think any of us were expecting. It glows. It's beautiful, it has an inner glow. It's and, and can you do me a favor? In a minute, we'll show you the transparency oh, that's a good first. Good torch, yeah. wowzers! <laughs> 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 oh, watch this hold the light. It's insane. That's beautiful, isn't that lovely? That's like a Lumi light, isn't it? That is Look at that. absolutely the light. Like a ring light. Leave, right, leave it. Leave it like that for a second, Carol. Yeah. So your torch is in one is in one portion of it. Yeah. yeah. But the whole bangle's lighting up. Yeah. yeah. Of course because, it is. Because because there is that's no amazing. obstruction of the light, and when I'm looking at it from here, I'm across the studio. I'm not looking at it from the screen. The bottom of it that isn't lit up yeah. is lit up because yes. the light is yes. traveling yeah. through it all. This is supreme. Absolutely oh supreme. Oh my wow. gosh. Look yeah. at that. That lovely. I have, we've seen some seriously decent bangles over yeah, the years. Absolutely. We? This is. Right, if this is Jade, it's the million dollar bangle really, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Like, that's it. It's like, that's exactly we bring it. you incredible material, like but I'm just eyes telling eyes. you, if that's Jade and it's that transparent, wow. It's the million dollar bangle. That's it. It's the best bangle money can buy, what we're about to bring you. And uh, anywhere else in the world, money can't buy this material. It's Not our money anyway. pure. Yeah. It's so pure. Mm. Right, 30 second clock. Uh, well done. Love to, lovely to see all of our usual collectors on the phone lines. Alison, Susan, Gloucestershire, Yi Mei, Anne in Cardiff. This wow. is going to be a wild, wild deal this morning. So the inner diameter, sorry, it's slightly uh, misleading. It's 58 to 62, I yeah. believe. Isn't that right? Yeah. Uh, 58 to 62. Um, I don't even know where to start with this, Dave. I, yeah. I feel very privileged to have this in the studio. That's exactly it, right. Oliver. Well, a lot of people say, still think this is severely um, undervalued right now. Yeah. Even though it's climbing, climbing, climbing. I'll tell you what this would be if we were just buying one. £2,000. So let's just go there straight away. If we were just buying one of these, okay. that's the, to me, by the way, not to you guys. Mm. If I went to the same team and said, we just oh, want wow. one of these pristine bangles, it would cost me £2,000. That's trade price. So let's go to that price immediately for all of our collectors. And then I'm going to let you know that it's going to be the most affordable bangle you've seen me bring you. Oh my gosh. £2,000 mm -hmm. is where we're starting. Right, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna um, do something <laughs> crazy. Okay, you see this one? Don't, oh gosh. Right, no. This one's coming up, okay? Which is the smaller version, which is very intricate, very beautiful. And just to give you some idea of how crazy these deals are gonna be today. This one, this one. He's gonna say it. 
is going to be in double figures. No, you were going to say that. Oh my so gosh. I'm just giving you that piece of heads up because you have no idea how good the other one is going to be. Okay? So if you want to multi buy, it's your time. The next one is going to be double figures. The one that Carol is holding is going to be the best deal you've seen for something of this size. And if you want to, Carol, you can take both of the bangles and just tap them. We did it earlier. We did oh, do really? it earlier. Oh, We've been doing I, I, didn't, just... I didn't know. Oh my gosh, that yeah. high. That lovely pain. Isn't that incredible? Oh, love. Sublime. Right, love. so Victoria, love. you've got three. Thank you for trusting me. 30 second clock, guys. Let's get this rocking. This is going to be a wild, wild deal this morning. Um, this, the, the other one is not on pre-order, so you can pick that up as soon as that one goes live. Oh. But I think I, the reason I told you that is because I wanted to inadvertently tell you how good this deal was going to be. For the 180 carat, large, impressive, transparent Branca Agua Beautiful. from Brazil. I know where you think we're going. Think again. Think again to everything. Susie kind of knows Susie's there. She's already confirmed. I don't a lot know. of you are already more I don't think Susie really cares. She no. just wants it. It's yeah, just, that's you know, it. It, it, when it, you become it, a collector of something like this, you just have to you have, have to have, have it. them. And it's gonna go with my mala. Bring that in. Right. Bring the mala in. Do you, know, do you know where I'm gonna go right now? This mala's oh, coming yeah, up go on, midday, isn't it? Yes, yes, yes. And, and I love it. Classic. It's absolutely sublime. It's gonna, that's Look at it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That right, just... Neary, let's go to the split pay payment. It's got to be done. Which is 499. <laughs> 499. Let's go there. Nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. Let me tell you where this price is going eventually, what it's going to start with. It's going to start with a one. Oh and my god. And we're already going word. to 499. Final price will begin Neary. with a one. He's checking these prices about seven Look, or eight it's times. There's only 85. There's only 85. But you're Good saying look. that the final price is going we'll begin to start with a one. With a one. Yeah. So this is oh. for anyone who wants to join us, for anyone who wants to get involved, for anyone who wants to be part of this historic moment. And the it's Branca Agua. Yeah. Yeah, it's on split pay as well. It do, won't the need Bangle to be. Club. Right, <laughs> Linda, Maker, Valerie, Victoria, well Deborah, well Anne, done. Maker, Suzanne, Maker, Susie, our Susie, Susan, <laughs> Lynn, Pauline, uh, Maker, Greater London, Essex, Gloucestershire. This is incredible. Mauve scale is, is between six and seven. Very, very durable, as all bangles mm. need to be. Mm -hmm. um, so it is you know, something that you're not going to have to worry about. Um, 499 we're at. Absolutely gorgeous. There's so many people joining us. There's lots in baskets. We've got people multi-buying. This is such an exciting moment here on Jewelry Maker today. Um, your split payments, by the way, they are interest-free. Give us a call. Put it in your basket. The end price, by the way, everybody, is going to start with a one. In fact, let's 30 seconds. Again, we, we have this opportunity, then we have the, the next opportunity, and I've told you that one's in double figures. This is your chance today, your show, your moment to capitalize on these incredible deals. Look at that. Oh my gosh, oh the two of word. them together. We were saying oh. this morning before the show, this would be the most beautiful bangle to wear on your wedding day. Oh, absolutely. Oh, wow. Beautiful white um, uh, kind of glossiness. And they look amazing together, I think. Yeah, they really do. Yeah. They really do look beautiful together. They're gorgeous. Love them. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Good luck to every single Aww. one of you. We only had double figure stock to start with. One nine nine. Good luck. Good luck to everyone that wants oh to own this, gosh. that is in the queue, that has it in their basket. One nine nine is the deal right now. One hundred and eighty carats. The Branca Agua Onyx. This unbelievable top water, translucent, transparent, natural Brazilian Onyx. Split payments of under fifty pounds. Oh, let me just tell you, I'm not done. What? Yeah, I'm not done. I just wanted to give you uh, an idea of how, how ludicrous these deals no. will be for you this morning. Nowhere near them. Oh my gosh. So, Ron, Pauline, Maker multi buying, uh, Greater London multi buying, Essex multi buying, Gloucestershire multi buying. We only have 85. I'm still not done. Um, if you are, are looking to be successful this morning, you're going to have to start being quick. If it's in your basket, it's time to check out because right now, this legendary, wonderful, translucent, transparent onyx, natural oh onyx bangle is still nowhere near the final price. I can't believe, I genuinely can't believe this. And this, and you know what, these split payments are giving people access to this yes. material. The only opportunity you're probably ever gonna get to get a Branca Onyx bangle on For Jewelry sure. Maker. Yeah. This is so, well, this and the other one, obviously. So exciting. I can't believe this, you know, this is gonna, we're going lower than 199. Yeah, let's, this time I'm gonna be kind. I'm gonna get, this is my final deal coming. I'm gonna give you a minute clock. Okay. I don't know if the stock will last that long, but I am going to give you a minute before I, I call the final price. Those of you that know me, you know I'm not taking 10 or 20 pounds off. 
This is going to be a big, big crash. This is your chance, your moment. Um, we're giving you every, and, and you're still going to have a split pair. We're giving you every opportunity to get involved this morning. The amount of people coming through, Susie, is just is just absolutely it superb. It looks like wind as well, doesn't it? I it's can't sorry. believe the price. At, you know, it yeah, looks even at like that price, it's incredible. It's amazing. You know, when you think what bangles cost. Yeah, any bangle. And and yeah. and as you were saying, it's the million. You know, if this was Jade, the million yeah. dollar bangle. That's oh, sure. this is the one, isn't it? Yeah. Goodness me, less than 30 seconds, we're taking the price point down one final time. Geraldine, uh, more... Let's borrow the clicking area. I just want to show well you done. what black onyx bangles cost. Oh, just, yes. Just black nice. onyx oh, bangles. So this is hinge, right? So only half of it is black onyx. Beautiful Thousands. piece. Uh, or 550 pounds, Kate Young, oh, gemstone bangle. Like Eight, and it's, you know, gold overlay, so it's not yeah. solid gold. Nice. Then you've got this one here. Now, this is Boucheron. Beautiful. Uh, you've got the onyx and coral, uh, diamonds as well, 5,600 euros. Yours today, 149. Yeah. Good luck. This is going to sell well out, but we have one more coming up um, for double figures. I'm letting everyone know the next one will be in double figures. This is your crazy <laughs> showcase to join us for. I told you it was going to be you know, fast. I told you it was going to be competitive. A lot of multi buyers. Why not when the deal's this good? You still have split pay, 37 pound, 25 pence. Victoria, Sandra, oh. someone trying to buy four, someone trying to buy two. We've got Essex, yep. we've got Gloucestershire, we've got Yi Mei, you're there as well. Um, your opportunity is before you take advantage, get these whilst you can. Victoria's got five in this is, wow. this, is well up and, uh, uh, this is the lowest price. Yeah, I've ever done for a bangle. Bangle. No. We Absolutely. have ever done. I mean, other than maybe, you know, an agate bangle, um, you know, a dyed agate bangle. This is the lowest price bangle we have ever done. Those split payments, Susie, are less than £40 today. That it is, is unbelievable. Believable. I can't believe that. It's absolutely amazing. But it just sits uh, amongst, you know, the, the jade when you're thinking, oh, I can't remember, that was like 799 or whatever. Um, look, just. Can you pop that on, Donna? But it just looks, uh, you know, can you tell there's a completely different price band <gasps> with, with those? You can't. Look. No, they all look as look. luxurious and beautiful as each other. Isn't that Susie, beautiful? it looks amazing. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely Any tips for wearing it. this? Would you wear this with the J bangles, um, or would you yeah. wear it on its own? You, you maybe? could, but um, what I will say is that when you're wearing uh, bangles, they're not going to scratch each other, so you're absolutely fine. But just when you store them, don't put them with anything with diamonds or anything, because that will scratch. That will scratch so it. Just yes, put them in a little good pouch. tip. When you when, when you put take them off, absolutely phenomenal. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. Um, Anna, I can see you there. You've just come through to get this. Well done to everyone. This okay, is guys, let's. Um, who wants to do something absolutely monumental? Well, we've already done that, Dave. Right? How many do we have left? We had eighty-five. I want to know. Okay, thirty-one. So over fifty oh, of you gosh. have already got this. I'm going to take a massive chunk off. I said the other one would be in double figures. No. How would you no. Like how would you like this one in double figures? No. 30, someone got five, someone else has got three. How about we do that? Would you like to, to own 180 carats of the Branca Agua natural? Yes. Onyx bangle, top yes. crystal, you've heard the pitch, you've seen the light passing through it. Yes. You want it in double figures? Please. Then we're going to do it. Let's do a minute clock, Ollie. Uh, let's break the phone lines. Let's break some records. If anyone joined me next That's... door for the launch of the Branca Agua, which You're is a taking... smaller carat weight. Yeah, wow. yeah. 50 pounds off the oh, price. Oh, yeah. We're going double figures, guys. You've only got 30 opportunities, though. You've got 46 seconds. It oh, might sell out that time. Time to multiply. It should never happen. Everything on that screen that our wonderful producer, Neri, is looking at is red right now. Can I just say, Dave, and, and this, is, I'm gen this is not part of the plan. This this is not planned. No. No, this I is not planned. I swear to God, this is not part of the plan. Then it has gone <laughs> bonkers. Dave, oh This is oh what gosh. we do, we're live. And I always say, if we're live, then let's one, do something maybe live. One, two, nine. I know, what I, are you forget doing? one, two, nine. Forget, I, I agree with you, Carol, but let's, let's just go wild, let's go crazy, which is also gonna affect the price of the next bangle. Of course next it bangle, is, yeah. As Carol knows, you want to know the plan? The next bangle was meant to be 99 pounds. Absolutely. Pound. It's insane, it's crazy, everyone's gonna get it. It's a double figure oh, bangle for the nine, first time ever. Not today, done. this is it, you ready? <laughs> do it, do it, take 50 quid off. Good luck, wow. just go wild. We've got 22 He's chances. Got, you gotta no. do it. Neary's saying he doesn't. Neary's like, He's, you don't have to do it. He doesn't want you genuinely, to do it. Genuinely. Yeah. yeah. 
Wow. Everything on his going? screen is red. He might be. <laughs> Wayne's <laughs> red. Like everything's red. Wow. Anne's got two. Lynn's got two. Cumbria's got three. Somerset's got two. Kent's got five. Oh my Somerset, gosh. Greater wow. London, Yorkshire, Dorset. Cardiff, you've just got two. Nottingham. If you're not buying two, I don't know what's going on. Locking that that cool screen needs to look like Noah's Ark. Two by two by two, doesn't it? <laughs> We've got... Valerie's got three. That's a good one, Dave. Do you know what? And I'll tell you who else is red. Rumpelstiltskin oh, is red. Oh, he's jumping up and down. He is imagine. incensed. He's like a beetroot right now. Dave, you were selling jade archer rings for £99. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Go. And, 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 and uh, how incredible were they yeah, at that well, price? £99, amazing. I this is £99. Pounds. It's insane. I might get sacked. I might get taken off air. Well, we're right. never going to be able to bring this back to air. Uh, this is... Thank God. We, we know we can't anyway. So they might, imagine if they reach out to me and say, we've got we to close out. I'll be like, we're not way? interested, mate. We don't know how oh, many well are left. Done. We don't know how many are left. So please, I'll um, I think it, I think it's probably sold out, but we don't. I, yeah, yeah well it's done. got to have done. How many, how many people do we have on the phone lines for this, Neri? How many in baskets? 51 in baskets and we've got yeah. eight left. The, the, I can guarantee if we had a live feed to our call centre oh, upstairs right now, our contact centre, it would look like a Wall Street trading <laughs> floor, wouldn't it? Yeah. Like, a, like on an IPO, like something going crazy, yeah. that papers flying everywhere, that tube shoot thing, I don't know oh, what yeah, that that's is. that's amazing. I love that. They lock thing. it in, yeah. <laughs> that's very 80s, yeah. yeah. That's why they didn't have Beautiful. computers. Um, I think I yeah. wish we could go back to those days though. So do, yeah. Can we get one here? I don't know what it would be, but it's uh, yeah, pretty cool. I don't know what it would be. A bit of well, drama. So like you have that thing back to the vault. <laughs> That's the noise. Great sound Something effects. like that, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what they're called. Um, but that would be cool. Yeah. And anyway. then we could also bring back the '80s mobile phone. Yeah, absolutely. When we do, a, when we have a tea oh, caller, God. that big brick thing. Oh yeah, love with that. the aerial, the yeah. carrying aerial. the battery. Yeah, I want that. I want that. Six left, we think. We don't know. We think. I don't know. Well, Jenny's just taken two. I'd 20. Split, mate, 24 75. Oh. We're a bangle. It's less than a takeaway, yeah. that is. That's just incredible. Mm. Um, so, look, split pay is interest free. I think can I'm, we at I'm, least charge interest on it? Well, no. Like, can we yeah. at least do that? No. Like, giving no interest. Come on. Really well, good. actually, do you know what, Dave? And you can tell, and, and Susie, you can tell how ridiculous this price is, and you can tell how low we've gone because there's four split payments. You only have four split payments something when something is, is going to be over oh, yeah. a certain When you need amount. them. Yeah. Yeah. 99 yeah. quid is not a and four split You said split it's less payment. than a takeaway. Imagine that. Can I, can I pay for this in split payments, please? There's been like your pizza <laughs> order. Interest free. Over the next four months, perhaps? Imagine. There's been split payments on bangles. <laughs> for more than the price oh, yeah. of this bangle. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> oh, God. And I tell you what, if Domino's did offer split payment, oh they, would, gosh, they would deliver it Don't. after the, the last split payment, wouldn't they? Yeah, probably. They wouldn't give it you before. <laughs> yeah, it would be yeah. cold. <laughs> Coldy mould pizza. <laughs> Good luck. Right. Um, this one's double figures, but we're going, well, to, we're going off well, strips like, again. You've ruined that now, yeah. Dave, haven't you? Um, anyway. So the, how many of these do we have, Neary? <laughs> 99, 98. 99, 98. 98. Because she's, she's going to definitely not 90, 99. Actually, Susie's, Susie's got 10. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Two. We've got two left. I've been told off about two. Oh, Susie, don't listen to them, Don't, yeah. Come on, love. But the thing is, Susie, I don't, I don't mind because you genuinely, you understand yeah, yeah, exactly. the value I love of what it. you're getting. <laughs> but she does buy everything, I have to say. <laughs> I mean, that's good, though, isn't it? When your own staff are your biggest customers, you know yeah, it's good. That's literally exactly. unstoppable. Yeah. Yeah. That's, and that's she used the... to do this kind of under the desk or wait till, yeah, sorry, no, wait no, till be, she was out of be, shot. Let's be out. No, let's be no, open no. about it she's now. She's got she... her phone out right Sometimes there. she just walks off straight into the call centre and <laughs> I love that she, she's on, she, she's during the masterclass. You, know? <laughs> you should be demoing, Susan. Yeah. Uh, look um, at that. Yeah, know. this oh. is supreme. Let's bring the graphics in straight away. How many do we have? 99. 99 of these. This was meant to be 99 pounds. Guess what? We're going to go lower. Put it to where? Yeah, this was meant to be oh, the most nice. important uh, kind of you know showpiece event. It was meant to be like, guys, for the first oh, time ever, a, a bangle with it's double figures. Like that, yeah. This is it, multi buy time. I'm going lower than 99.99 because we have to because we just absolutely destroyed the price. I, in the I can't now. When you're carving how is something, this? Like... Susie's still not even the first person on the phone. Oh, like, that's how highly I know. anticipated that's how busy this it is. is. Like Susie's the third person, third person to confirm, three. and she had the a phone ready. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, I um. Wow. I busy. cannot even begin to imagine 
how high the stakes are when you're carving a bangle oh. with, this. with this dimension. Yeah, I mean, there's no room for error. No. There's literally no room so for error. Delicate. It's um, so delicate. I've never seen a bangle like this. It's not even in jade. Look, I don't know if you have, Susie. No, but not this, this well, the, fine. Not the, this Christmas, fine. the Christmas Day one we did was finer, yeah. but nothing like that's this. That's the finest I've ever seen. Yeah, that's that kind was of, the Olmec. Oh, that's incredible. Um, OK, I'm, I'm going to do what we should do, which is 99.99. Let's start there. Let's go 99.99, and then we'll figure out between us what on earth we can do. You'll have to ring Wayne or something. We're going to put 99.99 on the screen, and I'm going to tell you... We have to call you, someone. Yeah, I'm going to tell you right now we're going lower, even though we absolutely shouldn't, OK? This was the big deal of the day. This was the one that was going to shock everyone. And... Uh, well, we this was going to be the first ever bangle that we'd done for under figures, £100. Yeah. We've, yes. we, we've played that card now. We've yes. played that card. And the split pay, well done. We've got split pay too, great. Yeah. Cool, so we are going to go lower. We've just got to figure it out. Um, we have 99 of these. I'd be, I'd, be part of this, I'd be part of this right now. I'd be part of this. I'd be on the phone lines. I'd be with it in my basket. I'd be checking out is the reality. Half the stock's gone. Okay, we are going lower. Don't worry about that. And um, we're not just going to take £10 off. That's not how we do it. Margaret, Veronica, Tricia, Neris, uh, is that Neris or is that Neary? Just in there, just yeah. multi-buying away. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. But Neris in Bristol, Maker, Maker in Nottinghamshire, Julie, Heather in Kent, Linda in Nottinghamshire, Leslie. <clears throat> um, yeah, half the stock's gone. Right, let's, let's do a minute plot and let's just... It's like, uh, like Band-Aid, isn't it? Or a plastic. But the thing is... a Band-Aid. Uh, but the thing is, though, I don't think that... that the, most, the most kind of worrying thing about this one-minute clock... Look at that. ..is that... Dave doesn't know what price we're I, I genuinely don't, I'll be I honest. Don't know. I'm, I, in no a minute, one knows. When, when this minute expires, I'm actually going to go physically into the gallery and speak to Neri because at the minute, I'm guessing he's messaging our sales manager, Wayne. Yep. Just saying, Dave's messed things up. This could be crazy. Tom's panicking, is he? Okay, so he's panicking, yeah. What, yeah, it just, yeah. Um, well, congratulations to everyone coming through to get this. Um, no. Your guess is as good as mine with regards to what price we're going to. We've got, you know, the plan has gone out the window. But that's the great thing. And seriously, we are... By the way, are... this is our rock bottom. This was us... Look, we, we planned to bring the bangle, the first bangle, an incredible deal. And then we were just going to make sure that anyone who missed out, because we knew it would be oversubscribed, had the opportunity to get this. And that's why I said, the first things first, don't worry, this one will be in double figures. Yeah. Mm. OK, can, sorry, uh, Ollie. can I just have another minute clock? I'm just going to go in there. But um, I, we're going to go lower. I just don't know what I can do But this do is it. Here. We're live. You know, it we're live. live. We have to be Thank reactive. Thank you. Guys. Beautiful. Look He's at literally it. walking out the studio now. We're all on our own, Susie. Oh, I mean... This has <clears> such <throat> a glow to it as well, doesn't it? Such a glow. Yeah. Lovely. Beautiful. It really is. Now, what will, you be, will you be wearing it separately? Will you be wearing it with well, the other one? I will be probably wearing this when I go, if I'm wearing anything black, I'm probably going to be wearing my white jade and then my Branca Onyx on yeah. one arm. So I'll wear those two together. Yeah, absolutely. I'm, 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 I'm trying to, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this and I'm trying to work out what kind of a price point I think this, this, you know, oh, We've had no response from Wayne. <laughs> we've had no, I'll be honest, we've had no response from Wayne. He's gone offline. He, I don't know where he is. Uh. We're worried about him. Um, what are you going to do? We, been, this, I'll, I'll be honest, I'll be I'm, genuinely honest. We do have a system um, that will tell us like, you know, what, what, we're, what we're comfortable with and whatever. We're already at the, the lowest, right? That's the point. So now anything after this is just like, what, what are we willing to, to do? And we would hope to have some kind of insight from a sales manager to say, OK, well, this is a loss leader, it's a promotional deal or whatever, but he's not answering, and that's fine. Um, <laughs> he's busy. Um, I'm just going to call a price then that I feel like is in a... I'm not going to just take a little bit off. We are going to do something really, really monumental. You're going to have to be extremely fast. We have less than 50 of these available. We started with 100. 69.99. Yeah. I can't believe it. I genuinely can't. I'm pretty sure we've sold reed diffusers for that next door. I, I, I think we have. Candle or something, we definitely have. Yeah. That's amazing because 99.99 was a fantastic price. 99.99. 69.99. Wow. Mm -hmm. That is a career wow. ending price yeah. right there. That yeah. is unbelievable. And yeah. when you say, when you put I don't mind it though. I think that works on my CV in a way. Like it would be worse if my career ender was like, 
you know, some, some costume malfunction on live TV or, um, you know, an expletive coming out on live TV, like a career ender of just giving everyone an amazing deal. Yeah. I'll take that. Yeah. I'll take that. I cannot believe this price. That's si good. Si 69 pounds, 99 pence. Individual. Sorry, the reason why I put it on here is. I love how calm Susie is because she's was, already got it. I, I love, we're there losing our minds. And I just heard Susie just go, that's really good. I, I put it on here because I was trying to signal to Neary a price point which no I thought was going to be a sensible price point. It, it wasn't 69 um, It was actually 79 99 I was trying to go 7 9 just to see yeah, if we could. Yeah, no. sure. Try and 60, talk through code. Yeah. Oh, 69.99. I cannot believe that. That is un. Okay, we've, we've got 20 chances left. Um, there's a lot of you there. Lovely. Obviously, we can't go anywhere else on price. I want you to be successful. I want you to be part of this deal. We have gone one too. We've, we've gone far too low. You can hear that. It's lovely. Two bangles no, for 170 pounds. That's a joke. That is a joke when you say it like that. Yeah. There is you that go. right? Oh yeah, because we went double <laughs> figures on the first one. Yes, we, yes, Dave, we did. That was your I love the bangles. decision. You get that lovely. Okay. Um, Let's do a clock to end this auction, to end this madness. <laughs> Let's do the minute clock to end this madness right now. Thank you. Um, I don't know how many we have left. Try it. Be, be in with Jeez. an opportunity, be in with a chance. Good luck. Well Samantha, done. Samantha, Kevin, Maker, Derbyshire, Barbara, June, Yi Mei, Maker, <laughs> Teresa, Keith, Lydia, all the way from Pennsylvania, uh, Janice in Greater London, Elaine in well County done. Down. Good luck. Well done to every one of you. Congratulations. So excited. Mm -hmm. So wonderful for all of you. Look at everybody. Look at that oh, well full done. screen. Look at everyone who said yes. People buying fours, yeah. twos. I mean, just wow. Amazing. Unbelievable opportunity. Well done, guys. Now, um, we've got... Oh, gosh. 20 seconds, and we're taking the details away. Yeah. Look at all the friends you've That's made, right. Dave, That's says Margot. Right. Thank you, Margot. That's exactly That's it. Fine. That's exactly it. Um, well done. You've, we've literally got just a couple of chances available. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's lovely, amazing. Catherine. And yeah, that's what makes it all worthwhile. When you just hear someone say, I didn't think I'd be able to afford it, or I didn't yeah. think I'd be able to own this, and you know, you're like, you've woken up, you tuned in, and it's live. And that's what I say, you always tune into live TV because anything can happen. We, we, are, we are planning things but it's unscripted and we're not afraid to, to do things like this from time to time and we've just done it there. We are going to do something equally as ludicrous because we have to, you know, we've set the tone and we have a Branca Onyx Strand, a monumental, incredible carrot weight coming your way and I'm going to do you an incredible, wow. incredible deal. Look, Look at, at the that. size of this. This is one of the largest strands of Branca Onyx we have ever done. Yes. Um, look at that carrot weight, yes. 480 carats. Right, who wants this in double figures then? <laughs> wow. Why not? The Wilma. Why not? Flintstone. <laughs> Wilma Flintstone, absolutely huge. Who wants this? I've only got, I've got less than 30. Who wants this? I'm about to do something oh, wow. crazy, guys. Uh, 480 carats. So we're talking, I'm going to do it in double figures. I mean, obviously, you know, a different, a different, you know, we're not talking about the same kind of thing here. You know, this is this is a, a bangle, yeah. bangle. This is a strand, but quality is exactly Neary, the same. Let's just but get carrot it. weight. 99.99. Let's go there. I'm not done. Let's just get it on though. I've got less than 30. Oh, we shouldn't be doing that. No, we shouldn't. Uh, but we have set the tone. Well done to Buckinghamshire. You've just come in and taken three. That's. Wow. 1,500 carats, I swear, essentially. when we first started oh, bringing these strands to wear, they were 200, pounds. 300 yeah. pounds, yeah. Dave, yeah. I was paying, yeah, I bought them when they first yeah, came yeah. to wear. I know. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Jenny, Victoria, Suzanne, maker in Buckinghamshire's got three. Neris, 30 second clock, one. and we'll just go crazy. We'll do wow. it for everyone. It's a beautiful gemstone. Well, it is. and this is still the Agua material. Yeah. Um, if, you've got the, if you want to put the torch through it as well. Yeah, then, yeah. most definitely. This, the, this isn't the opaque material that we will be seeing over the next few months. This is the transparent, translucent, top water material that we're talking about. It glows. I love this shape. This I shape, love the yeah. size. 480 carats. This shape as a guru Whoa. bead in your, oh, in your wow. malachite. Yeah, in my the, um, God. Oh, no way. Gosh, That's yeah. happening oh, live. Oh, wow. Beep. That's happening yeah. live. Lights on. Wow. Lights off. Absolutely. 79.99. Crazy. Let's do it. Let's yeah. do it. 
you've got a chance. I mean, there's a lot of multi buys, but you do have that chance. It's available <laughs> to every one of you. Oh my gosh. Let you know, that as soon as we saw it, it's going double figures. It's going to be one of those crazy, crazy moments. Trisha, Julie, Lanarkshire, Maker, Neris, wow. Jenny, Victoria, Susan. Lanarkshire has now got two. Susan, Maker, and Buckinghamshire has got three. Suji are there. Alison, Nuno, you want to get three of these. Ron, uh, intense, it. well done. Unbelievable opportunity. That is a race to the finish. Look, we've got um, single figures left. Is that right, Neary? Minute clock to close yeah, this one out. Minute clock left. to close it. Let's get this gone. It's incredible. Absolutely amazing. I can't believe. And the buzz over this gemstone is yeah. just incredible. It, it, it's just absolutely wonderful. I've got Susie just saying to me, I love this stone. I love this stone. Yeah. And it is, it is an exceptional stone. I mean, I don't know about you, Susie. I'm looking at this and I'm thinking they're all individual uh, guru beads. Yeah, or uh, like... Or, uh, your or, or just a... Uh, pendant, like it's like this baroque yeah. shaped pendant. Yeah. Drop earrings. Oh my gosh! Wow, beautiful. Which which Half one are we doing next, Neary? No, 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 no. One of them is a barrel. One okay. of them is a rice. Yeah. The barrel. Okay, so slightly smaller barrels coming up. You've got 20 seconds. Look at everyone coming through. Are you sure you want to do this, Neri? Because um, you know what we're about today. You know, we know what everyone's expecting. We're setting we the. Can't precedence. just go back to the old prices. Not today. Um, it is just Suze about... Susie's literally thrusting the <laughs> strand of it. Play the strand. I, I, and I love the fact that Susie's like, she's mic'd up, but she forgets that. And she's like whispering, like the barrel. <laughs> she's lit yeah, that's it. She's whispering. Like, we can't hear her. Do this one. Do this one. Yeah, uh, we have a mic, like, six centimetres away from her mouth. And she's like, the barrel. It's Barrel, like please. gorgeous Sheila, gorgeous oh, thank Sheila you so Davies. Much, Sue. That's very you just kind. used to put a hand over the microphone. We can still hear you, Sheila. Yeah. You've got your microphone on, you know. To... No, that and and also, help. even if you switch it off, Sheila, I've got mine on. <laughs> <laughs> You're talking to me. Oh, bless uh, But whatever, we love it. Um, um, right, next one is, uh, thank Barrel, you so much, oh, Sue, Sue, in Edinburgh. And, and the fact is, Sue, it's natural. Yeah. Which is just... Now, this, this reminds beautiful. me of the finest grade mutton fat. Because with yes. mutton fat jade, uh, if you, you've got the book, haven't you, Susan? Oh, I have. It's when beautiful. you read about it, it has a yellow creaminess tinge yeah. to it. Or yeah. should do. Would you, would you say, would wow. you say that this is to mutton fat what chrysoprase is to imperial jade? As in, you get that look. Yes. It's got the glow. Yes. And it, it's got the glow and you go, oh, gosh, I just, that, that, just to have a portion Yeah, and also, I'd look. go even further, I'd say, what mutton fat is to jade, this material is to onyx. That's yeah. the, oh, what I mean. Okay. Yeah, so well, that's a, it's that's the a much better it's the way top, of saying it. It's think. the most incredible, yeah. credible uh, uh, grade you can achieve. Yes. And we've got it here, 250 carats. This is going to be... How many of these do we have, Neri? 26. All right. Oh, gosh, these are tiny. So let's ones. start this time at 79. Oh, wow. And I'm not done. Do you know, I love this shape. It reminds me of a Tic Tac. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's so tactile. If they, if they were Tic Tacs, though, you'd probably get two in one of those boxes. Yeah, yeah so that's if probably that, it. They wouldn't fit in the box. That's how yeah. large they are. They're so impressive. Oh, Again, you've got that transparency. It is the Branca Agua. Look at that look quality. At that. I've only got 26 of these guys. You saw how quick the other one sold out. I'm not done here. 30 second clock, please, Ollie. Oh, um, wow. And we're going to absolutely destroy the price. 28 seconds. Utterly brilliant. Things well are happening done. this morning that have never happened before, that none of us ever envisaged happening. None of us saw coming, including me and Susie and Carol. We didn't even know this was happening this morning. So when you're messaging going, I didn't think this would happen this morning. Neither did we. This is live TV. This is us just doing the, the, the crazy deals. Um, and it's going to continue. This is all the same grade. We're not bringing the lower grade in the same show as the Agua. This is all what we would call Branca Agua. And even just, I'm going to call a price, don't worry. But if you could show that recording again, Ollie, it, if you can it, see the transparency in that recording. If yeah. you do the price I think you're going to do, Dave, it's yeah. going to be the lowest price we've ever done for Branca Onyx. Well, you're really putting me in a corner there, aren't you? <laughs> if you do it, Dave, if you do it, it's going to be the lowest <laughs> price ever. But if you don't, that's what we thought you was going to do, isn't it? Forty nine ninety nine. There you go. Yes. You've bullied me into it, and it's great for every one of you at home. I love this. Uh, if you do it, Dave, it could be the lowest price ever. But if you don't, that's cool too. That's you are fine. literally Cheryl Baker, Chris Akabusi. You are a record breaker we are today. today. Roy we are. Castle. You are a record breaker. Yeah. And, and, and let's, well, we're all celebrating that right now, but upstairs they're not. They're like, no, they're yeah. going, what is he doing? They're egging him on. Carol's telling me he's a record breaker. <laughs> this is it. Transparent Victoria is multi buying. All of you should multi buy. Look at the split page, 24 dollars yeah, That's amazing. This is absolutely 
the best deals we've ever done. We never meant to do it, but it's so fun to see so many of you on the phone lines. It's amazing to be part of shows like this every once in a while that are just out there crazy. 60 second clock to end this auction because we only started with 26. Um, I'm going to bring you one more as well and we're going to destroy the price on that one as well. Go on, Lovie. But you're desperate to say something. Go on. What is it? Go on. The angel light this morning, you know, the green angel light this morning with this. How beautiful. Oh, what? The vivid yes. green? The vivid green yeah, angel light. Wow. Absolutely. Or, or your Chrysler praise kit from yeah. a couple of weeks Oh, ago. yeah. Definitely. Tell, and, and also, if, if yeah. you're, you should as well tune in for the masterclass, which is where um, yes. Susie's going to show you working with this material. That is it, a mala. It's a mala. Right. And I've never. I don't know the mala. I hear the term a lot, like guru oh. beads, mala. I'll teach yes. you all about. I don't know what they are. Oh, oh gosh. So it's I great to be able to see. This is a traditional yeah. mala. That this one. Is your, this is your guru. The button. Yeah. Oh, yeah, great. and that is 108 this is... beads. This one's got three marker beads. Wow. So you're going to see how to create all of this, and, yep. and obviously you guys will have all of this material that you can additionally, you know, kit out other bits of jewelry yeah. to go with the pieces that you're going to create alongside Susie. You've got six seconds. This is gone. It's out of here. 24.99 on interest-free split payments. Oh, brilliant. Wow. Right. Excellent. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, what it's do we do? Beautiful. Okay. What do we do? Oh, oh. Okay, we do have other strands. You can... Right. I can just shout a price, but I, I have to leave now, uh, which I apologise for. But Nira, if you're going to carry this on, you better carry on the crazy we're gonna see, deals. We're going to see you on Sunday. We are. Sunday, uh, me and Carol uh, are so excited. Oh, my gosh. Uh, Susie, you, you've been excited about it She's as well. She's going to be shopping. I know. Yeah. Oh, black be... I've bought all the black jade you've bought to her so far. <laughs> yeah, you haven't multiple. seen anything yet. You wait until Sunday. It's going to be the most incredible. Yeah. I've never seen like excitement like it. We've seen a lot of Jade. We get excited a yeah. lot because it, we love what we do. But when I came into the building this morning, I was speaking to Carol, I was speaking to Susie, I was speaking to Neary, and they were showing me how they've recorded, what they look Amazing. like. Yeah. It's going to be a show not to be missed. Even, and I'll say this to you, even if you're not tuning in to shop or to buy or to, to whatever, I want you to see this jade. That's it. That's amazing. good enough for me. I just want you to see it because we've been working so long on it. That will be Sunday. This is an incredible deal. Um, how many of these have you got, Neary? Because I've got to shoot. 31. All right, 49.99. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Double figures. Yeah. See you Sunday. Susie, lovely to see you. Lovely Carol, to see you. Lovely, to see you. lovely to see you guys as well. I'll see you on Sunday. 50 quid. 50 quid. 50 quid. Oi, oi. Lads, lads, lads. There you go. Um, now, whatever you use these with, if you've got the black spinel rice beads we did the other week, did you see the black spinel rice? Really yes. elongated. You've got to use them Beautiful. with these. Beautiful. Absolutely. There you go. You've got to use them with these. Absolutely beautiful. $49.99. Unbelievable prices. Unbelievable deals. And exactly oh, the same quality. The quality is with beautiful. That Marla, with that marla. Oh. With that marla. I just this just it. goes with every single gemstone that you could ever have. Fantastic. It's got an inner glow, which is what I love about it. And I don't think that another kind of treated stone you'd necessarily get that the fact that this no. is natural it just brings yeah. it to life doesn't it it's just gorgeous it's yeah this shape is so beautiful it is directional beautiful. it's very slender it's very sleek it's just gorgeous and it just i don't know it, it, it is just a really pleasing shape to look at it's beautiful isn't it 49.99 split payments of 24.99 well done Look, we've got 10 chances available. That's it. Valerie, Diane, Muriel, Jenny, Veronica, Janice, well done to you, my lovely. Loads and loads and loads of people coming through at 49.99. It's going. It's going to sell out today. Well done to everyone. Absolutely beautiful. Um, now, we do have, are we going to be playing these now, Neary, or do you want to... Okay, right. So we've got some rounds coming up now. Now, look at these, Susie. Look at these. Beautiful. This is going to give you the chance to... Make those graduated pieces, isn't it? Absolutely so beautiful. Yeah, there are so much you can do with it, um, with with all of these. Would you graduate them? Would you get them all and do some graduated? Yeah, or why not? Them? Yeah, absolutely. Just do a graduated necklace. I'd be mixing my my jade with it, so I'd be putting red, yellow, green. I'd do a multicoloured jade necklace with that. Yeah, beautiful. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I think when you've got a um, when you've got a gem which has got this level of kind of um, ooh, neutral about it, putting it with something like your jades yeah. is an absolutely perfect pairing. Um, Shop and take a breath. Um, can I ooh. just show... 
Oh, look, look, sorry, just very quickly, this is the black spinel rice bead strand I was just talking about. Oh, my look word. Look at oh. those. Drop the mic. Look <laughs> at that. Wow, look at that for a piece of jewellery. And Susie, that could be the simplest, most uh, restranded necklace. Yeah. That's going to look so expensive. That's Chanel. It is. So, so high end. Oh, what a lovely idea. Yeah. So we're going to play this black spinel now. Yeah. Come on, we may as well. We may as well. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Black well, and white. Well, yeah. Yin black and, and white. yang. Yin yang. Yin yang. Black Flip and flop. There we go. What do you call... <laughs> what do you call a French... <laughs> what do you call a French man in sandals? Philippe Fallop. <laughs> She's been at the Christmas oh, I just, you know, <laughs> all the jokes today. All the jokes. Look at that. It's beautiful. Is that the price, Neary? That sounds very low. Ready? $29.99 for your black spinel rice wow. beads. Jenny's got two. This, by yes. the way is Burmese black spinel. Um, these are the biggest pieces we have ever, ever, ever. This is absolutely amazing, Victoria. And we're not done. Apparently we're not done. Um, absolutely amazing. Um, because of the way gemstones form out in Burma and particularly the Magok Valley, it's very, very um, rich in uh, granite, which makes the gemstone in, um, which makes the gemstone um, more protected. Uh, granite is really impermeable and it basically protects any gemstone from other elements which might discolor it or lessen or dilute the color. So you get a very rich, very true, very powerful saturated tone with pretty much all of your Burmese gemstones, be it ruby, sapphire, tourmaline, spinel. And so that's why you get such incredible quality. Gives you that black diamond quality. It's absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous quality. Well done. Victoria's got two. Well done to you. Wow. Beautiful. Maker in County Antrim. Well done to you. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Those well in done. between. Those in oh. between. Look, just Look. those in between. Ooh, simple. Beautiful. Why Massive dog? 12 black mil. Yeah, black and white's so lovely, isn't goes it? goes with everything. <clears throat> Looks so Chanel, isn't it? it so really Chanel. Is. Coco Chanel. Amazing. Look at this. And she famously made lots of, you know, made kind of black, very, very um, fashionable yeah. um, up until, up until then, really, I think, I think black for a long time was attributed with mourning um, because of the, you know, um, Queen Victoria had that very, very, you know, decades worth of mourning, bless her, when, when after Prince mm -hmm. Albert died. Um, and Chanel started off making dresses well she i think the she nuns. grew up in a monastery didn't that's she right. She used the nuns habits to make dresses <laughs> exactly which of course right. were all black. black um which is why things like her beautiful famous kind of box boxy kind of dresses and those little short beautiful yeah, she's famous box for now, jackets yeah. you can just imagine them being made made out of you know yeah, habits, habits almost it's just beautiful um what's an incredible history what an amazing life um 12 mil rounds, absolutely beautiful. Uh, Neris, we've got Anne, we've got lovely Susan in Essex as well. 99.99 with a 30 second clock. <clears throat> absolutely amazing, well done to everyone. Um, lots of people coming through, lots of people um, uh, enjoying the uh, uh, Branca beautiful. White Onyx. Totally natural quality you're gonna be getting here. We are so lucky to have these pieces we really genuinely are and I don't know who was it mentioned earlier on was it you Ollie it might have been you Susie mentioned uh, multicolor cord if you put multicolor cord with something like this you're going to yeah, see that absolutely kind of, come through yeah but I'd use these in the same way I'd use pearls so all the designs that you do for pearls you can replicate these I'd have strands of these yeah like Chanel uh, oh yes well that's it and at these kind of prices 59.99 with the best one in the world on a, on a big long line necklace, how many 12 mils are you going to use? I'd probably only use five, maybe yeah. seven. 
it's the smaller ones I'd use more. Yeah, exactly. Because otherwise it's going to be a very heavy, heavy piece. But you're absolutely right. Do these kind of ropes and ropes, ropes. of, and you, you know. And you can do some with ropes, some <clears throat> with a chain. Just mix it all absolutely. up. Absolutely. Well, much like your nine o'clock necklace, yeah. actually, just a longer version, version. of that. Um, that is such a good look. And it's a timeless look. It's not one of these kind of trend looks which yeah. you know people wear for you know a year you know some you know some of the some of the trends you know only last for kind of you know a year or so or maybe or maybe you know and that's a good thing like shell suits um you know they last you know they don't last forever um but that kind of look that you're describing Susie that is a timeless look it is and easier to wear because you can with all jewelry you should always it should be the last thing you put on but if you accidentally put a bit of perfume on it or rub perfume rubs on a on off it. It's not going to affect this as it would say with pearls. That's gorgeous. Well done. So there you're wow, 12 mils. Beautiful. Faceted ovals of the black spinel. Do you want to show that one, Susie? Oh, yes. Oh, they're beautiful. I love oh, these. Oh, now, when oh. we bought these to wear the other day, we were saying, they're wouldn't gorgeous. these be, don't they remind you of kind of cameos? Oh, right. Yeah. Kind of the backdrop beautiful. of a cameo. That lovely plain kind of plate the plain kind of plate that you're getting of, of, of on top and then that beautiful faceted crown around the edge we didn't have to do that we, we could just li literally give you oval slices and it would be really lovely mm. i love that extra effort we've done uh, we've gone to sorry with that lovely faceted crown it gives you much more luster don't forget let's let's remind ourselves black spinel is a really close neighbor to um black diamonds they've got a very similar molecular structure and of course what that means is they give you a similar luster to a really good black diamond so a lot of the different cuts that we've tried out here on jewel excuse me jewelry maker the first gemstone we've tested them out on is a black spinel because what it does is it gives you the best possible luster of almost any gemstone out there. So any new cuts of the German cut saucers, the first gem we tried it out on was a black spinel because you do get that beautiful return of light from that lust from the surface. Six left, it's a tenner. That's, Ridic the price is wow. amazing. The black spinel, I love black spinel. 10 yes. mil white oh, onyx. Oh, oh, now we're getting into that cat, uh, that kind yeah. of ballpark of, ooh, I could use that as a bracelet as well as a necklace. Yeah. It's, but the quality, we're not, Look we're not, the whiteness it's of the that. same. Do you like the oh, bigger yeah. bracelets? Yeah, that is beautiful. <clears throat> that's really nice. Yeah. I'd want to use spacers. I'd either use a, either a black gemstone or, you know, you could alternate rose gold, yellow gold, silver, you know, do, you know, do whatever, whatever you fancy, really. Um, but what a look that gives you, that, that glow, that inner glow, that purity. Um, <clears throat> and just, um, just from a, a chakra point of view as well, and I'm not necessarily talking about the supposed properties of the gemstone, I'm just talking about the colour. That gem, it just, it, you can just feel, feel. yourself being it kind is, of lifted. It is, you can see that really epitomises the crown because not only is it white, but it has this inner glow, like an aura. Like an aura, yeah. Beautiful. And so it's not necessarily the gem, because when I think of onyx, I'd probably say, oh, it's quite a grounding stone, because I think of black onyx. But yeah. this is just, it just yeah. lifts. Yeah. Amazing. Um... <clears throat> Oh, Ollie, that's fantastic. Right. <clears throat> oh, beautiful. These are um, fantastic. Again, use the spaces in between the 10 mil. These are lovely. The 12 mil. These are lovely, lovely, lovely. Yeah, spacer, spacer, spacers. There you go. Oh, look at that. That's what... Absolutely oh, gorgeous. Um, I think as well, with black gemstones, with white gemstones, we're not dictating and saying this is a summer gem this mm. is a winter gem we're not saying that we're not in, we're not inhibiting your creativity as ollie's mm. just quite rightly said if you've got little multicolor seed beads put them as spaces in between this it'll yeah. look absolutely electric it'll look gorgeous um beautiful with pearls beautiful with tanzanite have you ever thought of black tanzanite lovely beautiful black with and blue yeah people always say I've always, I've, I've always kind of, I don't know whether people, you know, people say, oh, red and pink don't go together. Blue and black don't go together. Yeah, they, they, they absolutely really do. do. Yeah, they really do. 4 
That's an amazing deal for Genuine Black Smell. That's absolutely gorgeous, 4 dollars Lynn's got two, Ooh. Marva, Maker and Kim, well done to you. Right, okay. <laughs> Eight mil. Now we're on to the quintessential must have size. Yeah, the, the next three strands of Onyx are going, well, they're gonna sell out very, very quickly. It was at this point when we bought you these the other day that we said, gosh, that quality has just got better. It's just shifted. Not that the quality of the larger stuff is, 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 is no good, because it's absolutely beautiful. But it just seems that with the smaller sizes, it's almost like it's intensified that yeah. translucency. Good grief. Look at that necklace. Oh gosh. <clears throat> yeah, the mixture. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. That's your eight mil Milk. in action there with one of the beautiful barrel beads. There's your rice beads. And the spaces are just black seed beads. So clever. Mm. 20 seconds and we're taking the price down. Well, we're bringing you your price, I should say. Yeah, lovely tassel as well. It's really yeah. cute. Lovely, lovely tassel. Uh, London, Yorkshire, Angus, Hertfordshire, Greater London, Buckinghamshire, County Armagh, Greater London, Kent, Suffolk, Angus, well done, well done to you. Here we go, all the way down. Look at that on the screen now. That glows. That is absolutely that beautiful. That glows, yeah. $29.99, oh my gosh. Just shouts quality, beautiful. doesn't it? Just I think... Top quality. I don't think I've seen Branconic that white till today. Do you think that there, that in your collection there are must-haves, as in, you know, there are certain gemstones which, you know, will be your favourites. Yeah. But I think you could, all, you always need to have black and white gemstones in your collection. Absolutely. Not only for the chakra, but just to sort of place within your jewellery, because sometimes you need black will give it a punch and white will give it a punch. Mm. When we do the Marla Showcase, I'll show you some Marlas I've made and I've got some white with other colours that you might not think about. Nice, Always Lovely. handy to have. Very, very popular, variety, this one. Yeah. 29.99, so amazing. Um, also as well, and I don't know what this would look like, I would never have thought of putting this with like the clear quartz we had earlier on. But that would go well. I wonder what it would look like. It'd look lovely. <clears throat> yeah. Because you've both got, you know, got two colourless gemstones, mm. one with insatiable clarity, the other one yeah. with a glow on the inside. Uh, uh, tr try it out, see what happens. What's the worst that can happen? You make it, you don't like it, take it apart, oh. make something else. It's fine. But That's the beauty. You know the Merkabal quartz, just on the end of that? Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, that really would be in in incredible, wouldn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Look how many people in baskets. Goodness yeah, well me. Done. Joy's got three in her baskets. Oh, my what word. Get it, add it's it onto your order. Um, 30 seconds and we're, um, and we're taking the details away. Look, you've got 35 in baskets um, with only 20 seconds left to get this. Absolutely incredible. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. What a deal for you today at just 29 99 We've got two more slightly smaller strands of your Branca White Onyx. Amazing. Oh, we've had a lovely message through. Wow. Oh, how lovely. Who's this message from? Um, it's from Susie. Linda Morris from Derby. And she says, morning, Carolyn, Susie. My husband bought this Papadasha quartz oh, for my 70th gosh. birthday. I mounted it in your sterling silver and zircon ring shank, and I absolutely adore it. Linda. That is wonderful. That looks gorgeous. Please tell me that's not your hand. <laughs> Honestly, Beautiful. that is gorgeous. Oh, haven't you got a lovely husband? How sweet. Yeah. He's a keeper. Um, that colour is just, it looks hot, doesn't it? But you, you imagine putting that colour like ambers with this as well, mix amber yeah. with it. There's it so looks many colours. fiery, beautiful. Yeah. Six mil white, and then we're gonna do the six mil black spinel. Yeah, yes. Oh, oh look, you've got to get the two. Match made you? in look heaven. Look at that. Oh. Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out, out, out. There you go. Okay, so. We've got the six mil white uh, Branca Onyx. We're going to be playing the six mil black spinel next, just to let you know. Okay, there you go. Stretchy bracelet, like you say, 50 50, yin yang bracelet. Mm. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. perfect. Yeah. There you go, <laughs> half and half. And don't be, don't be afraid of doing that half and half. I was saying earlier on, I like the, I like alternating. I yeah. think that's really nice. 
But, what, but something you don't see very often is it's just doing that 50 half 50, and half. Yeah. It's, re it's a really cool it's, design. Yeah, it's, it's, it's um, striking, isn't it? It's very striking. It's just a little bit different. And um, it's even easier. Yeah. <laughs> which, is, which is just crazy, isn't it? But, um, you know, just, just think on it. Making those asymmetrical pieces. It just looks great. It looks brilliant. OK. Um, Lynn, Victoria, Maker, Suzanne's got four. Maker in Buckinghamshire's got two in the basket. Maker, Victoria, well done to you. Yeah. Yeah, we played these the other day. Now, we'd, also, we'd already gone lower than we should have done for the strand before, the larger strand. So uh, we gave you a couple of pounds off and did 27 99 This was meant to be, at the very lowest, 29 99 And we just thought, stuff it. We've got to do something. We need to take a couple of pounds off. Jocelyn's got this. Well done to you. This is such a great deal. Um, Actually, do you know what? You can watch the show back. When did we launch this? What day was it? What day? 16th of uh, last Thursday. Yeah, so by all means, if you want to watch the show back and you can see, you know, this is totally unplanned. Half Alison in Greater London says, oh, yes, she did message you yeah, this morning. Hello, my lovely. Oh, she had a bad day at work. So I have my tiger's eye in clear quarters to oh. improve the day and also bought an onyx bangle. Yes. All must be right with my world now. Yes, well done. Bless you, sweetie. Don't let work get You're you down. down, darling. Be strong. And you can... Yeah. Yeah, positive mental attitude. You can do this. We believe yeah. in you. Message in. Let us know how your day was. We're yeah. always here for you. Yeah. Always here for you. And you know, Ollie, I said that to myself the other day. I had a lot of stuff on my mind the other day. And I said to my, I literally said out loud, it's okay not to be okay. You don't have to be that, ah, happy all the time. That's very it's, true. It's okay not to be okay sometimes. Yeah. That's okay. Because it's only by not being okay sometimes that you appreciate the great days. Spot on. It's true. We all have to, it's like too much sun creates a desert, too much rain creates a flood. We need a bit of both. And never eat yellow snow. There we go. Exactly. Right. <laughs> Let's do the six more flex. <laughs> oh, you're asking a lot, you lot, this oh, morning. Oh, I love Put all the white onyx to... Oh. This is really great. If you love joking. Art Deco jewellery, this is quintessentially to me Art Deco. When I made this, I showed my husband. He says, oh, I like that because he likes Art Deco. It's very Art Deco. Because it's black and white. Black and white monochrome. So if you love Art Deco. Well, Art Deco was never really about colour. It no, was about it wasn't. Lines and it architectural was. lines yeah. and Tutankhamun, the finding of yes. and oh. then transport. You know, we had the super, like the Titanic and yes. speed railways. And even I'm thinking back to even the posters. Then they were very. The lines were oh, yeah. beautiful. Very strong lines and. Yeah. Um, it was mixed in with the Bauhaus movement. It was all that in the 20s. So the, the Bauhaus movement was geometric shape. So that's why we have... What's the, Bauhaus? What's Bauhaus that? is a movement of modernists that started in Germany in an art like institute called Bauhaus. And it represents really three, the, the triangle, the square and the circle. So form... Fascinating, yeah, Susie. What form over function. Knowledge. Yeah. Amazing yeah. knowledge. Well done. Oh, she's so clever. <laughs> Not just a pretty face. Um, so, um, black spinel. That's all the white together. Let's do the six mil black spinel. That's what's got to go with this, hasn't it? Make a, ma make a version of what, um, yeah. of what Susie's made there. Beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Uh, right. Um, here we go. Let's just do this. Oh my gosh, this wow. feels so wrong. Fourteen ninety nine, but it's so right, so good. Well done, everyone. Joe, you know, this is so good to have in your mm -hmm. um, collection because spinel helps with burnout. So if you're, you know, like overworked, um, oh. it will help regenerate your energy. It's a very good energizing stone, and it's really That's good. Great. You know, if you're making bracelets. A black stretchy bracelet as a present for anyone goes down, you know, beautifully. You can't go wrong. That's a really, gosh, that's yeah. a really, um, the, they were talking on the radio yesterday about the importance of recognising um, kind of mental illness and, and yes. mental health, particularly in men. I hadn't believed it was yeah. one of the biggest killers under the age of, under the age of 50. Yeah. 
Good. And this gemstone, you're talking about burnout. Gosh, yes. so many guys who, well, not just, not, yeah. you know, everybody, but, you know, that, you know, you know, some guys I can think of as well who work so hard, you know, they're trying to support families yeah. and this that, and the other. What a wonderful gift to give yeah, them. Yeah, no, it, um, and wow. they don't even have to know about it. Like, yeah, you know, I keep making jewellery for my husband who won't wear it, but there's a reason for it. I think, oh, wear you're it. you tiger's eye things, don't you? Yeah. Yes, I know, yeah, and, um, lovely. He won't wear it, but, you know, you can make a present. Great, for somebody that is, is like working too much and they're getting tired, just wear some black spinel. Very protective too. Oh, sweetheart. Caroline in Greater Manchester, lovely viewer of ours. Uh, ladies, you've cheered me up, but it's coming up to my mum's first anniversary of her death and it's going to be hard for oh. my uh, kids. Oh, sweetheart. Oh, bless. Do you know what? Um, you. Thank you so much for sending that message. I'm really glad that we can be there for you and just um, just, just keep going, lovey. You're doing amazingly. Oh. Um, thank you very much for sharing that with us, lovey. Thinking of you. Um, and um, you know what? Yeah, this is this is this is what I love about Jewelry Maker. It's that sense of community. Absolutely. You know, we are. It, it's a two-way street. We are. Yeah. We are there for you. And you know, we we are. And we've said this a lot. We're so grateful for you being there for us, especially during the pandemic, which is three years ago. Can you believe mm. that? Um, but but you know, so we are as grateful to have you there as you are having us there. So it, it, it's a two-way street. Thank you so so much. Um, amazing deal there. Well done. I can't hear you. Oh, full mill. Oh, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Must have by. Great tassels. If nothing else, you can make lovely tassels as well. Lots of things, but make super duper tassels. This is the kind of. This is the kind of thing that you can't help, but you have to buy. It's the kind of thing you can't walk past. There's a certain there's a certain chocolate bar that you get in a certain in a certain supermarket, and I cannot walk past it without buying it. I have to I have to get it. It's a black forest. It's a black forest chocolate. Oh wow! It's got cherries in it. I love it. Um, and I don't care because my husband hates cherries, so I so I know it's just for me, just for me. Mm -hmm. um, but it's one of those things I buy, and I know that I'm the only one who's going to eat it, and I just love it. Um, and it's one of Oh, oh, there we go. That's why Ollie buys licorice. Oh, no, I don't like licorice. No, 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 because no, he loves it and everyone else hates it in his house. Um, so Maker in London, Suzanne, Lorna, Neris, Victoria. There's loads of you there. Well done. OK, here we go. We're going to give you the best deal we possibly can. Um, um, here we go. Six seconds and we're taking the uh, prize point Look at all the beautiful. way down for you today. They, uh, the quality of this is absolutely supreme. Love it. $24.99. Absolutely amazing. Lorna, gorgeous to see you today. Well done to you. Joy, Victoria's taken two. Well done to you, my lovely Kent. Absolutely amazing. Suzanne, gorgeous. These look very juicy, don't they? Mm. They look sort of like you, you want to eat them, but don't, honestly. It's not yes, please don't do that. <laughs> Uh, Suzanne, <laughs> please don't listen to Susie. <laughs> Suzanne from North Yorkshire has got two of these. Well done to you. But they do. They look like they're full of so, water. Yes, they do. They Gorgeous. look. Gorgeous. Like, like they're going to yes. quench your thirst. Yes. Beautiful. Kirsty, well done to you as well. £24.99. Well done. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely amazing. Well done, everybody. We're get, you're going to get a 30-day money-back guarantee as well with this, which is absolutely fantastic. Well done to everyone. Yeah. Ooh. 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 Yes. Look at this. Look. You see, I look at that. To me, love that combination. Look at that. Beautiful. Now, Neri's just said we're gonna Ooh. we're gonna do this after the break. Don't go anywhere, because this is going under twenty pounds.
Makers. Did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. chocolate <laughs> my fault <laughs> tell you what no I'm having another one they're lovely lovely can I have one if I don't talk can I have one? <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> don't you recommend them that's literally just what I needed that's Michael shoehorns the last piece of flapjack in Right. What did we say? That was my stomach. What did we say? Neary. We need to maybe rethink this a little bit, don't we? This star by, do we not? Because I thought, it's a bit like a bad dream. I thought Neary said, stand by, because after the break, we're going to be playing this strand of Tanzanite and we're going under. 20 pounds you didn't say that did okay that's what he did say right um I'm a little bit in two minds about Tanzanite I have to say because 
Everything I've been giving you recently... Can I have the clicker, please, Levy? Everything that I've been giving you recently for Tanzanite goes against everything I have ever known, learnt about this gem. Now, it took us a long time to get this incredible gemstone on Jewelry Maker. And the very first strand we ever had must have been 10 years ago. And it was Tanzanite chips and nuggets on not a big long strand, but on a fairly modest sized strand. Not 30 centimetres, it was shorter than that, of, of chips and nuggets. And um, I'll talk to you a little bit about the colour. Have a look at this slide. This is the GIA Tanzanite. Um, I don't want to call it a grading chart because we don't grade our Tanzanite. But just to give you an idea about the colour, the value, because with Tanzanite, colour is king, as with almost all coloured gemstones. But if you just look at this chart, the strand of chips and nuggets that we did 10 years ago, which we bought to air, by the way, uh, for $24.95, <clears throat> I would say was about the 2-2. Two, two. So two down, two across, there. It was about that colour, 2-2. Two, two. And that was $24.99. I literally lost my mind. <clears throat> and I stormed upstairs after, how dare you? How dare you price Tanzanite at $24.99? We, we cannot do this. This is, this is way too low. This is, we are, we are, we are devaluing this gemstone, blah, 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 blah. And then kind of over the years, I've kind of thought, I've seen gemstones come and go and I've seen the kind of prices we can do for gems and, you know, the kind of prices that we're doing for things like Branco Onyx. And I'm like, do you know what? Actually, this is great for our customers. This is fantastic for our customers. This is great for our viewers. This is great for them to see. As long as we instill and prove and show the value and the quality of what we are bringing to air, I don't mind bringing it to air for ridiculously low prices because I've already made you aware of what you're getting. You know what you're getting. You know the true value of what it is you're getting. And if we can do it for $24.99, that's brilliant. But that's ridiculous. Look at the quality of this Tanzanite you're getting here today. We are talking, I would say, a majority, a majority of third row, third column across yeah. to the fourth row down. I would say a majority of that colour. Yeah. We are getting into the territory territory where, yeah, I know we don't grade our tanzanite. We believe that you should fall in love with the stone rather than the grading. Because, and that's absolutely dead right. But if this was graded tanzanite, there is absolutely no way. And it wouldn't be quad A. I don't think it'd even be triple A. It might be A plus or maybe double A. But if it was either of those gradings, A plus, double A, there is absolutely no way we would be able to do this for under £20, but today we are. So enjoy this. This gemstone is becoming rarer. It's becoming infinite, infinitely more difficult for us to source. And that's because the mines are now owned by the, the Tanzanian government. Absolutely right. They don't want to sell Tanzanite on at the lowest price. They, don't, you know, they, want, to, they want to make a profit from it. Absolutely. They've, they're absolutely entitled to do that. But it means that the days of the kind of incredible closeout deals that we used to arrange with the Saul family, who were the original family involved with the mining and launching of this gem, those days are gone because we have no control over that now. $14.99. Oh, my gosh. Moira, Susan, well done. Absolutely incredible. We are at £14.99. What a deal. What an incredible opportunity for genuine Tanzanite. Now, this gemstone, I, I, you associate this with luxury, rarity. You know, this gemstone is said to be a thousand Absolutely. times rarer than a diamond. Yeah. Found in one place in the world. 
the Merilani Hills, just just in the in, in in the shadow of Mount Kilimanjaro. We're talking about um, the only location in the world where you can get this incredible gemstone from, and we're at fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence. That's not your deal. Wow. <laughs> It is crazy. Sorry, Neri, are you talking? I can't hear you. Um, Nikki in Merseyside, well, there's, abs there's so many people coming through to get this. Now, we want to be able to bring you the best deal ever. We want to be able to bring you... We want to be able to bring you the best opportunity. We want to be able to give you an unmissable deal. I would be considering using these with the, the beautiful... Um, with the beautiful um, uh, Marla kits we've got coming yeah. up in the... Uh, when we've got them coming up in the 12 o'clock hour, I think they go absolutely beautiful absolutely. spaces. You can, great with spaces, but in, say, the Laramar, if you've seen at the bottom, I've actually used two oh. little... Yeah, look at this. So look I've, at that. I've used those. Can you see? So yeah, beautiful. Just two little rondelles there. Susie, that looks amazing. So Now, let's be honest, Tanzanite spaces... Tanzanite spaces. Don't be ridiculous. You can't use a Tanzanite as a spacer. It's way too considered a purchase. Not today. It's fourteen ninety nine. dollars No, it's not. It's going lower. It's yours today. Enjoy. Just take it. Use it for whatever you want to use it for. Use them as spacers. $9.99. Oh, my gosh. That's absolutely incredible. That's absolutely bonkers. And you know what? Um, if you're going to make what I call a high-end mala, yeah. and you just put the, the top, you know, two of these is yes. negligible in that strand. Yes. But it really adds value to the actual mala itself because it's an extra element that isn't, you know, that you wouldn't think to put in there. But that's that little punch of, you know, I've thought this design through. So this if, is why it's brilliant to have If that. you've made a mala and you detail that piece of jewellery, let's say, you, you know, you detail everything yeah. you've used. Precious metal findings, Larimar featuring tanzanite spaces the fact that you've added tanzanite yeah. whatever in whatever capacity that is it literally adds so much value to the piece and it gives you so much integrity as a jewelry maker as a as a business owner doesn't it looks fantastic with pearls you know we had the acquired pearls imagine Amazing. you Immaculate. make a necklace with that and just put nine of those spaces just at the front bit just there and this is why these strands are so fantastic to have. You don't, you just use them very sparingly, but you've got them. So many designs. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, now, <clears throat> I can't, okay, I'm purposefully not going to look at this. No, there's a recording there. I'm not even going to look at that. I don't want to see it. You're showing it. Now, I'm not even going to, I'm just going to literally, I'm just going to put it there. I think I've got it the right way around. Gems are, yeah, the gems are there. Um, I want the first time that I see this to be the first time that you see this. Oh my gosh. What is that? Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, what is this? A horseshoe? A, a good luck horseshoe or something? Looks like it. A moon? Beautiful. Oh, oh, so it's meant to be a moon class, but oh, that's absolutely beautiful. Wow. Oh, gosh, that's stunning. Oh, that recording's really pretty. Look at that. That's so pretty. Yes, it's a moon, um, but it's also like a horseshoe. Yeah. Absolutely. Aren't you meant to have the horseshoe facing up? Do you know Isn't what? That I'm, right? I can't if you remember. If it the wrong way, then the horse, then the, then the, yeah, it's, then the, then the thought, horse will fall out. No, I've, the luck will fall out. I've heard that the horseshoe facing up gets rid of all the bad energy, and if you have it down, it protects the good energy. So I never know which way to do it. So a bit like a hamza hand, actually. Yeah. Whether you have it that way or, or that, that way. way. Yeah. Oh gosh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Susie. Oh, God, love her. <laughs> it's like she's doing Vogue, isn't it? Um, absolutely amazing. Um, this is a gorgeous clasp. It's sterling silver. Oh, gosh, look, it's white onyx and... Uh, sorry, Beautiful. green onyx and white topaz. <gasps> Beautiful. That is lovely. That is really lovely. Look at that. There's your sterling silver. Um, oh, wow, that is really pretty. I like that a lot. 
loving that green onyx, loving that white topaz. Isn't that beautiful? Be a special piece. Isn't that absolutely wonderful? Well, with all the chrysoprase that you had the other day, yeah. uh, with, of course, your branca white onyx as well, that'd oh, be wow. absolutely beautiful. If you made it. a multi-stranded of your branca onyx, maybe you have one with just a four mil, another one graduated. What a lovely idea. Mix it with a spinel. Yes, most definitely. And just punch of green you know, at the front, just to pick up on the cloth. And that's a really powerful kind of uh, punctuation, isn't yeah, it? Really lovely. gorgeous punch, as you say. Beautiful. Elaine, well done to Dawn, well done to Diane. Price point, here we go. Come on, Neri. Just do it. Just do the price. Okay. All right, well, just sneeze then. What's your problem? Okay, we'll get a light and look into a light and then you can sneeze. Is that what they say? Hmm? <laughs> look into the light. Look into the light and then you can <laughs> sneeze. 19 is not your price. Christine, Elaine, well done to you. Any tips on how to sneeze? I know how to not sneeze. You touch the end of your nose. Is that right? You touch the end of your nose and then you don't sneeze. Ooh. Touch the roof of your mouth with your tongue and then you don't sneeze. Nothing better than a good old sneeze though, is there? <laughs> oh, I think it's yeah. I think it looks like a horseshoe as well, says Sheila. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Really does. Well done, everyone. Christine in Devon, well done to you, my lovely. Um, you're not taking the price down, are you? Oh, oh gosh, that's not the price. Oh, I'm, I'm just discombobulated. I'm sorry. Here we go, everyone. It, it really is, yeah, an unmistakable green. The only other green I'd say it's like is like a Santa Teresina emerald, uh, which is like from Brazil. It was only mined for a few years, totally gone now. And actually, it's interesting what Dave was saying about um, the kind of discovery of gemstones in Brazil when they're doing things, when they're yeah. kind of farming or whatever. And the, I think the Santa Teresina emerald was discovered when they were building a road and it, the, the miners found it and staked a claim and it caused one of the fastest mining migrations um, in Brazilian history. Um, hundreds and hundreds of miners flocked there overnight um, to try and stake um, a claim. And uh, yeah, it, it was completely mined out. It was beautiful though, really powerful green. Uh, Maureen's got two, well done to you. Catherine uh, in Bristol, well done to you. Lynn, gorgeous, 12 99 amazing deal. Leslie, well done, beautiful deal. And if you want to, look, you can always take that, take that off. Here we go. How pretty. There we go. And just wear that as a pendant or Beautiful. a little charm. Yeah. How sweet. Also, look, if you wanted to go down the sort of like the aztec -y route of jewellery and make quite aztec -y, that almost looks a bit aztec -y to me. Do you think? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. See, I'd say Aztec is more gold, isn't it? But, yeah. but I think maybe, yeah, the design-wise, yeah, it, design it, it does. Yeah, I could sort of quite imagine you have sort of quite chunky Gorgeous. Pieces. Maybe that's a collection we need to explore, actually. Oh, I'd I like, like to do that. that. I'd love to do. Mm. Kind of Aztec Frida, Mayan. Frida Kahlo inspired jewellery. You know, a big fan of her, so, and her jewellery. She was an amazing woman. Me from, that's from say. Mexico, but yeah. She's literally a kind of overcoming every Everything. obstacle. Absolutely. She was incredible. Such wow. A good I, I didn't I didn't realize what kind of a life she'd had. Yeah. What a sad life. Gee yeah. whiz, but polio what? Yes. in a car crash got speared through. Yeah. Survived it thought she would die but didn't. Yeah. Just incredible. Um Oh, okay. Ooh. Uh right. <laughs> okay. Another star by coming up now. What is it? A jade flower. Oh, come on. Let's go. Star by. I've got a beautiful flower for you here. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Isn't that now, beautiful, the quality of that jade? Is this a lotus? What do you think? I think that is a lotus. I think it's a thousand, uh, where they call it, the equivalent of the thousand petals lotus, which is so, to enlightenment. You, well, you, were, you were talking the other day yeah. about the different stages and the different yeah, kind exactly. of ways in which you can get your lotus it's flowers they can be the roots they can be closed absolutely closed semi-open a few leaves yeah like your typical one is your six leaf uh that you see sort mm. of halfway yes which is the journey which is what um 
uh, Buddha sat on. But when you get it fully open like this, this is... Nirvana. Yeah. This like is it. This is a, sort of accepting all the abundance that's in the world and all the knowledge and, yeah, which is fantastic. So that's why I strongly think that this is... Um, a lotus flower. It has much more significance than any other flower. It's and, such... and a reason why you'd wear it. Yeah, well, such an auspicious thing to wear, yeah. isn't it? I mean, yeah. this is not only a you know an, an incredibly beautiful carving with with these gorgeous kind of these are so tactile. These yeah, dips, beautiful, aren't they? These go they're gorgeous. so tactile. I just want to I just want to do that. They're yeah. Beautiful. So translucent as well. I mean, the yeah, the material is actually. Let's get the torch on. I yeah. don't have Dave, Dave's torch earlier on was absolutely brilliant. He took yeah. it away though. Um, it's absolutely look at, beautiful. Look at this. Look, look at this. Look at that. Oh wow. Look at that. It's, it's like it's made of paper almost, yeah. isn't it? Look at that. <gasps> See, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? Love that. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, and the just so that you know, the thousand leaf uh, open lotus, which is part of the mandala, when you go through the chakras and you get to the crown chakra, it's a, a thousand petaled um, lotus flower. That all also represents the flower of life I was talking to you about. Yes, now that was fascinating yeah, earlier on. Which is a, say, all sacred geometry. Um, so that's and, your mandala yeah. kind of. Yeah. yeah, how that fasc it's it so is. fascinating. It's all but, connected, yeah. isn't it? But it's sort of how everything is formed. All sort of shapes uh, in nature are formed by that. You'll see that. Well, when you see a seashell, it's got exactly that, spiral, that you can get the, isn't it? the fractals from that. Exactly. And the um, the sunflower with yes, the spiral of exactly. seeds. Exactly. So it's is it called the Fibonacci series. That's it. it. It's all yeah, the Fibonacci me. number. Yeah. yeah. Um, right. So what a lovely carving. It really is. The material is absolutely superb. It's so gemmy. Four nine nine. Yeah, again, Ollie. Something you said the other week actually really resonated with me. With this particular material, it looks like uh, lalique. Looks mm. like um, it might not have been you actually, um, Ollie. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that gorgeous frosted green kind of glass work of lalique, um, who were. Who still are? Who still make glass kind of pieces to this day? That glossy kind of misty glow that they get. But it does look glassy, doesn't it? Yeah, it really and does. This is what I mean. If I'd have seen this anywhere else Ooh. but jewelry maker, I would have thought this is type B and C jade because it's so translucent. I'm thinking, you know, the price we go to is ridiculous. Look, Linda's saying, look, it looks like it's carved from ice. You're absolutely yes, right. Absolutely. It does look like it's carved from it kind of frozen water from like ice. It's just melted. Beautiful. Um, Lucy, in Nottinghamshire, I've got you there, my lovely. Well done to you. Yeah, it's got a gorgeous colour going through it, hasn't it? It's that lovely spring green. Mm. Um, we've had some... I was, I was walking through a lovely arboretum the other day with lots of different trees, lots of different... I saw a silver birch. I saw a red birch as well, which oh, I've wow. never seen before. So instead of the silver bark, it, it was a red red bark. Oh, wow. Um, and one of the trees that we saw was obviously a very, very old fruit tree. And it, it was clearly dead and it was just so sad. But then a tree right next to it, but you see tiny little buds... Uh, on its branches and you just thought uh, and they were this green you yeah. just thought that's spring that's the start oh, of wow. new life so wonderful um and uh yeah just lovely to be around that and um, price point coming sorry price point going down i should say in five seconds we're at 499 as it stands at the minute what a lovely way to end the next i'm just oh, was, your necklace yeah, there that absolutely we're doing mandalas later but you imagine making the mandala and making that the centerpiece sort of the guru and the tassel absolutely it represents enlightenment that's this is what the tassel represents absolutely you can't think of a better way to finish no. off a, a piece with real intention it's, being made behind it um 129 pounds there you go individual split payments look at that 43 pounds well done to sue in edinburgh i can see you there my lovely well done and just to, you know just as a side note look at it with look at it with the tans isn't that lovely isn't that beautiful with the tans at night
what I love about that jade. Doesn't that look beautiful? It's Absolutely. another gemstone. Everything goes with jade. Yeah, it really does, doesn't it? Well, I suppose you get green in nature everywhere, Where? don't you? Exactly. So it should go with everything. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. Uh, gorgeous. Well done, everybody. £129. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. We've got time for one more item, and then we're going to go to a very quick break. Uh, can we do this? Yeah, this has got to be a star bite. This is absolutely amazing. Um, this, I know what this looks like. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Is it really? It's lovely. It, it looks like Neon Appetite, but that is the biggest oh, strand wow. I've ever bought you. And guess what? It is Neon Appetite, and we're going to do it as a star buy. I am a little bit, um, oh, yes. Mix that up. Look. Lovely, wow, 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 wow. That looks serious. I mean, not the way I've done it, but the colours together look great, don't they? Doesn't that look lovely? Really strong, isn't it? It's a lovely punch of colour, Neon Appetite. Neon Appetite. It, it, I, I'm always amazed when I see this because the only pieces of Neon Appetite I've ever bought to wear are, uh, before bringing you Neon Appetite on Jewelry Maker, that is, are uh, uh, cluster rings of Neon Appetite. And when I say cluster, I mean melee sizes. I mean um, each piece being one mil faceted round, uh, faceted kind of round brilliant cut in a cluster ring. And reason being is, is that when you get appetite and you heat it to make it go a neon color a lot of the appetite doesn't survive the heating process it cracks it breaks whatever so to get it over in over one mil in size is incredibly rare then the other the only other piece i was i, I had the experience of bringing to you was this exceptional neon appetite ring part of our larique collection which was this huge eye clean pretty much might have had a couple of inclusions in a ring that was beautiful that was kind of seven eight thousand pounds um both of those would have been heated. This, this is natural. And that's one of the things that blows me away. But the second thing that blows me away is that you are getting a 50 inch strand of six mil rounds. Fantastic. It's huge. It's huge. It's absolutely huge. And these are natural. They're not heated. That, isn't that incredible? Yeah, London, Essex, Eastern Bartonshire, Lanarkshire. Yeah. Well done. 47.99. Neon Appetite is the most startling natural gemstone colour. So it's I nice. could not agree more. Yeah. There's certain gemstones that when you mine them, it must be amazing when you find Branco Onyx. Mm. It's white, but it must be amazing when you find it. When you find Tanzanite, gorgeous, but it doesn't come out of the ground blue. Mm. All Tanzanite's heated. Yeah. Uh, you have to you have to heat it up. It, it's kind of like a, a bit of like a brownie green, green when it comes yeah. out of the ground. Then you heat it and it goes this beautiful intense blue. Okay, emerald. When you mine that, yeah, that comes out of the ground green. That's lovely, but sometimes not that intense. Mm. This comes out of the ground looking like this. That is a miracle. Yeah. And blue is one of the rarest colours to get in nature. I mean, I, I know we have blue sky, but you don't see many blue flowers. You don't mm. see many kind of blue natural na things which are naturally blue it's always a greeny blue or a purpley blue or whatever it might be this is that intense electrifying blue exactly. isn't it jackie nikki janice elaine maker helen elaine lanarkshire london yorkshire price point coming in this is amazing and of course with, yeah. with what we've got coming up in the next hour with the marlas this is what you need to do absolutely amazing Ready, steady, go. Amazing. Go, go, go. Jackie, Pamela, oh my gosh, well done. Loads of you there. £29.99. pence. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. I tell you what, um, much like an electrical current, this kind of electric blue, I can, it's like a zingy kind of, 
it's not a placid, restful, peaceful colour. It's going to give you, it's going to pep you Absolutely. up. Absolutely. It? It's, it's, it's going to you know, charge you almost. We're going to be doing malas uh, in the 12 o'clock hour. And, you know, not only are they great for meditation, but if you use a certain gemstones, they actually oh, go sort on. Of give you the vibrations that you need to give you that energy. Now, Neon Blue Appetite, I absolutely love, part of the throat chakra. And this is a gemstone that actually gives you the zest for life. Oh, uh, yes. It makes you sort of analyse your situation and think, no, if you want to change, this is where I need to go. It's great for meditation because you think, where, where am I going next? Where am I going next? This will say, this is where you, you need to go. It will sort of talk to you and say, this is what you need to plan wow. to move forward. So it's a really energising, as you said, stone, and it just helps you move forward. It's really yeah, good. that's awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Giving you that va va voom. Yes. I really lack that sometimes. And I find that I lack that direction of knowing what I want to do, how to set those intentions. Yeah. So if this can really maybe help that or, or help you kind of have a clearer yeah. mind of how to achieve that, how to set it out. Yeah. Awesome. Brilliant. Yeah. What a great deal. Yeah. Right. Next hour is going to be incredible. Looking forward to it. Three Marla kits yeah. like we've never done before. Branco Onyx. Larimar and Tanzanite, Tanzanite Marlers. You can't get any better than that. It's coming up in the next hour after the break. Don't go anywhere. Makers. Did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one P&P charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know?
know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. That's right, I'm going to get a chair. <laughs> what did you have to do to get these kits? I don't know, but I love Amala. As you know, I love Amala. I've got three Amala kits. Absolutely love them. I wear Amalas all the time in various forms. So, if you love Amala, and, but you don't know what it is, like we had Dave earlier saying, I've heard you know, people talk about Amalas, I don't know what on earth you're talking about, what's so special about them, I will tell you everything you need to know and debunk a few of the myths because they are the most beautiful necklaces to make. I wear marlas all the time. Marla just means garland, but I'll tell you the traditional marla and the do's and, you know, and what you can do. So I, I, I've literally got two slides to show you yeah. just about, just about, hello, hello. Come on, there you go. Um, this is this is just a re this is just dead simple stuff. This, but Susie's going to go into a bit yes. more detail. Marla bees traditionally have 108 bees. The largest bead at the centre is known as the guru, said to hold the energy generated during your practice. Um, and I think that when we talk about practice, it don't don't be put off and think, oh, I need to know how to meditate, and no, I need to no. have I need to have. Um, mantras that I need to chant or I need to be sort of on the path of Buddhism or believe in Buddhism no, no you this don't. could literally just be five minutes before you go and pick the kids up from school and you just sit and just close your eyes I do that sometimes I just sit mm. listen to the birds and I just practice a bit of gratitude just like and just breathing focusing yeah. on my breathing and that's we're not talking about, yes, anything like that. You don't have to be a devout Buddhist. You don't have to be you religious or anything. You don't have to sit in anything. a yoga position to, no. to use them. Sit in your car. Yeah. Great for meditation. And I think we all need a bit of in-the-moment time. Totally. Break from all the chaos that is going on through the world. You have to have a bit of you time to recharge your batteries and just calm down because if you can't do that then you can't give your best self to other people exactly you? you've exactly got to, you've got to do that and it's not selfish yeah. it's self-care no um there are 108 beads on a mala uh, on a traditional mala that mm. is the number is often described as the numerical equivalent of om uh one of the most important spiritual sounds in medication uh, medication meditation also the relationship between your inner and outer environment is described by the 108 beads um but they're more than just trendy necklaces or bracelets. They have a deep connection to mental grounding and opening your mind to spirituality. If that's what you're into, if it's yeah. not what you're into, Doesn't if you just want to wear it because it's a nice necklace, yeah. you go for it. Yeah. You go for it. Now, I've got a little image here, which I think is quite interesting. Very useful. A really useful guide if you want to make a traditional mala with kind of that, with, with that kind of um, yeah. significance. It, it's a really useful diagram to look at, don't you think, Susie? Exactly. Traditionally, malas were made for uh, Tibetan priests um, that they used to wear around their wrists and every day they would meditate. They would go and, and would chant and meditate and the mala was used to help with the meditation. Now, on a mala... Oh, can I have one of those? Can I borrow one of those? Yes. To hold? Yes, absolutely. Which is a nice one. I want to give you a, have that one. a nice one. They're all nice. Oh, wow. Go on. Sorry. And um, so they would sit and this I'll show you. First of all, I'll, I'll tell you about traditionally with malas. I'm just using this one. And what you would do is you would sit and hold your mala in your left hand and with your right hand using your thumb and your middle finger, never the forefinger, because the forefinger. the forefinger is a sign of ego. So we're talking about non-ego, so we use those two fingers. Okay. This is why you yeah. see quite often dancing in India, and yes. they, they dance with that, because they never use that finger. It's 
for pointing and it's to do with ego um, and it's beautiful now my understanding of the 108 is when you um w w now we're going a bit down the religious route but it doesn't have to be but the 108 are the failures in us as human beings like anger jealousy and all of those i won't go through the list but you can imagine there's 108 but one of them is ego um pride is another one so there's 108 so that's my understanding of it. Mm. Uh, but what you would do is you would start at one end, you would have your tassel. Let me get one with a tassel, silly me. I've got one. With your tassel, and you would start at one end after your guru bead. You've got your tassel, that represents enlightenment. The guru bead actually represents the teacher that mm. teaches you. So whoever you're grateful for that's given you all the teachings. And you'd start at the first one and you would hold it in your left hand and just hold it like that and you can feel that bead and you would just breathe in breathe in and then as you move on to the next one you exhale and then you breathe in and just that's all you have to do now to meditate they would be doing their chants and their ohms and whatever prayers they have but the, what you would be going through is you'll be going through the past the present and the future so, and then you'd come full circle round, and it would probably oh, take a length wow. of 108 because they were Buddhists and, and it was sort of quite important for them to do this every day. It might, may take you an hour to yeah, get so through. Yeah, I was going to say they'd meditate for hours. You know, it could take you a long time. And then when you get to the last one and you feel, because it's all by feel, um, you would feel the guru and you think thank you and you give thanks to your teacher and then all of those thoughts... And because you've been in a sort of a, a place that's sort of where you're not hearing anything, seeing anything, you're just in the moment. It really does bring down your blood pressure. Yes. Now, I can feel, I can feel my heart rate kind of lowering. Actually. Exactly. It's amazing. Now, in each mala, there are three to four marker beads, yeah. which are different to your normal sort of meditation breeds. They can be a different size or they can be a different texture. Yeah. They can actually be a different shape. And you can have three or four, depending on which sort of Buddhist relief uh, religion you have. Mm. The Tibetans typically had three, some have four. So it, it honestly depends on whatever you like. But what would happen is you would start meditating and you would then get to, you because you'd feel it, a different uh, bead. So you think, oh, time to change up my thoughts and start thinking of something else or you can stop and this is where um i'm really for meditating with malas because i sometimes just sit there and i just roll it in my hands i don't actually move along mm. but if you do that and you just sort of roll it with your fingers you're breathing in and you're not thinking and you you'll get to a mark and you think I have got time, so you carry on. But sometimes we all live really hectic lives. We're picking up children, we've got children, you know, places to be. And you, you think, I haven't got time to sit there for an hour and a half and meditate. I'd, I'd love to, but I haven't. My life is too chaotic and too busy. But you can, because you could just set yourself a few beads, put a marker in there and think, right, that gives me, say, 10 minutes. Mm. You need to give yourself that time because it's good for your health you are unblocking all of your chakras which is sort of rebalancing any sort of areas that you have stress it all gets blocked and it gets gnarly inside you know sometimes when uh, you go and get your um your neck massage and the ma masseur might say oh you've got a few knots in there mm. this is because you're holding on to that anxiety stress energy anger frustration whatever it is and you haven't given yourself time to release it. By meditating like this, you will release that energy. It is absolutely, it should be on the National Health Meditation. I tell you, you should do it for yourself. You need to do it. It's not, it's, you have, sometimes you have to be selfish. They say on an aeroplane, if there's, um, you know, uh, it's going to crash. Put your mask on before. Put your mask on before, before you, help, you help your children. You might think, first instinct, need to help the children. No, you've got to help yourself first because then you are in a good place to go and help others. And this is what meditation does for you. It rebalances your alignment. 
gives you that extra bit of energy, stops you being so tired all the time. You'll be amazed at how tired you think, I'm always tired, tired, tired. It's because you never stop. You just literally go to bed and go to sleep. But sometimes you need more than that, just sleep. So meditation is fantastic. And these are what malas are for. But you might say, Susie, Susie. Ha hang on, sorry. Uh, Tanzanite mala on screen. Yes. Tanzanite rounds are like hen's teeth. Yes. These are the Tanzanite rounds you are getting, an army of Tanzanite rounds, an army. Absolutely beautiful. Seven, uh, yeah, you're getting seven meters of your purple cord. You're getting your purple um, tassel, gorgeous, soft silk, that is. And then all of this gorgeous Larimar, these beautiful Larimar uh, marker beads, if you like. Your beautiful Larimar Guru bead, use it for whatever you like. An amazing kit. To have Tanzanite rounds is something quite incredible. The jewellery that Susie has made, be it a mala, be it a necklace, whatever it is. Um, incredible. This kit, we've got 29. Great for... Oh. If you want to make a change in your life, this is a great one to meditate. Oh, yes, please. Like yes, please. Stone of transformation. Great for making that next change. Meditate, thinking where I want to be. This is fantastic. And then you've got the few marker beads of your Larimar, which is really nurturing and really calming. So this is fantastic. Now, we're going to give you... Oh, gosh. Um, here's the thing. Look, we've got 29 of this kit. It's already starting to go. Um, what we're going to do, we're going to give you two prices, did you say, Neary? Okay, here we go. So this is your start price. This is already amazing. The quality, the calibre, 249. £249 on split payments of 62.25. It's not your deal. We're going to give you another price. Oh, hello. Now, I cannot think of ever being able to bring you a mala kit with tanzanite and you do have enough beads here oh absolutely you've got your 108 Th these are 108 with 108 of your tanzanites four of your larimar smaller ones one of your larger ones and your purple cord this is a proper mala kit with tanzanite Beautiful. We know the situation with tanzanite at the minute. There's all sorts of stuff going on, which is preventing us from getting tanzanite. So for, this makes this kit even more special. Fantastic advice on meditation, Susie, says Angela. Oh, Thank you. Yes. It's lovely, isn't it? It's lovely to listen yeah. to it. And we will kind of carry on with that. Don't worry, yeah. but we're going to give you a prize point. Yeah, it comes to you in a beautiful little box what? as well, which is really sweet. So all packaged up lovely. And um, I think as a gift to yourself over the Easter holidays, oh, as a gift to yourself, do this for yourself. What a deal. This is amazing. Oh gosh, this is such a great deal. Ready? You're gonna love this, 129 pounds. Oh my gosh, for 108 tons of light beads, your Larimar, your silk, that's wow. a mala right there. Absolutely amazing. And as you can see, Susie's added different things as well into her pieces as well. If you want to be really, really traditional, then yeah, just these and yeah. just not them, perfect. But Which I will show you. Please, don't be afraid of adding spaces, no. adding pearls, adding things in, little spacer beads. Because honestly, it is your jewellery. You're the one who's going to be wearing it. You're the one who's possibly yeah. going to be meditating with it. Enjoy. Enjoy Absolutely. every moment of these kits. They are very, very, very limited. Elaine in Kent, Karen in Devon, Karen in West Yorkshire, Maker in Buckinghamshire, Susan in Lancashire, Victoria in Kent, Maker in Cheshire. Well done to you. I've also got Jackie, Elizabeth, Jackie, Mary, Lorna, Maker and Sean with this in their baskets. You've got to check out. We've got 50, 14 left. Tina, check out. Mary and Jerry check out, Lancashire check out, Worcestershire check out. Um, absolutely amazing. Ab Enjoy every second of this. Well done, everyone. Tracy and Norfolk check out. Absolutely ridiculous price. Give us an idea how much you would charge oh, for that. Oh, this is going to be like eight hundred pounds. It's Tanzanite, and this it's is tanzanite. this is me without a shop front as well. <laughs> You know, marlas typically start for sort of like a rose quartz, maybe 80, 85 pounds. Oh, beautiful. Just for, you know, with no, just 
purely knotted. And actually, where we were the other day, they yeah, had a yeah, rose quartz, quartz parlor price. in there. It's beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful. But Gorgeous. we're talking tanzanite here. Top quality, honestly. Mm. Now, with this, I've put them with pearls. And the uh, th there is a reason. Every time I make Marla jewellery, there is always a reason behind it. This is a, a Marla for meditating, for transformation, moving forward. The pearls uh, sort of recognise the fact that life may have been a bit difficult, but it happened for a reason. And to accept those and to acknowledge it and to say, I embrace what that happened, but I'm moving forward. So always a reason. Now, we're at £129. We're going to try and do everything we can. We've still got 12 left. I want every single one of these to go. Oh, wow. This is really naughty. We should not be doing anything to this at all. There's 108 Tanzanite beads in this kit. And you're getting your Larimar. And, and they're rounds. They're not rondelles. They're not chips. It's not nuggets. Mm. They are rounds. This is exceptional quality. This is the best quality Marla you are ever going to get from Jewelry Maker. This is the best quality yeah. Marla kit ever. These three kits combined are the best quality Marla kits we will ever be able to bring to you. Nancy, Irene, Tina, well Jackie, done. loads in baskets. Please check out, oh gosh, 119.99. Wow, that is Fantastic. Look at that split payment of twenty nine ninety nine. That is incredible. Well done. Um, what a deal. Maker in Surrey, Nancy, Victoria. Oh, gosh, there's loads of people there. Please check out as soon as you can. We're into single figures. That is absolutely amazing. Now, where right. were you, Susie? What were you no. talking about? Now, we've talked about the, 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 what a Marla is and the significance of the Marla, mm -hmm. why we have the amount of beads we have and a a typical, the traditional Tibetan mala that was used for prayer wrapped round the wrist, not worn as a necklace, was made really of wooden beads, oh. the seed beads, yes. and they were knotted. So a lot of malas you will see will be knotted. And you can knot it, and that's what I'm going to teach you today. I'm going to do a really traditional one, so we're going to do oh, very lovely. traditional. But you might say, Susie, I like a mala, but it's, you're putting me off because there's all of this religious significance to it. And, I, you know, and I'm clearly, you know, I am not religious at all. Does not matter because it is the design that's important. Absolutely. And you make the design. And I've bought a couple of, well, oh, a couple. Lovely pieces. Right. Less now, than 30 seconds and we're going to take the details away. If you want it, get it now. Look yeah. at all these people with this in baskets. Get it now because it's going to be taken away in 20 seconds. A very first right. and the only Tanzanite Marla necklace kit we will ever be bringing you on Jewelry Maker. Well done. Right. This one oh, is wow. a pearl and jade with a Buddha at the bottom. This is a Marla. It doesn't have a tassel. It doesn't really have a great big... Gurubi, but it follows the form. Another one is this one here. You know, what I was talking about earlier when we had the Branco Onyx. It's fantastic because oh this is gosh. this is white onyx. What is that? This one here again. I've got four marker beads here with a traditional tassel. This is more of what you would imagine a mala bead to look like. But then I've done another uh, onyx oh. one. This one's got the lovely big pendant on, but like a mala bead and again gold? yeah th no they're uh, jade black no, jade it's not that's black jade yeah oh my yeah. gosh that's amazing so the design really is up to you and not all right this is a completely this one is that's with lipidolite. eight mil Th yes lipidolite now it's got a clasp at the back okay which you're thinking you know it should be a gun but it's your mala and what I've done here is I've done the sort of the guru bead and the tassel, but this comes off so that you can just have it as a normal necklace. Oh, how and wonderful. And you've got a little um, bracelet. Little and then mala. if you wanted to, you're sitting in the car, you, you know, you're picking up the keys and you think, right, that's fantastic to meditate with 10 minutes. That's gorgeous. So different design. Ooh. You might have some nuggets and you think, oh, I don't know what to make with my nuggets. You know, I said tiger's eye, make a mala. Oh, yeah. Make a mala oh, yeah, with it. Oh, I haven't yeah. spaced it, but you just... We had these on. And all you would do with this is you would just feel them, just stroke them nicely and just think, see? Can you use nuggets? Absolutely. There you go, Another one more decorative. Last one I'll show you before I get on with the th This one, typical um, 
Martin, but look, how oh many spaces gosh, have I got here? Loads That's and loads amazing. and loads. I've, I've just sort of thrown the fact that you need three or four marker beads out the window thinking that no, I want it no. for the design as well. I've it's got these. Beautiful, so Susie. it's up to you because it's your marla. You, don't, you wear it as you want, but great for meditating. You can sit so, with that and you meditate with it. Details alive for your Larimar Marla kit yes. now, where you get 108 of the Larimar beads. You get um, the uh, seven meters of the turquoise cord. You get your incredible um, uh, tassel yeah. as well, which is really, really pretty. You also get your tanzanite markers and your tanzanite guru as well, which is just beautiful. Um, yeah. Oh my word, uh, this is gonna be a popular kit. Now, the, now the, look at this necklace. I think this is one of my one. favorites. Yeah, I really love I this I love one. the fact you've gone for gold spaces there yeah. as well, Susie. I think it just looks absolutely With stunning. With the tassel, and the tassel is phenomenal. It's just a beautiful, beautiful tassel. It's so silky, isn't it? Is. It is, it's really lovely. Very silky, really beautifully, uh, beautifully made. Um, now, oh gosh, we're at 129 pounds. Do you know what we're actually gonna do today? I can't believe I'm about to say this. Now, you might be thinking wow. that we're going to match the price of the Tanzanite kit. Cause that went to 119.99. Nope, we are actually going to go lower. My advice to you is get it in your basket. Check out, if you're happy to pay under 119.99, get it now, well done. Um, lots of you there, Victoria's again has taken two, Susan Maker, Tracy, two more Susans there, one in Lancashire, one in Essex, well done to you. Uh, well done to Maker in Meath as well. Absolutely fantastic. Well done to everybody. Elaine, well done to you as well. Linda in Devon, Sandra in Surrey. Look at those gorgeous blues together. That's absolutely Beautiful. stunning, isn't it? Okay, your price point coming in. More Agonies Lothian, well done to you as well. Go, go, go. Oh, look at it with the gold. They're stunning. Well done to you, Alison in Kent as well. <laughs> Gorgeous, here we go, everyone. How wow. about under 100? At Larimar. Yeah, under 100 pounds. Come on, let's go. No, Lorraine, well into you. 99.99. If you went into a, a, oh, yeah. a shop to buy a Larimar. One locational gemstone from the Dominican Republic. Marla, it's gonna cost you an arm and leg, isn't it? An because arm and so... Probably two legs. So many beads to make a Marla. Yeah, 108 of your yeah. incredible Larimars there. I mean. This is a, a rare gemstone, a one locational gemstone. This is another one of those gemstones, a bit like your mukite, that looks like where it's from. It looks like the beautiful lagoons surrounding the, the Dominican Republic. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, and what I love as well, just looking at this slide here, a half marla, you've got uh, 54 beads in there. So if you want to make a half marla, uh, you know, as a bracelet or, you know, whatever it might be, then absolutely go for it. Uh, they always say as well that if you do knot your marlas, every knot you tie is a knot untied yeah. in yourself, which yeah. I absolutely love. Um, and it says it, uh, consistent, it provides consistent space between each bead for ease of counting. Yeah. Knots are sometimes used to represent the connection between all beings. That's mm. very nice, isn't it? Uh, but well done. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through. Um, there's so many, there's so many, um, there's so much, I should say, information out there about my, what are you doing? Oh, wow, 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 wow. Split wow, payments wow. of 24 99 That's a bit low, isn't it, Neary? Come on, I think we need to maybe, no. Okay, we're taking a little bit more off. Why not, you know, if we, if we can, we absolutely will. Today, we're gonna have to, they haven't all sold out. They're very, very popular, but my goodness gracious me, we are gonna give you a little bit back. What about a fiver off? Yeah, fiver off? No. A tenner off, 89.99, there you go. Wow, 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 well done. Absolutely beautiful. Who's this from, um, Suzy? This is from Sue in Edinburgh, and she says, too good to miss. Larimar is one of my favorite gemstones, and I'm a Buddhist, and I love Marlas. Yes, Sue. Yes, I love Marlas. You... I wear them every day, so I'm with Literally you. got the, be what is that? Oh, wow. Yes. Oh, wow. Susie. Isn't that lovely? Can you imagine and that? 
And this uh, mala, as I say, is a love. You imagine this is so good for meditating. This oh, is meditation wow. in a necklace. It's very soothing, very calming to wear Larimar. Wow, oh, that is absolutely amazing. Yeah, to get to get a, 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 yeah. a Tanzanite mala is amazing. To get a Larimar mala is is just is just absolutely oh, e of equal excitement. Oh. We've got one final kit. Um, and we've got a demo. Gosh, we've got lots to fit in before the end yeah. of the show. Oh, look who's come through for this. Rachel in Cornwall. Wow. We know who that is, don't we? Gorgeous Rachel Norris. Thank you so oh, much, my lovely. So well done to you, sweetie. I wonder what she's got. She'll be making, oh, I don't know, a beautiful blooming castle. Yeah. A dolphin with it or something. I, I don't know. It'll be, it'll be something beautiful. super impressive. Yeah. She's so talented. Oh, I love her. Uh, right, OK. Um, 20 seconds, we're taking the details away. Well done, Valentina, Nicole, Maker, Julie, Maker, 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 London, Shamala, Alison in Kent. Check out your baskets, my lovelies. That is absolutely amazing. Wow, wow, wow. Um, we have one final kit. And I think today, with everything we've been bringing you today, mm. with the deal of the day, with the strands, I think this kit is gonna go the quickest. Um, what a show it's been today. For the very first time ever, we did oh, bangles for under favorite. 100 pounds, but both the bangles and the Branca white onyx strands that we bought to you, incredibly popular. And the cherry on top of the cake today is to be able to bring you the amazing Branca onyx in a Marla kit. This has got to be a star buy. Just, you, do you just go home and read? No, it's just, I think I've got one of these, I, I remember everything. And I love Marla, so, you know, and I love Chakra, so obviously I've studied it. So Knowledge is just incredible. Just it's lucky just that I remember wonderful. It. This is, if I had seven different Marlas from seven different guest designers, I'd say that one's Susie's. Yeah. This, this is, is you. Yes, I've made this for me to wear. Of course she has. <laughs> this is... <laughs> Susie, if you ever come back as anything else, you're going to come back as this Marlin necklace, yes. I reckon. Uh, to me, it looks a bit Art Deco. It doesn't look like your traditional Marlin because I've, I've added sort of like your some take. lovely Parve uh, rondelles in there and I've used it up a bit. But this is what I'm saying. This is the lovely thing about a Marlin. You can have it traditional and I'm going to show you how to make a traditional one. I'm keeping it really low key on this one. But you can bling it up as well. It's your Marlin. 108 of your white Branco onyx beads. There they are. Six mil. <whistles> Seven meters of black cord. That's never the rain. Oh, gosh. Wow. Bit of light rain. <laughs> black tassel. Oh, my gosh. Which is beautiful. And then black onyx. Yes. The only reason I didn't use the tassel in the kit is because I've already got a marla <laughs> that's black and white that has a black tassel on it. So, so I, I thought, oh, I'm going to have two very similar. So because I'm making them for me, I'm thinking, right, I need, uh, you know, I need one with a, a gem tassel. So sorry, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> it's fine. We'll let you off. <laughs> very defensive there, wasn't she? <laughs> Um, this is the ultimate, and, and, and as Ollie said earlier on, Director Ollie said earlier on, look, when we bring you black and white, we don't want to stand in the way of your creativity. You add whatever you like to Absolutely. this. Absolutely. You can add spacer beads, you can add knots. You'll see a lot of mine, I'll put spacer beads in, but you don't have to. You can knot them, you could add gemstones. All that, all the knot represents is a space between, you have to have a space between the beads. So, a knot obviously makes sense, doesn't cost you anything, but I've put space beads purely for decoration. And I've sort of made mine more decorative. Oh my gosh, that's such a good kit. But there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not a Buddhist or Tibetan monk. 69.99. I'd be using them all up. It's not your price. 
Juzzy, juzzy. Such a good word. <laughs> Juzz. It's a bit like on cheese on toast, bit of Worcestershire sauce. Oh, yeah. Juzz. Juzzy it up. Lovely. Mustard in cheese sauce. Oh, yes, Susie, now you're talking. I, <laughs> I love your work, Susie. As I said, it's always a vision uh, in being warm with people with different settings. Oh. I, I always vision it being warm with, uh, by different people in different, different settings. settings. Oh, yes, thank you. Thank nice. You. I think as well, Susie, you know, this is very much your design, your, yeah. your kind of taste, but it's a commercial style that you've got, yeah, which is exactly. so appealing to so many, yeah. to so many people. Yeah. As you say, different people in different settings. Um, I can't believe I'm about to say this, but your price point today is not 69.99. This is crazy. This is going to fly. This is absolutely flying already. Ready? Steady. 49.99. Just go for it. Yep, just go for it. Branca white onyx, black onyx, and uh, your gorgeous tassel and your and your cord. There you go. Oh my gosh, it's gone nuts. Oh, it's gone nuts. Wow. <gasps> yes, yes, yes. Oh. Well done. This is actually my favourite, and I've it made is a this. beauty. I would have worn it today, only. Obviously, you've got to show it. <laughs> but as you say, what's nice about this is it's not a, it's not that traditional. It's a nod to the traditional mala, but it's, yeah. but it's not a traditional mala. It's your take it's on a mala. It's my take on a mala, and absolutely. that's fine. And this and is, I just want to convey that a, a mala, as you know, is a garland long line necklace. Used for meditation, but you might not want to meditate with it. I don't meditate with all of my malas. That's it. It's a, you can look at it as a mala, you can look at it as a meditative um, aid, or you can look at it just as a lovely long line necklace. And I yeah, love it. Thank you very exactly. much. That, that, that's, yeah. the, that's the great thing. And it's okay for you not to sit yeah. there and meditate. And when we say meditate, we don't mean, you know, yeah, yeah, get, get in the, the yoga position, get the, I mean, the om. things out that. and, you know, all that kind of stuff. Do you know where I meditate? In the bath. Oh, what a lovely thing I to do. I get in the bath and I'm just like, close the world out and then I just, 10 minutes, contemplate life and go oh. through everything and then let it go. Do you know what, if, I, if, I'm, if I'm kind of in the car, I find that, you know, you've been listening to the radio in the car, whatever, and you get back at your house, you turn the engine off and it's just that quiet and you just yeah. go, oh, I'm just going to close my eyes just yeah. for a sec. And it's exactly. just so lovely. Exactly. And we all need to do it. It should be on the National House, as I say. Find yourself, even if it's five minutes, should be sort of, if you so can give nice. yourself 15 minutes, fantastic. But oh, Ollie's just said he does a school run purposefully 10 minutes early every day, just so he can have a little sit yeah. in the car afterwards exactly. and just close his eyes. It's so good, isn't it? <laughs> it's so good. It's great. It's great for your mental health. It so is because, you know, sometimes if you're sort of uh, having a rant about something and someone will say to you, Cut the ties, you know, cut those ties. And then you suddenly think, yes, I've got that off my chest now. I'm happy. Mm. And I'm cutting the ties and bye. And then you feel really better, don't you? Yeah, We've you absolutely, a problem shared is a problem halved. I exactly. think that's always, and that's, that's what, such a good. Giving yourself this time to nice. just de-stress. But what a treat to yourself. Yeah. 49.99 comes to you in a little uh, box as well, which is just great. Absolutely brilliant. There's so many people there. Thank you, Lovey. Uh, which is absolutely brilliant. Well done to everyone coming through. I'm, I'm over the moon for you. Uh, these are Marla kits we've never attempted before. You know, we've done them in lots of different gemstones before, but for the first time ever. Love yeah. Oh, look. Rachel. Who's this message from, Rachel Susie? Rachel Norris. Oh, hi, Rachel. Mm, sending you big hugs in awe of your mates. I had to follow you <laughs> the following day. With an absolutely stunning demo. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> they needed you back. Well, no, you said come back, like Rachel. Rachel all this for you. <laughs> oh, bless oh I watch your show. It's fantastic. Susie is so therapeutic, isn't oh. she? Just, I, it's just. Um, I've gone into Zen mindfulness, making a dream catcher. Love your beautiful oh. models, aren't they beautiful, Rachel? Oh. Thank you so much for getting in touch today, darling. I know yeah, you're so busy. So busy. Um, so nice. And um, yeah, I could listen to Susie all day. Yeah, my husband couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> I just love it. It's great, isn't Switching it? Switching off. <laughs> um, that's really, really, um, that's really lovely. Thank you so much, Rachel, for getting in touch, my love. Uh, well done. This kit is absolutely flying, as you would expect. And the great thing is, I can't wait to see your wall of fame entries. What you're going to be making with these, how you're going to be adding in your own spin. Is it with chain? Is it with other gems? Is it with other colours? What's it going to be? Well done, everybody. Uh, would the onyx work with the earlier neon appetite? Oh, yes. yes. 
<laughs> Absolutely. It'd be beautiful. We haven't got it, but yeah. Yeah, I, definitely. I think we showed it with it. it we did, yeah. Yeah, we Perfect. did. Perfect. Uh, Rachel's an extraordinary human being. I'd love to uh, her to make a dolphin with a kit. Yes, yes, I don't know what she's going to be making with that kit, but I just said oh, dolphin yeah. with the Larimar kit. Well, it's known oh. as the dolphin stone. I think that's maybe why I said yeah. dolphin, but um, yeah. Beautiful. She's pretty amazing, isn't she? Yeah. So, right, demo, yes. Right, wait to down, see this. Lovely. Down to the demo. So, I'm going to show you how to make. Um, a mala with 108 beads. This is a bit of maths, but you, you, it's it's really oh, easy gosh. to remember because you've got 108. Sweaty palms. If you use three malas, which is quite traditional, in other words, three marker beads, you will have four lengths of uh, your normal beads. You will need to do 27. So you'll put your marker bead on and then 27 beads, next marker at 27, next marker at 27. Okay. If you want to use four of the markers to make a four marker mar marla bead, you are going to do four because it's going to be five because you've got four, so it'll be five areas of your other beads, your sort of meditation beads. It'll be 21 uh, here and here, and then the back one that goes around your neck, ah, you'll be doing 24. I see, yeah. So 24. So wherever you start, and I normally start towards the back. So I'm going to be doing a traditional three marker bead, although I'm using four and you'll see why. Um, and I'll show you how I make it. Now, sometimes you can make it so that you tie the end, that you go round the, the marla and you tie the end at the, um, the tassel, which is what I've done, say, here. This is tied here and you can see the knot. But I've recently started doing them so that I'm tying the knot at the back. This is a four marker. Can you see what I mean? Yeah. And this one isn't 108 Bs. That's what I'm saying. It can be anything you like. But with the three marker, you've got one right at the back. And this is where I'm starting. So this is the one right at the back. And this one will sit really at the nape of the neck. So we're going to be doing two um, sets of 27. Now... This thread that you get is absolutely fantastic. It's nicer than the Estron cord. Now, I've used Estron cord before. This is a nylon cord, but it's so soft. It's like silk thread. It's really, really fine. Yeah, it's very, very um, soft, isn't it? I've doubled up because of the size of the drill holes that you get. Because if you're going to knot, if you're not going to knot, I'd still double up. You're going to need to measure out about a meet, two metres, halve it on a needle, Simply just because it's easy to thread through. So you're going to need two metres if you're not going to knot and you're just going to use spacer beads. If you're going to use knotting, which I have and you'll see, you're going to need to use four metres. So you're going to measure out four metres, put your needle through so you've got two metres. Very long, but take your time and um, just... It's not as bad to work with the, that two metre length, but you will need it, otherwise you're going to run out of thread. Nothing worse than running out of thread when you're getting to the last few and thinking, oh, I haven't got enough. So two metres long, doubled up. OK. If you're going to knot it, which I did here, which I've got half left. So I'm doing half here because um, I'm going to be hitting you all the time otherwise. And I'm, I've already half prepared another one. So first thing I've done is I've left a little tail of about four or five inches. Then I've fed on my first marker bead. And here, just because of my design, you don't have to, you could straight into the knotting. I've added um, a little parve because, you know, I like a little bling, but you don't have to. But this is the design I've gone for. And then we're going to start the knotting. So knotting over the hand and through. And I know um, Alison did it yesterday, so it might be a bit of repetition. Then I just fold it out onto the table, then stick a T pin because that's the easiest by far, the easiest. And then just gently tease it onto that. Now we've got double thread, so just take it much more easily than a single thread because you, you, otherwise they'll bunch up. And then when I'm happy with that, and I just thread the, the thread through my hands back to the beginning because you'll be starting with two meters of this and then I start with my first bead. Now I'm using different beads to the kit simply because when you get one kit and you can see that I've used them so I'm trying to do the sort of a Larry Marl-esque version so I've, I've, these happen to be Amazonite and then when I'm happy 
I take out the tea pin and then I push that um, bead onto the knot. Now that one's fairly hidden in that one. So we just continue, as I say, we just go through. And this in itself is very, you know, it's really good for the meditation. I love making malas. Just have some nice chill music on. Don't ever yeah. do this stressed. If you do this, if you're stressed or if you're in a hurry or you're angry about something, your um, thread will not, um, the knots won't go through. Honestly, all things that can go wrong will go wrong. Yeah. And that's your energy coming out in the mala. So you want to be completely at peace. So yeah. happy, happy, happy. Happy. I'm happy. And then when you're happy with that, you just pull the um, T-pin through and just give it a squidge. There we are. I'm going to just do it again because we've got two threads. And you can see how easy it is, even with the two threads. Simple, simple. If you've never pearl knotted, this is how you do it. And we had pearls earlier today uh -huh. and I showed you how to do a very professional beginning and this is all you would do now this is I'm really pleased this happened because this is double thread can you see how that is kinking yeah and if I push that up it's going to kink so all we do is we tease it out see just tease it out da, 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 and there it is easy as that there's no hassle That's to this real. just Really, really easy. Bright and breezy. And, Lovely. Um, you can be, you know, watching a bit of TV. You can, you know, you can, if you've got oh, your Oh, I tell you what I've been listening to. I've been listening to a podcast I've been listening to recently called Dish, which is oh, Angela right. Hartnett and Nick Grimshaw. Oh, uh, right. I love Angela Hartnett. She's an amazing chef. And, and they invite kind of celebrities around and cook for them and stuff. And it's just joyous. It's just happy. People That's just eating and drinking and chatting. That's and it's we just need. We need some happy... Do you know, I won't watch soap operas. And my husband, you know, who it's was... too much. Oh, it's so I mean, it's depressing. Not, I mean, it's not like real life, but it, no. yeah, it is so I don't know, depressing. I wouldn't want to live on the street of EastEnders. There's been so many murders, all Albert sorts of things. Albert Square. I oh, know. <laughs> Old Coronation <laughs> Street. She oh. was... And Emmerdale, wasn't there a oh, plane crash? crash? Something like that. Literally, I just, think, you, know, just you know, unlucky I, people. I like happy programmes, <laughs> so, so keep I. me happy. <laughs> So I won't watch them just for oh, that I'm reason. I'm so glad really. Alison Hammond's going to be a judge on the Bake Off. Uh, going to be a yeah, host on the Bake Off. Yeah, she's lovely, isn't she? Love her. She's so she is just so happy. Lovely. Yeah. yeah, that's what we need. Happiness yep. in our lives. Just think happy thoughts <laughs> all the time. My husband thinks I'm bonkers. If you're watching, I love you, darling. But he does think <laughs> I'm absolutely bonkers. But. <laughs> But you're not going to be, you know, as, as we were saying earlier on, you're not going to be happy all the time, and no. that's okay. Yeah, exactly. But as long as you go into every day with exactly. as positive a mindset as you exactly. possibly can, then that's great. And anything that goes wrong, we've, you know, we've had dishwashers that have gone on the blink, we've had to replace, I've had to replace tyres, all sorts. We've got a oh, leak currently a pot, at the a house. My pothole the other day. Potholes are oh, so no, bad. Oh, no, I minute. know. Ruined your car. Yeah, and the wheels, the wheel uh, bent and, uh, you know, every, all that kind of stuff. So many potholes at the minute. I think because it's the cold weather, cold then weather. very, very wet. Yeah. And it's just brought them all out. Yeah. So, Ugh. you know, everything, you anyway. know, everybody has things that go badly wrong yeah, at the time. Like I say, we've got leak galore at the moment. But... It's just life, and I just think, oh, well. <laughs> there we go. I'm healthy. I'm happy. I've got my husband. I've got my little Tilly. I've got my children. You've got to do it, yeah. That's it. Just look on the bright side. Look on the bright side. And can you see how easy this is? So lovely, Sue. And really therapeutic. And I know they're all gadgets that you can get for your um, sort of pearl knotting. Mm. Right? Um but I tell you what, you can't beat a tea pin. It's tea pins, they always sell out. I mean, Neary, if I ask, if I ask Neary now, he's going to say no. Neary? Neary? He's literally clocked off for the day. Neary. Oh, sorry, I can't hear you. Um, have, we got, have, we, have we got any tea pins? But do you know what? If you haven't... No. If you don't, if you've got any one mil wire, give it a little hammer, cut the end... And then just um, make one of these sort of ends and, and that'll suffice. As Lovely. long as you, you sort of give it a bit of a bang. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, we haven't got any in stock. I'm really sorry. That's about the thickness you want. I know there's not in alls, which are great. And, um, mm. But I just like a tea pin. Yeah, tea pins are great. And you can take it with you. So, look, here we go. This is what I wanted to happen. Can you see that's all getting knotted up? Oh. Well? But just gentle, right. gentle, gentle. Oh, wow. Gorgeous. And it just that. takes it out. And... 
you don't have to worry about anything. And if you, before you take that tea pin out, just remember to be happy with the knot because there's nothing worse than you've done a whole row of beautiful pearl knotting and then you do one and then it's loose. I have got a baggy bit. Yeah. Nobody wants a baggy bit in there. No, um, they pearl don't, knotting. Susie. I definitely don't want a baggy bit. I so got so frustrated with my shoelaces yesterday. I got them into a knot first time oh, no. in years and I got so frustrated and then I just thought, no, calm down. You can make this work. And I just was super, super calm. And it, and it happened. It worked. It was great. But yeah, you can't yeah. do things like this if you're stressed. Exactly. Sure. Yeah. Now, anyway, if let's just imagine that I've now done 27 and yeah. I'm coming to my marker bead. So I'm now doing my knot. As I say, look, it's trying to sort of unfurl because I'm on live TV. But look, you see, I'm, I'm the winner. I'm the boss. It happens. And then on my design, again, I've got um, little... Um, what do you call it? Little rondelles, just as decoration. This one's a slightly different size to the one I began with. I don't know what I've done with the bigger ones. Um, and then here, I'm just literally feeding the whole three through. I'm not knotting in between these. So if you've got a, a spacer, just do that and then take that out and then just push it all along and then carry on. Now, to go to go with all of this gorgeous Marlin-ness, Neary's bought to wear, 240 carats of green angelite, six millimetres, one metre strand of angelite. Wow. Ooh. I cannot, I didn't even know we did a metre long strand of angelite. I cannot think of a more fitting strand. Um, thank you, sweetie. That is, ooh. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, my word. I want to make one. Do you know that. what? If you wanted to wear a mala on your wedding day, this could be the oh, mala. Oh, beautiful, isn't it? Lovely colour, very gentle. And can you see that's a lovely big hug? hug. It's wearing a hug. So yeah, absolutely. Fantastic. You are so right. That is, it is like a cloud. It is. Oh. Do you know what that is? That is, get, that, I tell you what, that is the feeling you get when you get into a freshly made bed with clean, lovely clean sheets. That's the feel of it. It's this gem. Gorgeous. Right. Victoria, Mary, Janice, well done to you. Um, how much is this going to be, Neary? No. Just... Have you... What is wrong? Have you been drinking in there? What's going on with them today? I don't know what, just, just They're about chilling. had enough of them. $24.99, you've got to be kidding me. Oh gosh, that is amazing. Susan, Victoria's got two. Janice, uh, Alison, Maker, 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 June, Mary Ann, Mary, Victoria, Bake. Oh my gosh, it's gone completely bonkers. A meter of angelite. And do you know what? If Susie wasn't kind of doing a demo right now in the middle of making a mala, she would be... Oh, absolutely. I'm going, I've got to because I love it. I have to really say as well, like... um, I would love, hmm, I'd love to see this with Tanzanite. Yes. I'd love to see this with um, the Larimar as well. We showed it with the Larimar earlier on. I agree with Susie. I'm not a glass half full or glass half empty. I'm just happy to have a glass. Yes. That is Villa in Bosch, naturally. Oh, I love that. <laughs> as long as it's crystal, darling. Um, brilliant show, ladies. Susie, your designs are beautiful. Please, could you tell me how to add the tassel? Love yes. Nicole. Yes. Thank you. You have preempted my go. mouth. Uh, that my strand is demo. delicious. I know. I want to eat it. Right. The angel like with the Branca Onyx. Yes, Gloria. So. Yes. Back to the demo. Come on, Susie. Just pretend. Sorry, I'll just put that there. That's okay. Just pretend I've now done the whole side. I've done 27 of these. That doesn't look like 27, but let's pretend it's 27. Yeah, let's pretend. I've put on the marker bead and I've now done 27. Now, obviously, that would take well me a long done. time. Well done. Congratulations. So, here we go. So, I'm, there you go. That's what it looks like oh. in reality. Okay? Perfect. On this design. Now, when I get to that last bead, my 27th, because I'm now going to go through my tassel, which I've lost, here for my design, but you don't have to, you can just forget this tiny bit, just for the design. And can you see, can you see how long my thread is? 
Gosh, that's yeah. very long thread. See, because I I've, I've still need two metres of that to go around the other side. So I had four metres of this to begin Wowzers. with. Um, for my design here, I've then put a little spacer. I've put a little four mil. Again, you don't have to. Then I'm going to put a spacer. Then I'm using my other guru because this design is... Um, oh, Annette. Sorry. For um, three. Annette said, I started making my first knotted mala, but only have seven beads before a larger one. Can this be a mala or do I have to start again? You don't need to start again. No, you don't have to if start you, again. If you were making a traditional Buddhist mala, then, then yeah, you might want to rethink the design. Yeah. But you're inspired by the mala. A ma this is your mala, exactly. your personal mala. You do what? Ever you want, collector in London. Um, You're Annette, wearing it. Don't worry, sweetheart. Honestly, there are no rules. There are no rules. There are no rules to make an amala. And as you said, mala just translates as garland. Garland. That's in it. In other words, a loop. A loop. That's it. That's 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 the takeaway. It can be whatever you want it to be, my lovely. Right. Okay. I'm really so, worried. We're going to run out of time soon. Right. No, we're getting there. We're nearly finished. So okay, then I've on. put a tassel cap on. Again, you don't have to. This is where I've now got to where I've got my tassel so I'm going to add my tassel straight away right here and then then I'm going to feed the thread back through the uh, tassel cap if you've got one great if you haven't doesn't matter and then through uh, my little rondelle again this is part of my pattern but again you don't have to and then through the bead making sure you don't capture the um, thread and then through that one there meter of gold sewn on screen seven seven ninety nine that's a that's that's right. disgusting that price now, here we go right yes and here we go can you see all those components are on and now we have to get them to come together so this is two minutes right here we go let's pull it through Pull through, pull this is through. amazing, Susie. But because you've got two metres, actually, it takes a bit of time. But You're watching a master at work yes. here. You're pulling it through. What you don't want is it to get tangled work it, up. Work it, though, the... You know. been... So I'm going to do it slowly, 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 slowly. Slowly, slowly. Right. Pull it through, pull it through, pull it through, pull it through, pull it through. No. It's because it's a Susie demo, it's bound not to want to happen, but we are, that's 90 seconds. <laughs> 90 seconds, can you? But can you see, this you're, you're pushing it through because, yeah. yeah. So we're pushing all of this through. Look at this. Because you're rushing <laughs> now. That's yeah. why it's getting all. Yeah, this is what out. I'm saying. When you Don't when you rush. you stress and you think, oh, it's not going to go Susie, through. Honestly, Susie, it really doesn't matter if you but finish you're, it or you're not. You're just sweetie. talk through it if it you through. want, Levy. So once you've pulled it all through, yeah, which we will do that. Just. Let's pretend it's all pulled. Yeah, come on. <laughs> We've pulled it I, I through. Don't, I don't want to stress you out, darling. <laughs> We've pulled it through. Right, and then it all goes like that. Let's get one that works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. It's going so well. But here we go. Oh, God, well, I did earlier. I went through. Oh, look at back. that. It comes through and it all pulls out. And then you just start again, going round, 27. That's why you need yeah. the four metres to work with. That's right. And this is what I say. Don't ever do it stressed because it'll go happens. like this. So I'll sort this out. Susie Menham, you're an absolute legend. <laughs> it had to go wrong. Ooh, it had ooh, to ooh, be ooh, me ooh, 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 ooh. who went wrong. We love her. Uh, right. Do not go anywhere. You have got, you've been amazing. Love you, darling. Thank you for today's show. That's been absolutely brilliant. We will see you the other side of this. You've got an amazing afternoon with um, Dave on Hobby Maker. We'll see you after the break. See you in a bit, guys. Mm -hmm.